in full blown sad mode, guys. <laughs> it's Saturday morning and I feel too sad for this. <laughs> the song hits so hard. Jack, welcome back in. Darpass, hi. Kobe, hi. Thess, welcome back in. The song is so good. I had to play it. That's why I was a little bit late. I was like, Bert, what if I played it on the intro? Can we meet in the middle, man? Like, I need to play this song. So sorry for the couple minutes late, but I think it was worth it to be able to play that song and get in our feels, but happy Catterday, yes. New intro music, what is this? Probably for today and tomorrow to kind of finish up Cyberpunk and then we'll be back to Country Roads. You miss Country Roads already, yeah? Killer Fish, welcome back in Handsome Caboose Hive. Did you say Vert will survive, but will, yeah, Vert will suffer later. Absolutely, absolutely. Thess, welcome back in, happy Saturday. Yes, I did survive, I came back, I, Kind of. I didn't actually go get Taco Bell or drown myself in pizza or anything. I just ate my meal prep and I went to bed early. Like I took a shower, actually had my nice shower beer, and then I went to bed early. <laughs> I just said it was a good day. Like I wasn't as sad. Lots of shower beers. One shower beer and kind of like a moment to just be like, damn, that was a really good DLC. Like that was really good. How was the shower cry always? You have to occasionally just have a good shower cry to get like reconnected with your feelings, you know? Tomorrow is Pon Pon intro, right? No, never. There's two days left of Pon Pon and I am living for every moment of it. Grim, welcome back in as well. Did you, wait, wait. I rewatched what you did last night in Night City, mind blown. Yeah. It was not easy, that's for sure. I haven't played Phantom Liberty, so I'm avoiding the stream. Absolutely, no worries, no worries. We'll not talk about it too, too much, don't worry. I didn't realize. I actually hadn't realized that. As I was, I hadn't realized that Anna hadn't played uh, Phantom Liberty, so I messaged her and I was like, did you pick so-and-so or so-and-so? And she was like, I haven't played Phantom Liberty. And I was like, no, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's not like, you know, it's, yeah, it'll be fine, it'll be fine. She spoiled things for me. For the record, B-dubs. <laughs> for the record, she has spoiled a lot for me before too. Bear with the gifted sub to platform shoes. Anon with all of these gifted subs. Anon, thank you so much. And Lord, Lord Porg, welcome back in and thank you for the 100 bits as well. Anon with the gifted subs to A's, to Zidzo, Kobe, Isa, and also Thundercrack. Thank you for two months of continual support as well. Oh yeah, the DLC was amazing. Hawkeye, I was wondering, I was like, we haven't seen you in a little bit. So I hope you've been doing well. Yeah, we are entering the last two days. You are good. Mm -hmm. I would say you're good to come back. If you don't mind get it, Ugh, there's some side missions we're doing at the beginning. I would say if you come back at 12, we should be done with all the DLC side missions and then we'll be on to, um, then we'll be on to everything that's related to like main game. And Hawkeye, thank you so much for the five gifted subs to the channel and community too. Thank you. Yeah, I was like, we haven't seen you in a little bit. Um, yeah, I would say, I think it will take me about two, maybe one o'clock to be safe. You can always pop back in and be like, hey, are we still on DLC? But yeah, we are finishing up a couple, two gigs and two side missions. Yeah, two side missions as well. But I will say like, I still feel like I'm just reeling from it all. I think from just dissecting all of the parts about it and my choices. And so I do hope that maybe doing the different outcome will bring me a little bit more uh, peace and kind of, I, I definitely don't regret the choices I made at all. I stand by them fully, but I am interested to see what would happen if I went the other way. I think I'm just like the curiosity is getting the cat, you know? And Fox, thank you for the follow. And Anon, thank you for the gifted sub to Droopy. Droopy, welcome back in. And YouTube, thank you for eight months of continual support. I will say that I ended up making myself feel better by going and diving into Gold Saucer. To defend her Master family. Da Vinci. Master Da Vinci also with three gifted subs to the channel and community. Yeah, I dove back into the gold saucer and just kind of did some chocobo racing to make myself feel a little bit better. And prove in fact, it does actually make you feel better. Just doing chocobo racing will in fact make your day a million times better. 
Vichy, welcome back in. Mood Man, hello. Did I see a side beard as well? McBuzzin, welcome back in. Jasmine, hi. Master Da Vinci and Hawkeye. Guys, thank you for all of the gifted subs. And YouTube, thank you for eight months of continual support as well. The Gold Saucer has so much. I thought I was going to be able to complete it all. But it's just, you would have like death by mini games. You have to like do it in pieces. I couldn't just do one giant arcade game night as much as I wanted to. And Sergio, welcome back in Crate. No spoilers for people late to catching up, hopefully. Um, I mean, obviously if people come in and ask what ending I chose, I'm, I'm absolutely gonna answer that and have that transparency um, if they know that I completed it. But for the most part, there shouldn't be too, too many spoilers. Death by minigames doesn't sound too bad. It doesn't sound too bad for me either. It's more death by side missions that usually gets me. Also, Soup, hi. Soup, welcome back in. Handsome Caboose, I see. Voldemort, hi. Joel, hi. Killerfish, Beatubs is here. Faust, Faust, I see as well. TJ, hi. No boundaries. It is the perfect, like, rainy day to also just dive into everything the rest of Cyberpunk has to offer us. I actually feel like I need to go grab, actually, I have a straw right here. I'm going to use the straw for my AG1 greens. Rise of Ronin for me today. What is that? Wait, what is that? I feel like I should know this. Uh, almost spoiling stuff for Anna. I would say almost. I just kind of went in and asked her who did she choose. But to be fair, to be fair, I will not... I'll never say what she spoiled me on, but we had a hard, hard spoiler, heart to heart moment. But I will say that Anna is the sweetest person in the entire world because she's like, I would, she always says, she's like, I would never forgive myself if I spoiled you on any story because that is just such a big reason that her and I connect is our mutual love an emotional connection for games so she'd never want to take that away from me and vice versa i truly thought she had played phantom liberty but i guess it makes sense because i think she did her i think she did cyberpunk for herself she never streamed cyberpunk and then phantom liberty obviously came out more recently uh ninja games came out on ps5 the ninja games if she doesn't know the characters, it'll probably slip her mind. Absolutely. Oh, absolutely. Especially right now. She's in the like throes of moving. She's got like a million jobs going on. Like, I cannot tell you guys how hard that girl is working right now to just keep everything afloat. Like it's, I, I don't know how she does it. She's got all these things happening right now. Knack, Knack, welcome back in. I hope my neck feels a little bit better. I did not sleep well at all last night. So I probably have bags under my eyes. I felt like I woke up like every single hour. Uh, Ginger walked all over my body, meowing left and right. She had water. She had food. She just simply wanted attention at three in the morning. And it just sometimes happens like that. Perfect film or gaming day. Salt. Yes, exactly. It's raining like crazy here in, in NY. Oh, in New York. Wait, that's awesome. I've been talking about, I've been talking to my friends about doing a New York trip for a while now. Ginger was worried you went to bed early. I really did. Guys, I hopped off. I went and grabbed a course and then I went in the shower and I just like, decompressed for a second <laughs> it's so true and then I fell asleep early and she doesn't like normally mind if I go to sleep early but I think if I go to sleep earlier she thinks I'm gonna wake up earlier and then she thinks she gets fed earlier she's just always long story short trying to get more food rocker Michael and also Rando and uh, Iagos I'm not saying this right at all but thank you guys for the follows and Darth Energy thank you for 16 months of continual support as well my hair is still drying so it's a little wet it's like a wet stringy mess right now uh New York trip is always a good time especially during the spring yeah I haven't been back in many many years and as much as I love going to I mean you guys know I love going to the theater so it'd be it'd be fun to go to New York City I think New York City with Jess and Anna would be a hoot you know so early streams today. I oh TRD, you have been here long enough to know. You guys have been here long enough to know that Saturdays are meant for early stream days. Y'all should just be happy that I don't do super early Sunday stream days too. So there's a dog adoption event tomorrow, and my girlfriend isn't here to tell me no, Shroopy. <laughs> Please come back in tomorrow and tell us if you do Darpaz. London. Y'all are trying to save this hype train. It's okay. We don't have to have a hype train every start. This isn't like me going to the bathroom. This is not the status quo. Also, Redhawk, thank you for 15 months of continual support as well. Ungers, thank you for the follow. London and Darpass. Guys, the thank you for 10 gifted subs to the channel and community and keeping this scam dream alive. No. Dude, <laughs> I hate you so much. 
I hate more than anything. Oh my gosh. I hate more than anything that I was going back to find an old picture and I came across BTS of that situation. My friend had taken a couple videos that I didn't realize. And so I have behind the scenes from that day and I just saw it this morning. I <laughs> Bear. Frozen. I don't know. Maybe we'll unlock one video on my birthday. I never know whether to applaud Bear or wait or what or curse him. <laughs> Bear and Frozen, thank you for the five gifted subs. TJ, y'all know my defenses are completely down for this weekend and. TJ, thank you for 10 more gifted subs to the channel and community and bear cursing 50 more people with that horrifying, you know, if some of those people knew that that is how they were getting gifted a sub, I'm sure they would return it if they could. Anna said in my chat today that she is blocking you. Did she really? Because I spoiled something? R. Kelly. Kelly, I feel like I haven't seen you in a couple streams either. I was thinking about that the other day. Kelly, thank you for 10 gifted subs as well and Y'all, I'm just messing with you. Okay, I was like, what? She had time to message her mods today? Oh my. Camposaurus Rex. <laughs> Kelly. Do you see what you guys started? This started as Darpass in London just trying to keep this hype train alive. Bear exploiting this opportunity to curse 50 people. And now, oh my gosh. I cannot, I still want to be Bob. Camposaurus, thank you for 10 more gifted subs to the channel and community. R. Kelly. TJ. No! I cannot believe you guys could be doing pawn pawns and you're choosing to curse me with Cat Game of Thrones. ZD's welcome back in. Release the footage. We need more people to defend Millie. Is that what happens? Is it an automatic? If you have a gifted sub, do not. If you have an automatic gifted sub, you have to defend Millie. No! <laughs> no! Dishonor to you, dishonor to your cow, dishonor. I swear. Lucky or thank you for the 400 bits. Andrea, welcome back in. Curdle the turtle, welcome back in. Cobra, hi. Zibit, hi. Bunny, welcome back in. Extended version of the, oh my. <laughs> I'm gonna die. I'm just gonna. Do not cat bob to this. Let me tell you, you guys plague. Huh? I'm so <laughs> Handsome caboose, this has always been a thing. Like that's the... Pon Pon and Cat Game of Thrones are out. They're both out. They're both out. So we're keeping Pon Pon and deleting Cat Game of Thrones instead. I'm going insane. No, not Cat Game of Thrones, please. Who is playing it now? Why is there a level eight hype train off of this? This is going to be like the Cat Game of Thrones a thon from. The <sighs> what is it? Hot D coming back? Pon Pon can uh, can into evil cast origin story. This is fine. Oh, thank I'm goodness. Okay with the events that are unfolding. Currently. Zippy, Zippy, thank you for 29 months of continual support, and it's your three as well. And welcome back in, Anon, with all the gifted subs. Rage and thank you, Curry and Leg guys. Thank you for the follows. Welcome into the insanity. Um, there was a time. No, no, no. That is the whole thing. Is Cat Game of Thrones was the original 
like pawn pawn annoyance. There was a time during Survivor where the community banded together and had this play for no kidding. Yop, get out of here. <laughs> that was back when I raised it to 2000 bits. It was not always 2000 bits. I think it even used to be 100 bits at one point in time. I raised it to 2000 bits because you guys were exploiting it and just completely driving me insane with it. It was 5,000 bits at that point. At one point it was 5,000 bits. I think it was 5,000 bits. Was it 5,000 bits when we did? I was playing Jedi Survivor and it legitimately played for 15 minutes and I've never felt more like I, I just, I think it was the highest hype train I had ever had because of a cat Game of Thrones and it truly just broke me. I played it for at least 10 minutes straight. I. <laughs> I have no words. And Boston, Boston, thank you for 10 months again. No. Dude. Oh my God. Hawkeye. Hawkeye? Communities who troll together stay together. Lamaletto? Lamaletto, I never thought you would resort to this. <laughs> Hawkeye, thank you so much for 50 gifted subs to the channel and community. You guys are converting innocence. I swear indoctrination occurs once a stream, somebody new falls. I cannot believe you guys. You, how you, are. you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. You really can't be here without. Part of the ship, Hawkeye. Thank you so much, you guys. I can't play. I can't get even closer to finishing. I'm not going to finish Cyberpunk at this rate. That dude, Vinny, welcome in. Rob, thank you. Leto is full revolting. Oh, it should have kept on going down that You guys way. have conformed you fully. <laughs> you guys are crazy. Victor, thank you for the follow. Rob, thank you for 10 months. I'm trapped, but Alien makes it all worthwhile. <laughs> it makes it all worthwhile. We need an actual animated alien emote. Chuck, thank you for the follow. Why do I always think Chuck? I always think like Serena wound. saying Chuck. Uh, indoctrinated fully. Jesper, welcome back in. The curse continues. Hawk cursing 10 more people with the gifted sub. Being new and all, I kind of enjoy the theme playing constantly. That's not the theme. That's not the theme. Senin, y'all are going to drive me insane. The fact that you guys could think that, no! <laughs> no! Don't worry, Casta. I was a troll already before I found your channel. <laughs> You're just like, oh, nice. I'm not alone here. I found company. I swear. I built the ship. I'm I'm steering the ship straight off the uh, edge of the world. We are going full Pirates of the Caribbean. Mm. Not happening. Also, YOLO, welcome in. Yop. With five more gifted subs to the channel and community. Cat Game Thrones is not the theme song. Pawn Pawn is not the theme song. Country Roads is the theme song. Shadow. I am going to feed you to the unknown. Mark my words, the next time we play DBD, I will let you die on that hook. There is not a single non-sub left in chat. Between Anon, between all of you guys, Stewie, thank you for the follow. No! Denny and Stewie, guys, thank you for the follows. Jams, hold on. My now my now my family's calling me. Uh, 
What do you do? Oh my gosh, Michael! Also a thing, a new thing. And Denny and Stewie, guys, thank you for the follows. Michael, with the 2,000 bits that you could have played on Cat Game of Thrones, so I appreciate that. I woke up and chose violence? I woke up and chose violence? What? How? This is like a, I, I came on here with a great attitude. I was like, I'm so excited to stream today. It's gonna be a good day. And you guys have now claimed that things are theme songs that they're not. You've converted, I wouldn't even say you've converted a troll. You've just made a troll step out from the shadows. It's like, I did fro him. You woke up and chose violence. A new thing, Anon with the gifted sub to Pon Pon and Spazzy. Cat Game of Thrones 2 for the outro. I will point out the insipid tears have stopped. That is true. So. No boundaries. The blue, some blue thing crawled out of my dryer. <laughs> Y'all with a level nine hype train off of Pon Pon's blue knees. <laughs> Some blue thing crawled out of my dryer. Stop. <laughs> you see what you guys do? No boundaries. No boundaries with five gifted subs and also Arnie. Y'all are infectious. Look at this. It's spreading. There is something in the water in this stream. Oh my gosh. Another successful pawn pawn times cat game of thrones hour. I cannot believe you guys. <laughs> I can't. Also, Kasib, thank you for the resub for two months in a row. Casper, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. Gino, welcome back in. Jesper, get back here. Wreck it, welcome back in. Robbie, I. The other Phantom Liberty ending tomorrow? Possibly. If we have enough time, I think I'd like to do it tomorrow. That way I can fully say goodbye to Cyberpunk for, for at least a little bit, like a little bit of time. No boundaries, thank you so much. And Rusty, thank you for 16 months of continual support as well. Holy cow. Gino, Gino with the half a year too. What I was gonna tell you guys is y'all have completely ruined Meow Meows because I'm sitting there playing Final Fantasy and Kate goes, meow, 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 meow. And all I can think of is like, oh, another, another cat thing for them to exploit. Oh, of course, here we go. I can't even enjoy Kate's dialogue anymore because of you guys. You have ruined Meows. But it's Scottish. It's Scottish this time. You know, for a second, I had to really debate if uh, if Kate was Scottish or Irish. And then what did he say? Uh, he said something. I was like, oh, that's for sure Scottish. But it took me a second. Ah! But it definitely took me a second. Mm. Yeehaw! I'm a cowboy! I don't want to spoil it. I'm not going to say who it is. Mm-hmm. Also, Tiny, welcome in and thank you for the follow. Mm-hmm. No, they're not Reese's eggs. Guys, I've been obsessed with them. They're like unreals. I don't know. They don't have like, I love Almond Joys because they do have the almond, but they're basically like an Almond Joy without the almond. So they're just joy. Ah, they're just joy. Mm-hmm. But you get chocolate all over. And just like, I love coconut. My favorite kind of cake is coconut cake. Kate Sith is Scottish. Mm -hmm. um, I did, in fact, look it up later. I was like, no, 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 I'm pretty. It's just straight joy. <laughs> um, yeah, I ended up looking it up because I was pretty sure I was pretty sure he was Scottish. And then they're just mounds, not almond joy. Wait, I'm thinking of mounds. What are almond joys then? Wait a minute. They're just mounds then. Wait a minute. What's the difference between a mound and an almond joy? I'm thinking about buying test cyberpunk. Is it worth it? <sighs> Let me just say that a week ago, I said that it was my top 20 games. Last night, it became my top 10 games. And so I played a lot of games, like just a couple, just a few. The Almond. The Mound is the Almond. 
Right. You think Meow is your ally? You merely adopted the Meow. I was born in it, molded by it. Top 10 of an unlisted... Ask me to list all top 10. I won't do it. I can't do it. If you want depression, then yes. No, if you want a beautiful story, um, I think there is something to relate to in, every, in, in at least one part of the game, in some kind of aspect of the game. I think that it is a a uh, beautiful disaster and a dark twisted story but it also helps you feel the reality that there are very few black and white i i think choices in life there's a lot of gray area and i i liked that aspect of it i really did yeah post phantom liberty the game bullied you into my day bullied its way into my top 10. <laughs> It's true. Do video game series count as one game? I would count them as one game. Personally, for my list, I would count them as one game. I think Mounds has dark chocolate as well. Um enjoys the milk chocolate. So yeah, it would be a mound then. You're right, because it's dark chocolate and coconut. I prefer dark chocolate, like usually like 85% or higher. But I really want to stay at your house. It's different after watching the Edge Runners. Yes, absolutely. You know, I thought about it a lot. Um, Kane, thank you for 15 months as well. And just real quick, before we talk about the game and get started and get into it, um, thank you guys so much for all, all of the trolling and all of the gifted subs. Um, I know it just comes from the most generous place in your heart possible. And I, I wouldn't have it any other way. And so thank you guys for everything and for always ensuring people feel welcomed and really just wrap them up in love when they come into the channel. It is absolutely infectious and you guys spread joy like near and far across the board. The song is sad and beautiful. Oh, absolutely. I played your ending second, so I don't think it hit as hard as Reed's side. But I think I appreciated it more watching your playthrough through it. Interesting. Locked. Thank you for sharing that perspective, by the way. Yeah, I was going to say that... I think... I do, I do attribute a lot of my choices based off of her name and, oh, if you guys do not want Phantom Liberty spoilers, I would probably, I would skedaddle for now. I am doing a couple more DLCs. I'm going to talk about my decisions from yesterday real quick, and then we're probably going to get back to main mission kind of progression at around 1 p.m. Eastern. So in about two and a half hours, I'd say two and a half to three hours. So just real quick, I would just skedaddle if you don't want spoilers, but hold on. I know. I know. I'm still in my seat. Don't even start. I'm still in my seat. I'm still in. <laughs> All right. Uh, not intentional. If it was for him, not intentional. Yeah. Um, duck out for the next like five minutes while we talk about this. All right. Go, 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 go. Look, 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 look. Mojo, enjoy the lurk as well. Um, my allergies. I know my allergies have been killing me my whole life. Alvin and also Meister. Guys, thank you for the follows and outer. Thank you for the hydrate. Uh, Yeah, I, I was thinking about it a lot and I guess I stuck to my guns and I think I chose what I chose because there was a part of me that really wanted somebody to escape all of it. Spoiler time, yes, thank you. Thanks for pinning that dark pass. Um, I think I really wanted somebody to get away from all of this. Uh, just Night City from FIA, from all of it. And I guess... I had put my freedom and my life almost living vicariously through hers. Like, I guess I had kind of come to terms that I w am probably going to die at the end of this. And so I just wanted somebody else to live on and have an opportunity that I might not be afforded. And so I think that is why I stuck with sending her where I sent her and why I picked her to begin with is because I just wanted to free somebody from what we're going through and I didn't want to condemn another person to being trapped as I've felt trapped with Johnny and everything that's happened to us. I saw the alternative ending and it hit like a truck. I think there would have been tears either way. Yeah. Yeah. I know it's going to hit hard too when we go back and play his ending as well. Are you going to attempt every ending? Not every ending, but I'm going to see by picking. I am going to go for picking read this next go and then see which ending I get. I think you guys said that there's about four different endings. Um, so I want to see which one I, I naturally go with. Yeah, Jadev, I, uh, for anybody who is popping back in and didn't get to see yesterday, I, I stuck with my decision to stand by Songbird's side until the very end, including killing Reed to get her to have her free, her free ending, to free her. 
Alex, welcome in. I turned her in. Calvin, again, thank you so much. And Outer, I already did hydrate. And Anon, thank you for two gifted subs to the channel and community as well. Uh, I will say for anybody who did pick that ending as well, did the did the show have anything to do with that with you guys? We're all going through something these days, you know? Oh, absolutely, Gino. It's a good way to go about the ending. Yeah, I never thought that I was going to get out alive with choosing her. I never thought that there was actually an ending where I would have made it. I made the same choices as you in the DLC and also just made the call based on a gut feeling. There is this like, there, yeah. I, I think I was struggling really hard with thinking she was going to betray me, but sometimes... Um, I don't know. I guess I felt like I was being manipulated by her and I think I knew it, but I didn't care. And that's such a weird feeling to know that somebody's using you, but you don't mind. It probably is a little messed up. There's a little bit of toxicity there probably, but I think I knew that she was using me because she was trying to acquire a better life. You know, I, I don't know. There's so much there to dissect. Jake, welcome in and thank you for the follow. Mm-hmm. Well, the interesting thing is, <laughs> you say it depends on how much you care about the person. I didn't really care about either of them too, too much. I felt like I barely really knew both of them. But I guess there was a part of me that felt like, I don't know, I guess there was a part of me that felt like I related more to Songbird than to Reed. Reed is very, um, I think I would describe him, I think a good word would be dogmatic. I feel like he is very, like, he really sticks to, he has, like, his code, he has his rules, and he, yeah, Reed is very dead. <laughs> okay, well, now he is. He's very much, like, set in, I mean, even till the very end. I, I talked about it, stoic, dogmatic, idealist, yeah. I feel like I talked about it at the very end that, I do wish that there was an ending where he, maybe there is, maybe there is, to be fair. Um, and maybe when we choose to go with him, he can have a redemption arc with Songbird, possibly. Hopefully, we'll see. No, that would be too happy of an ending. But I guess I kept wishing that he maybe was going to throw everything to the side. But that would be asking him to be not who he is, you know? And so that's very doubtful that there is even an outcome like that. Also, TK, thank you for the follow. And Anon, thank you for the gift of sub to Calder. Goro, blinded by principles. <coughs> and the thing is about it too is I don't blame him because I do think he is a little bit of a product of his upbringing and that's a lot of what he's known. I'm choking on these coconut flakes. I'd probably have chosen Sogburn if I hadn't taken the oath at the beginning of the DLC. This is interesting. A couple of you guys asked about that. If, if me taking the oath would have changed things. There's a lot of unknowns at the very start. I regret taking the oath without enough information, but not following through once I did. Did anybody take the oath, but then choose Songbird in the end? I watched the show after Phantom Liberty. Another thought I wanted to share is that I liked that for Songbird, the last important thing was to confess to you. That took a lot of guts, guys. That did. And that wasn't, I mean, I don't think that was even just because she thought she was dying. She still could have gone to the moon having tricked us and never given us the resolution or the knowledge that she wasn't going to come back to us. I didn't take the oath. You did. You did take the oath, but you still chose Songbird. That says a lot about your character, Spazzy. That's really interesting. Like in a good way. Amish. Amish. Edge Runners was a separate story to me and didn't affect my decisions. Interesting. I think Edge Runners, Amish, thank you so much for 10 gifted subs to the channel and community as well. You guys, thank you. Um, I think, I think the parts of Edge Runners that did impact me is there is this romanticism associated with the moon, going to the moon in the realm of cyberpunk was then forever like this romantic thing to me, I guess. It just kind of became the idea or what I created in my mind as happiness or bliss or freedom for people that, um, for people that lived in this world, I guess it kind of represented a lot of, a lot of different things. And so I brought that into the game, which is the only thing that I would say that I wonder if that would have, 
I wonder if I would have chosen differently had I not watched Ed Run Edge Runners ahead of time. Depends on how much you care for Songbird. Yeah, and I just wish I cared for both of them a little bit more, maybe. I was actually surprised I didn't cry when I shot Reed, um, despite maybe wishing that I had spent more time or thought that through a little bit easier. It was the same final that she chose. Why erase? It was the same final that she chose. What do you mean? Tida, Tida, Tida? Astronauts say they view Earth differently after they went to space and see the whole Earth. I'm sure. I'm sure. I was very anti-Nusa from the beginning, from the get-go. Yeah. Always seemed like a better choice for that, too. Um, it's interesting. I, I don't think I... I don't know how much Nusa played a part in my decision as much as uh, thinking about how it felt to be them within the FIA. Obviously, the FIA falls under it. But I think that even even seeing President Meyer's true colors, it it didn't change a lot for me. Like I, I guess there was a part of me that maybe expected it, not expected. It still took me by surprise. But I wasn't really that shocked at the same time that there was a betrayal happening. There were like multiple betrayals, you know. I also played that gut wrenching ending. The song afterwards makes it worse. Bunt cake, by the way, and digital guys. Thank you for the follow and Amish. Happy Saturday. Thank you so much. I felt very exploited by Songbird and the president, and it didn't make me feel like a coincidence. So I didn't want to take an oath. I felt like a puppet the whole way through. It's it's um, it's so interesting. Uh, I remember somebody asked if taking the oath, or I think just my experience with Reed and Songbird was changed by my own military experience. And for some reason, I guess it just felt, it didn't feel right to take the oath. I, I don't know. I just remember looking back on that scene and I guess I thought it was a little bit of like a, it was kind of made of like a mockery of it in a way. And so it just didn't feel like a legitimate process anyway. It didn't feel like the same way, like, I, you know, as when like I took my oath into the Air Force or stuff like that. Um, I guess like I did look at the oath a little bit differently, maybe because of my own choices that I've made in my life. It's also poetic and tragic. Yeah. I got a game over the last read standoff thinking that I could save both, but I couldn't commit to betraying Songbird at that point. And I, I actually, this was the first time in a long time, but I didn't think I was going to be able to save both. A lot of times I do try to get the best outcome, which will be often like keeping both people like parties alive, but I just didn't think that it was going to be possible. Our oaths. Farce, farce. Thank you for the follow. I can't force myself to take that oath. Um, it didn't quite feel right. I think when I look back on that choice, I think I started to. And then Johnny had said something and I was like, honestly, I felt like taking that oath was making a mockery of it because there were other people that became FI agents or like trained for it or like my getting initiated into the FIA just didn't feel legitimate i never felt like i was a part of the team as much as they tried to make it seem like that mm -hmm. dlc in a nutshell the spy game is messy and if you're more than likely going to get played by someone i also love alex i think alex's character is actually fantastic even to the end like what we got to see yesterday uh-huh david welcome back in and srujan welcome back in too it is really difficult having to end Reed's life, but I also am kind of proud of myself because I do think that a lot of times I let biases kind of impact my playthroughs and the fact that Idris played him, I recognized that that was something that was I was having to fight the whole time of not wanting to be like drawn more towards him. And so I really tried to detach from kind of having exemptions or maybe giving him the benefit of the doubt because of the actor that plays him, not because of Reed. Like I had to look at it as like two separate people, Bear and also Maple, guys. Thank you for the follows. All right. Well, are you guys ready to get back in to Night City? It's such a shame though, because Myers is very charming. Oh, absolutely. But some of the most, oh yeah, but charming and manipulative go together actually more often than you, than you think. Like some of the most manipulative people are incredibly charming and absolute silver tongues. Oh, for sure. Isn't it weird how we react to the Netrunner siblings getting executed? Meanwhile, we probably have thousands of kills under our belt. Absolutely, Alex. Oh, for sure. But that's like games. That's, um, I had tried to kind of describe this to I know that it's not like it's kind of like apples and oranges but I find that the gray area of this game is almost like revered and in like you you like it 
more than maybe sometimes like in other games I was thinking about for some reason like me enjoying how divisive this game was felt similar to I remember how I felt with Last of Us 2 Last of Us 2 gets like a lot of crap because it explores another person's perspective and I found that it was interesting how we embrace this gray area, but then we're so quick to condemn another, like another game that explores that kind of gray area as well. And it's so easy to be like, I despise it because somebody I liked uh, gets killed or something, you know, like it's almost like we romanticized Joel, I think, and made him out to be more of a hero than he is. When in reality, like he killed so many people, like he's not done exactly. Like, he's not an extraordinary person. Like, he's done extraordinary things, but he's also done horrendous things, too. I give Last of Us 2 crap, not for giving the player a choice at the end. And yeah, and if you like choice-based games, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, Last of Us 2 is a complex topic, absolutely. Mm-hmm. Mikey! <laughs> Nobody is a good person in Last of Us 2, but I, I... Yeah, in Last of Us, but I just think it's easier to somehow attach yourself to that to thinking that there's a good versus like evil side with Abby and everything. Yeah. Jargon, welcome back in. Yeah, yeah. Big Tim, thank you for 20 months of continual support. And Ty, thank you for 31 months as well. Holy cow, over almost two years, Big Tim, and almost on our way to three years, Ty. Ty, thank you so much. Yeah, and the pacing felt really weird. That's interesting. I never thought that the pacing felt off. I don't think. It's been a while since I played it, to be fair. Mm -hmm. We learned that he's also not a fan of golf. That's true. The doctors had no idea what they were doing. <clears throat> yeah, I didn't mean to kind of like cause this whole... I, didn't, I don't want this to like completely turn into a different conversation, but I guess I was thinking about that a lot in my post completion of the DLC is how it's easier to attach ourselves to some games and the different perspectives they show versus others. I went through a rabbit hole of watching cyberpunk lore videos and the amount of things that connected together was mind blowing. I've heard that with the NCPD missions and like all of the stuff, all of the little uh, shards that you read, like they really do connect from one to another. Like the, the lore is thick. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. If we were Abby in part one, we would have hated Ellie and Joel. Exactly, exactly. I wonder what games, what playing the cyberpunk tabletop game is like. Oh, that's true. That's true. That'd be kind of interesting to try. Also, members, welcome back in and not not welcome in. Cyberpunk Edge Runner show was amazing. I absolutely agree. All right, we are gonna get started. I try not to talk about Last of Us in general. People get really heated about it. Just different opinions, which I welcome. I also don't like to start like a full out brawl on on stream, but I I see kind of both sides. There were elements that absolutely ripped my heart out if, with that, but I've always talked about this. I have a lot of respect for games that aren't afraid to make an unpopular decision or if they have like an idea of what kind of story they want to tell and they stick with it. I have a lot of, mm, I just think it takes a lot of guts to kill off people that you know your community loves, truly. It's so polarizing. I'm scared of discussing it. It's okay. We're going to get best started on cyberpunk so we can avoid a Last of Us 2 discussion. Uh, also, Legion, or Legend, Legend, and Free, guys. Thank you for the follows and welcome in. And G, thank you for the hydrate. Oh, I think we can agree that River over Judy, Songburn over Reed, and Meredith over Pan Am. Is this based off of my choices? Cups, thanks for the follow. Welcome in as well. River over Judy. Coming at you. Uh-huh. Yes. Through and through. Mm, most crazy statement that I'll ever say. Good morning, Night City! All right, one more time. Was a whopping sturdy 30, and that's not even the lyrics at all, but I will always say it. I can't even talk about Last of Us 2. I get too hated. It's okay, it's okay. We're going to do this. We're going to do this. Mm -hmm. Cobra, welcome back in as well. Um, yeah, I know. Actually, if you guys are looking for a really good playthrough of Last of Us 2, Anna is doing Last of Us right now. That is one of her favorite games. So if you're looking for good, like a 
really cool and unique perspective on it. Absolutely. Go watch her playthrough. Mr. Magoo, thanks for the follow. Welcome in as well. Yeah, Jess is doing it too. I forgot. Jess is, yeah, Jess is streaming it. Yeah. I wonder how she's getting along with it. I haven't talked to, it's really weird. Like, you know, when your group chat's popping off every day, like sometimes I'll go to stream and I come back from stream and there's like 80 messages. We're all so busy this week. So nobody's, well, not me, but they're so busy this week. So nobody's talking in our group chat. Mm. Too much to watch. Okay. What are we doing? So guys, if y'all are new here, welcome in. We just completed the main part of the DLC yesterday and we are left with cleaning up, run this down, moving heat and two of Mr. Hans's gigs. So we're cleaning up Dogtown. We are going to go to Blistering Love and all of the follow on side missions. And we are saving Nocturne for tomorrow, depending on how long Nocturne takes. I may or may not <laughs> go back on a save and explore Reed's side to the DLC. So, mm hmm. Why is she talking like it's the start of a YouTube video? Well, because there's a lot of new people that have popped in. So I just wanted to like let them know. I often will kind of like go back and be like, hey, just so you know, this is where we're at. Uh, maybe it's because I also have been doing a lot more YouTube videos than lately. Like I've been recording nearly every day. So I'm in like YouTube mode more than I'm in stream mode, which is not normal. Can we do a dark blue fireplace today? You guys have been liking the blue. A quick recap is always nice. Nice just to know where you are. Mm -hmm. Have no fear. Your cast of recaps here. Scuffed it may be, but it's still. King, thank you for the follow as well. And Saint Dream Mary, you guys with the blue. It's nice and cool. Blue is for Ravenclaw. Blue is for Ravenclaw. Also, Gardener, what's up? Welcome in. I can see first time chatting. Mm -hmm. Cast it one step closer to YouTube. Wait, what? To YouTube only? This is not going to happen. Casta has YouTube and stream switches above the back of my neck. I put on the wrong one. Exactly. I got to just flip the switch. We needed it. Also, I did record this morning. Like I woke up super early and recorded an episode this morning. So I'm literally coming from YouTube, essentially. This is actually the first live stream of catching. I've been watching on YouTube for over a year. Alex, thank you for tuning in. What, uh, what video did you find me through? That's awesome. Thank you so much. And Shadow, thank you for the gifted sub to Gardener and Rob with the gifted sub to Alex. Oh no, Alex, now you're stuck. Part of the ship, part of the crew. It happens. There's so many people from YouTube. They're they're just kidding. They're not giving YouTube crap. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Also, Scoop and Nightwolf, guys, thank you for the follows. I am extremely congested today. It's got to be the weather. It's got to be. Alex, yeah, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes. Oh, I don't know about that. That's Blue Tendo. Welcome back in. <clears throat> Love Mr. Hans. Understated way of talking. Hanson zeroed in huge attacks on the stadium. He's like, you've been busy. Let's chat. <laughs> He's like, hey, let's uh, we need to catch up real quick. I'm trying to decide which one I want to start with. We did just finish with Alex's. Hmm. I guess we might as well go clear Ashley's moving heat because that feels kind of like the oddball. And then we can go meet with Mr. Hands. Yeah. Kino, thank you for the gifted sub as well. I just continue praying that the ending doesn't bug out for you. Yes, I'm going to keep doing that, Voldemort. I'm going to keep trying to save and hopefully it doesn't glitch. Yeah, absolutely. You're talking about for Nocturne, right? Kino, thank you so much for paying forward your gifted sub. And Yusara, 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 thank you for the follow as well. JJ, welcome back in. Yeah, I'm going to do this one. Oh, Millie, baby. Yeah. Look out. Yeah. Ah, uh, I assume you saw Casta on the Square Enix Instagram post. Are you talking about the YouTube post? Hmm. You talking about the thumbnail for their their inst uh, the YouTube one? Their creators react, Nilman. I haven't seen it. What are you talking about? It's a clip from the YouTube video, but it's a new Instagram post. No, I haven't seen it at all. Is it a thumbnail from it? Hold on. There's nothing. Was it on for a second? Did I dance for a second? No. No, 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 no. Well, I know I'm on the thumbnail for the video. I haven't seen the Instagram post. Do you want to use your pawn pawn redemption right now? You guys get one pawn pawn a day. 
You get one pawn pawn. It's now or never. Do you want it now or do you want it later? There is jazz music. Mm hmm. That's wild. It's the part in the video where you say, take your time. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's like paused with me talking. Stop, please. No, I actually still haven't watched the video, guys. I'm scared to watch the video. It must be the whole song, though. All right, fine. We'll do it later. We'll do it later. Let me go through here. As the pawn pawn representative, later when we have a long drive. Better now than to break the mood while you're driving to Hanako. Uh, we're not doing Hanako today. It won't be Hanako today. That's tomorrow. Final step is tomorrow. Oh my gosh, Nilman, what does that face mean? <laughs> you're like, dude. It's a scuffed photo. Hey, let me see. It's a dark day. Not trying to drive since Caster will hit a cop and take Pon Pon away. <laughs> Dang. We haven't been to the stadium since. Yeah. Go to the elevator and coordinates Ashley provided. Hmm. You finally got your issues resolved? Is it good to go and everything? Yeah? Wow. Yeah, I wonder if there's new stuff. Oh my gosh, I need to change my outfit. Absolutely not. What am I wearing? Huh? Get me out of this. All right, take this off, take this off, take this off. Uh, Chocobo? No, no. Wait, this is new? Oh. Oh, I don't know about the zebra. Constellation, thank you for 17 months as well. Thank you so much. Mmm. Mmm. -mm. Nope, 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 nope. I'm gonna mix it up a little bit. Uh, I do like this one white top. I think it just kind of works. Ooh. Yeah, oh, with the heels. Anna and DeWitt, what's up? Welcome in. I had to play all of the endings in Cyberpunk because of the amount of lore behind each of them. I just couldn't get enough of the world and its characters. Absolutely. I just finished my first ending yesterday, Anna. It was quite emotional, to say the least. I do like these red pants, but I wish I had some kind of other boots that were over top of it. Mm. That, you know, this kind of works. It's changing it. It's not what I'm used to. Maybe I do still wear. All right. I think that's good. And then I need a hat. I need a hat. Mm hmm. I haven't worn this rattlesnake one the whole time. It feels weird. I kind of like it though. All right, let's see end game fit. The zebra, absolutely not the zebra print. Mm -mm. Oh, the zebra print has always been a thing. Like it's been around. My dear. Oh Fee, gosh. Oh. How would you like to do a good deed? There's a gig in here. Oh, I forgot. Jadev, have a good one. Thank you so much for tuning in. Yeah, they're probably all focused on Witcher Four now. I think they did. Well, aren't they? They are still working on a Cyberpunk 2, though, as well. Well, I am a nomad, so if the shoe fits. A go for what you usually earn a mm. piece of hot lead in the gut. A terrorist organization, the Crimson Harvest, plans to Crimson detonate Harvest. a bomb at Biotechnica's HQ. In I guess Berlin. we could do this one. I know that because Nell Springer, my client, is one of them. She needs your help Bucky foiling the plot. Unintended. And arrested. See the attachment for details. I guess we might as well do this. Might as well. Mm, thwart the terrace. Yeah, they have multiple teams. Spurious, welcome back in. Yeah, yeah, there's a separate team working on Witcher 4. That's working on, absolutely. Oh, I feel like you'd have to with how in, like extensive their lore and their characters are and everything they'd have to have two separate teams working on it right absolutely mr hands i know anna i know um i'm pretty sure they made u.s headquarters specifically for cyberpunk 2 oh previously where is uh their headquarters set at mr hands new voice actor took a bit getting used to but now i like him better than the old one i can't tell a difference unless they change to poland that's right that's right that's right yeah, because that was what... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I remember us talking about that a lot during Witcher 3. Mm-hmm. 
but they're now in Boston. They chose East Coast. In, well, I guess that's better time-wise than going West Coast and then having your main HQ in <laughs> Poland. Yeah. Wow. Mm. Witcher 4 is going to be amazing. I know. I was very happy I chose the Nomad Path. Cyberpunk isn't my usual vibe, and it matched my character. Yes, Voldemort, dude. I swear, sometimes we're cut from the same cloth. Like, absolutely. There were two kind of things that stood out to me the most with Nomad. I believe they talked about family, and I want to say loyalty. <laughs> I think loyalty was a big part of it. And Jasmine, thank you for the gifted sub to Anna as well. Anna, I hope you enjoyed the sub and the emotes and the community here. I hope you feel at home. I'm downloading Cyberpunk right now and I'm so excited to play it. Tiny first time, right? First time and everything. Yep, we're finishing up gigs inside stuff today. So, thwart a terrorist attack, weapons factory on the top level of the stadium. Details, if there's one thing terrorists like, it's setting off bombs. Crimson Harvest really seems to have a blast. They've got several successful operations to their name. That is, if you were to ask them. Biotechnica wouldn't consider the loss of its top employees anything but a failure. I can't say for sure what Neil Springer is up to, but it seems like he's grown tired. She's grown tired of her role in Crimson Harvest. She seems stressed and it's hard to blame her. You don't just up and leave a terrorist cell, do you? Meet her at the stadium, please, and discuss details. Let's find out. Mm. The vanilla version of Mr. Hand sounded way more high pitched and chippier. Wait, did I get. Did they change it to where it matched or is your base game's. Depending on the patch, do they eventually patch it where the old voice actor is no longer even in it at all? So I always heard this guy. I never heard the old one because they just patched it. No? Hmm. Out of my way. Okay. Mm-hmm. This whole fucked up zone behind. That's where we raise the sweat. That's where we get the Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, hey. Where is it? I hear it, but I can't see it. It's gotta be in the actual stadium itself. Damn it. It's just, it's just in the background. I was thinking it was one of their, you know where? I was thinking it was one of the, um, you know how sometimes they actually have radios in places? Get me closer! I know, we can't play it right now. All right. I know, I think the main reason why I do male B is so I could romance Pan Am. I didn't really do a romance option, actually. I didn't romance anyone. I just had. Oh man. I will be staying at the stadium after all. Hi. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> if you played the base game without Phantom Liberty, you could hear the OG. Okay, there it is. But I always had Phantom Liberty installed. That's why. Um. Springer. Who's asking? Name's V. I like her Thanks jacket. That makes sense. Uh huh. You weren't followed. I'm not calling Meredith. I tried to hit it off with River again. I really tried. Turns off so stream. Cast is not romancing. I romanced a vending machine. To be fair. Why? Scared the Crimson Harvest might know you're up to no good. No. Well, I have a feeling. And not a whole lot of time. Did Hands bring you up to speed? I, I think she kind of has a little bit of a country accent. I can't tell for sure. I, I get this, like, hint. Where you asked Taki Mara to dinner and he left you on red. It was Don't so funny. Don't this any longer. I still am trying to romance Taki Mara. Let it be known that I am still trying... He just is like absolutely ghosting me left and right. Mister, welcome back in. Good morning. Not gonna lie, V is giving off Reacher vibes. If one starts stuttering, she will break you down. <laughs> yes, I know, Alex. We were talking about that when I was doing that mission. It's so cool. 
Said you're a terrorist with a heart of gold. For the love of... Oh. We're not terrorists. Oh. You got any clue what the Crimson Harvest even stands for? You got How about any clue? into hunger, starvation? Ah. Uh... How did you join the Crimson Harvest? The Crimson Harvest. Oh. They recruit you, or did you volunteer? I could offer one to Grew up on a farm like most of my comrades. Corpse boots stamping on our faces. That was our life. Until we realized we could fight back. Crimson Harvest. They're like family. And the things you'll do for family will... It's true. Will keep you up at night. It's definitely Haunt a southern you. accent, yeah. Absolutely. Nick, thank you for the follow and welcome in. Family. <laughs> Starving? Where? Because dumpsters are overflowing with food in Night City. You city folk don't know shit. You think you're free? That slavery's ancient history? Ought to see how Biotechnica treats farmers. Mm. Force them off their land to grow gene-modified wheat. For food, one would think. Wrong. For chew oh. that's sold to Petrochem. You like the taste of chew too? No? The chew too? That's what I thought. That was such an interesting response from V, I thought. It looks so crispy. What are your graphics settings at? Not, they're not even maxed right now. Sorry, hold on. Say what you Ask have to me. say. Also, Paperboy, thank you for the follow. Ugh. Nomads also started out as farmers. I was thinking there was like some kind of relation or similarity to nomads, yeah. Bear, I wasn't even out of my seat. I took one second. One second. Well, let's make this. God, thank you for the follow. Bear, thank you for five gifted subs to the channel and community. Farms are empty, but the roads are full. The first nomads were farmers too, you know? Mm-hmm. Heard all about clans oh. taking corp contracts. Kind of ironic, don't you think? Tough world out there. Gotta make a living. It's true. And yet you're betraying them? Don't need plant bombs. Say what you have to say. It's true. Which bar guest person's taken? Uh, don't you guys? We do plant need to bombs, see Mr. Hands. Carry out mass killings. Uh, our people's hearts are in the right place, but they're blinded by their hatred of corpse. I. Aren't we all? I never thought we'd start killing people. Things they had me do. I. I was naive. Probably thought she'd be collecting signatures and making peace protests. Sorry. Naive. A eh, bit of an understatement, that. Uh. Spare me the judgment. Didn't hire you to pin my biography. Yeah, the movements, the subtle movements and Here. change in her demeanor is really interesting to see. Even just like, I've talked about this before, but even just the subtlety of like her pulling out a cigarette and smoking it just all adds to a feeling just a little bit more realistic, like you're truly in a scene and not just talking to a robot. What's this? How discreet? Wow, discreet. New to this, are we? What's on the shard? One thing at a time, okay? The Crimson Harvest purchased a net nuke from Hansen. It's headed for Europe. Specifically, Biotechnica's HQ in Berlin. You'll make sure that Just doesn't happen. A nuke. Your bomb won't cause any good old-fashioned destruction. Thought terrorists like putting on a show. Take down a building, whoop the fucking do. Biotechnica just builds a new one. What you want is the protein. Human casualties. It's a very slight. It's it's kind of like an it's an obvious and slight accent at the same time. Like, she doesn't have an accent on every single word. Not that you oh, normally do. This any so what do I do? Western part of the stadium used to house a sports therapy protein. center. For Hansen turned into an arms factory. Entry codes 1701. Memorize it. It's got assembly lines, warehouses, the works. Part you're interested in is an experimental lab in the old pool. It's where they keep the bomb. Find it. Upload the program from this shard. A few days from now, when the bomb's detonated in Berlin, it'll neutralize the virus, stop its spread. When it's done, I'd like that shard back. Gonna keep it as a souvenir. Can't be too careful. Said Trina the Cowgirl Crimson Harvest ever got their hands on it. I'm toast. I, yeah, I can't describe it. I, I don't know. It'd be interesting to know if the VA actually has that accent or not, because it keeps dipping in and out. 
uh, Johnny. Say what you have to say. Yeah, I like that in the DLC, Johnny doesn't have glasses in a lot of the scenes. I talked about that very early on. And yeah, three, welcome back in and desk. Thank you for the follow. I admire what you're doing. You're taking a needless risk. Mm. Don't let's make this any longer. I mean, I think it takes guts for her to bring this to somebody and try to put a Not stop a lot to of it. folks who take the risk you're taking without even expecting a thank you. Mm hmm Respect. Maybe Walter. I'm doing it for myself. Can't turn back time, but I can still change what happens here, now, the future. Too long I've sat on my ass agonizing over the shit I've done. That ends today. Got enough to work with. Sounds like you're trying to atone for something. I feel like you're telling me that they're you not going crying? to... Guess I'll get to work then. Counting on you, V. So he can look at you and say breathtaking? How pedestrian wrong. <laughs> there has to be more of a reason for him not wearing his shades as much in this. I don't know. It's definitely a conscious choice to do that. You got Johnny and Millie, that's all you need. Yeah. Also, overzealous, enjoy the lurk. Can I talk to her Gotta anymore? Make sure no one's watching. You can go. All right, roads to redemption. Yep, setting off bombs. I'm sure that she's up to. But she's grown tired of her role with them. Let's read about her. A member of the Crimson Harvest Terrorist Organization since 2074, she and her four siblings spent her childhood on their family's corn farm in Indiana. After the farm went bankrupt and Neil's parents were forced to sell their land to Biotechnica, Springer moved to Night City. A moderate payout from... For, we will, from a compensation fund for the children of relocated farmers enabled her to study chemistry. The university, as it turned out, was a breeding ground for revolutionary initiatives and ex excellent hunting ground for recruiters of various dubious organizations. When the Crimson Harvest offered Neil to join its ranks, she didn't hesitate for a second. Yet, she never stopped feeling like a stranger in the megacity. And although she was a brilliant student, she was tormented by the thoughts her degree was bought with her parents' blood. Sabotaging Biotechnica seemed like the perfect way to alleviating her remorse. Then reality caught up to her. This is gonna be an interesting gig. That's for sure. Does this take us outside? No. They put in a lot of work with facial tracking and stuff because they want to show it off. With him? You think it would be more for the... Because he... This would have been a couple... How many years... For the VAs, how many years had gone by? Like two to three years, right? We did talk about this. V V's VA sounds slightly... Slightly different, like exhausted in the DLC versus the main game in some ways. Three years, yeah. You think about a lot that changes. Your, your voice does change a lot with years. Depending on too, like especially if you like smoke or do... Oh wait, I need to go to the shops. Does he have anything? No. Mm, depending on like wear and tear. What? Hold on, we need to find some more because we might be able to buy a couple more things. Drinking, overuse. I don't know if they use it a lot for voice acting. All right, here we go. Oh, that is true. Like getting sick, sometimes your voice might never recover. Mm hmm. Zero, one. Yeah. She low-key looks like a younger version of Jackie's mother. I can't remember what Jackie's mother looked like. No, I'm a horrible person. Yeah. Three like them in this whole city. You'd have to be they get a rocker boy terrorist stuck in their head. I'll be out of this city before they even realize. Oh, Voldemar, that's, I mean, that's a... Find a way into the stadium's weapon factory, okay. Um... I don't know. There's a lot. I think there's a lot of layers to that. I think, are you asking this in reference to whether like romancing somebody is right or not in the game? Because I did kind of say my stance on that. Like multiple times I've talked about why I'm not really bothered by not romancing anybody in this game. Because I think if I were in this situation, despite her being honest, like there hasn't been a single fling that I've had where the person, except for Meredith, but every person that I've wanted to have like a real relationship with knows that I'm going down. And so that's on them to kind of accept it, but I just don't even feel like I want to put them in that situation in the first place. Righty, yo, let's just kill him. Mm. 
Never mind. I'm gonna sneak it. I'm gonna sneak it. Meredith's tattoos were honest. <laughs> My cat is on the bed sleeping with her belly up. Aww. You don't know how cats can sleep upside down? I figure it's the same way. I sleep on both my stomach and on my back. Oh, somebody's walking over here. I'm gonna try to be stealth while I have my sniper pulled out. For fuck's sake! That is literally y'all. Y'all are saying every time I'm like, I'm gonna try to be stealth, and y'all are literally like, for FFS. Come on, Maggie. Come on, girl. Uh, I did not try very hard. I tried. <laughs> what? Wait, what? Sorry, what? Every single time they, that NPC says that, I don't know. You've had some. I don't know about that. What? Wait, no, 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 initiate over. Is there anybody I can, oh. You troll the knife. Nice. Even the game knows. <laughs> okay, I think we're good. Just initiate overload on that one. I'm sorry, what? You say don't king shame? It's given a little serial killer. It's slightly given serial killer. Uh-huh. It's giving most dangerous game. Is this the kink? All right, let me do this. Let me get rid of some of these. Mm. Uh, almost every day would definitely hold back the desire to romance anyone. <laughs> I also look at it like, I think there there is a part of me that looks at it from like a realism standpoint. I'm like, if this were happening, I would be doing everything in my ability to try to get the heck out of here. I would not be trying to romance somebody. Mm. You say that, but how many people has V killed and how many times have did you have sex? It's quite obvious what's better. Just because I've done one more than the other, I had less opportunities with one. <laughs> I've just had a lot more opportunities to kill people. <laughs> I have eyes on the factory via CCTV. Should make it easier for you. They're keeping the bomb in this room. The bomb's there on the table. Slot in the shard, only understand, touch nothing else. All right, thanks for the tip. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It's too, too dangerous to romance anybody in Night City. I was, uh, maybe he was a victim of Meredith too. Ayo, hey, hey, good morning. <laughs> uh, I just wanted to join. I wanted to know what we were celebrating. That, no deal. I didn't get rid of Pew Pew, but for some reason something else is on him right now. Yeah, you're right. Pew Pew is not on my, uh, not on my hip right now. Ooh. Ooh, stay down, stay down, stay down. Hold on. You're right. Where's my Pew Pew? When did I put Overture on? Excuse me. Keep you. Ugh. Nice. All right, they failed that. Wakey, wakey. Ah, the pew pew is just so good. It's too strong. Just a matter of time now. Oh, go through that door. Go through the door. Ooh. All right. For some reason, this reminds me of the area with Hanson. Who's tracing my location? What the heck? Excuse me. How can you even trace my location from here? Right, let's see what's here. This is really awkward, hold on. Where is this, you? Wait a minute. Are they upstairs? Oh, snap. <laughs> Left side? This person's trying to weapon glitch me again? Does not make sense. Okay, hold on, wait, it makes sense. Okay, hold on. They completed it, I got a weapon glitch? Oh no. This is, wow, this is a really big layer. 
Did Skippy follow up from last time or still no quest from him? Mm. I'm sorry. Pervert ass. Where is this person? I'm getting insulted in every way possible from this crew. Surround the target. <laughs> Absolutely, it's too early for this. They're finding new ways to insult me left and right. Always be sad that they know Johnny's gun. Oh yeah, I never got to experience that. Machine overload. Yeah, because you guys were talking about when you played the flashback, the flashback, his gun was so broken. <laughs> Nothing like a flashbang in the morning. All right, let's get out of here. Uh, it's never too early to pew pew the hell out of them. Jeez. I'm telling you, my ears would be blown out. XPS, happy Saturday. How's it going? How to negotiate a business deal? I still need to make sure we kill all of them. And we still want to try to max for engineering. Oh, come on. What? I'm just going to beat him up. Beat him up. Beat him up. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Nice. <coughs> All right, it's been so long since I've beaten somebody with my hands. It feels like now that I have the gorilla hands, I wish I had done it for all of the fights. I wish I hadn't done all the fights until I got the gorilla arms. It's so satisfying when you just like knock them upside the head. Everything's going to shit. Mm. Asian glow, welcome back in. Exactly, put them up, mister. Oh, snap. First door. Here we go. It's because Johnny's ego remembers himself as more OP than he was. Cinematic, wait. I can see that as being a real thing. I actually believe that. Dev, thanks for the hydrate. I actually believe that. Good morning, Nation Glow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, something like that. Should just be the one last person, I think. Maybe not. Okay. I think the only other red was this thing, I'm assuming. Yeah, I'm assuming this thing. I'm just gonna initiate an overload. Nice. Yeah. Homo sapien, welcome back in. And uh no, this is just it's just how I used to do my hair. I just keep going back and forth. It depends if I just washed it or not. Johnny's watched too much John Wick. It is a perfect fit, though. It somehow is such a perfect fit. I need to get more water, and let me do this. When you control another character, Siri, they're OP. Yeah, but Siri... Siri should be OP, right? Like, with everything that she has? Wow. So many cool colors. I like it. All right, install malware. Siri is just OP in general. Tell me you weren't a businesswoman in your previous life. <laughs> Only thing worse than a corpo is a terrorist with a conscience. Except terrorists ain't afraid to dirty their hands. You blame her for having a conscience? Blame Nell for trying to save innocent people for having a conscience? If you're gonna declare war on corpse, you'd best be ready for the consequences. Yes, innocent people die. It's the nature of war. What do you know about war? What did bombing air Saka Tower even change? Ooh, have we ever been able to ask him this? I don't think so. Been half a century since your little stunt at our Saka Tower. Thousands of innocent folks dead, and for what? An even taller tower? It was just the first skirmish in a long war. It's because of spineless cowards like Nell that we hit quicksand. Hmm. All right. Just leave the weapons factory now. I do want to scan it as well. Obsolete now. Function obsolete upon connection to the network sends a lethal pulse to all users. Dang. All right, body identified. We got to get out of here. Provoked penguin. I haven't seen you in so long. No, nah, I just washed it. Classic. This is so true, though. Did you do anything new to your hair? No. When will middle part be back? I don't know. 
I just change on the day. Sometimes I like my hair in a hat. Sometimes I like it a little parted. Sometimes I parted. All right. Um, that's not good. Drop it. Drop it. Variety is the spice of life. All right. Try not to get too attached to anything. I've been doing life stuff. No, that's good. That's good. I hope it means that things have been going well. Absolutely. Also, posture check, but then I know you posture check, so I get to relax. Yeah. You already have a sub. Provoke Penguin, you have a sub. Anon. Anon, thank you so much for the gifted sub to Provoke Penguin. Thank you. Do not say it for crepe. Jasmine, you guys are getting two birds of a feather, I swear. Hold on. Too much of birds of a feather. Need to go topside. Bring back the bangs, never. Mm. For around 50 years until the Unification War brought them back, so there was a little bit. So something did happen, but... Good morning! Luke! Luke, happy good morning! Actual good morning, not I'm killing you good morning. Luke, thank you so much for the five gifted subs as well, and welcome back in. I saw you said you were popping out, you at therapy. Popping back in. You didn't miss too much, we just started a gig. And thank you so much for the five gifted subs. Shaved sides and a mohawk when? <laughs> Alright, I don't go that wild. Does it feel 80s having your hair side parted? This is how I had it my entire life until maybe a couple years ago when I started middle parting it. Good morning. <laughs> oh, that's not good. That's not good. Try to get rounder. I'm out. Close contact. You know what? Sometimes I forget that you don't have to kill anybody. Sometimes you can just get away. And it's all part of the plan I just made up. Mm hmm. Victor, welcome in. Uh, they are. I do prefer my headset more than the earbuds because these guys do pop out of my ears sometimes, but I think it's more of a squeegee thing and less of a me thing. Like, I think my ears are just small. Hey. Tommy. Tommy? Wait, what? Are you what? Doing here? Uh, helping my dad. Wait, what? You know my son? You know. We met at Fiona's training center. Yeah. Huh. That. Tommy had such a promising career ahead of him. But yeah. Now, now he has to hang up his cleats. Along Small with the rest of our problems. Stuff. It's not the end of the world. Fiona is bad news. Yeah. Kids still young. Sometimes they pop future out. ahead of him. In Dogtown? Yeah, maybe for the families here by choice who can leave on a damn whim. Afraid we don't got the luxury. That's fair. I want to see if, uh, there's nothing, like, special that you could buy from the shop. Yeah. Satanic, what's up? Welcome in. Oh, you're gonna have the bull cut with the added mullet. Yeah, Mojo? You're gonna have the El Capitan special? Mm-hmm. Oh, uh, can one of my... If, if you do have smooch mark earbuds, it should pop up. One of my mods want to do the earbud thing. Also, Blazin, thanks for the follow and depth with the posture check. I know. Hmm, Blue Ranger, what? Hey, uh, thanks, <laughs> thanks uh, then. I think I need to go this way. Uh-huh. Uh, on the game, I'm not using any mods. This is my first playthrough. Almost most of my playthroughs on the first go around are typically entirely organic and vanilla. However, Depending on the game and how old it is, sometimes we might add things to make it a little bit better. Give me my life back. Oh, wow. Oh, are the earbuds temporarily sold out? These guys? Even on Amazon? Wait, I think I bought them through the website. I don't think I bought them through Amazon. It might be this color, though. The white and the purple might be the part that's sold out. They might have other colors. Yeah. Mysterious Elf, thanks for the know you posture check. AJ woke up from a nap. Okay, this is the meeting area. Here we go. Yeah, I do love my, I love my other over the head earbuds or earphones. All right. 
The bomb. You, you take care of it? Disarmed. We're in the clear. Quick, hand me the shard. Gotta make tracks. Yeah, you gotta get the heck out what of here. The... That's not good. Shit, the car's hacked. What's going oh, on? Oh, snap. Did you sell me out? No. No. Got nothing to do with this. Mel Stringer, you're under arrest for organizing last year's bombing of a biotech. Whoa. No, no, this isn't happening. That her people. Is that true? That true? You the one who planted that bomb? I swear on my life, V. I had no idea. Okay, but she planted it. Stay in the car. I'll deal with him. Uh, oh, snap. Oh, if you don't choose something, you die. It was so fast. I forgot to pick something. It was so fast. It was so fast. I. <laughs> well, showing you things that you maybe haven't seen before. Happy Saturday. <laughs> Mule, thanks for the follow as well. And Triple, thanks for the hydrate. Uh huh. Mm. Well, there's always a third option. Yeah, but still, she planted that, like... The bomb. Disarm. Quick. I don't know, this is so... Yeah, they Shh. zeroed us. Did you... Biotechnica! I really didn't nothing sell you to out. Do with this. No, no, no. I want to ask her the other question. You didn't tell me the so whole truth. you were a dyed-in-the-wool terrorist after all. I swear on my life, V. I had Get no... I... Get out. V, please, come on, don't leave me. Listen, fellas. You've got the wrong gal. They let me get out of the car. And the other one? The Crimson Harvest manipulated. Nell was oh, just following good, orders. Manipulated against her will by terrorists. Save it. Heavy then speaks for itself. Yeah, but I feel like they kind of wanted it too. Can't do anything more for you. Oh. Had a deal, Nell. Nothing more I can do for you. Corpse. No, this isn't over. Don't leave me like this, please. I'm just trying to get everybody to hate me. I'm just Wanna trying. cuff me? Go right ahead. Ah! It's not like I like Biotechnica either. Ah! I didn't do this for her. I did this for me. I did this for me. Bye, Felicia. <laughs> at this point, everybody's after me in Night City. Don't look at me like that. It was because I didn't exactly like Biotechnica. This is better than the sex we've had. Oh my gosh. Yet? No, I, I don't think so. Thanks, V. I don't even think you can kill her if you wanted to. Why did you let me? Could have told me you had more than the Crimson Harvest to worry about. Don't look at me like I, that. I thought if you found out the truth, you wouldn't help. I, I'm sorry. I misjudged you. I'm kind of surprised. I mean, I, I'm not surprised Mr. Hands took this, I guess. I am and I'm not. Just start Think fresh. you'll ever come around to forgiving yourself. Don't Just know. waiting for a reason to murder. It's a bit I of the, uh... I already hate myself for what I did. Got your whole life to turn things around. Today was the first step. Couldn't mm. have done it without you. Thanks, V. Giving Good her a second there. chance is kind of like giving Songbird a second wait. chance, too. I mean, potential. it's different, but could have gone far. Pains me to see promising careers. Promising careers. Down the train. Promising careers. I guess I'm just here to give a bunch of people a second chance, and then I also felt like I was like, "This is the pot calling the kettle black." If I'm to condemn her after all the people that I've killed, after all the people I've killed, I know. Hmm. I don't know. I don't think it's that easy. I think there's a lot. There's a. Oh. I'll have to do some cleaning up. Nevertheless, you saved more people than you killed today. Most importantly, <laughs> the client is safe and sound. Transferring your fee and closing the contract. Also, I did what was barely. I did what I was not, like said to do as a mercenary. So I. I acted as a mercenary in this part. It's a back and forth. We're the diet at the wheels of Millie. Hands is pragmatic as always. He gets gigs, he pays for them. I'm playing the Merc card. I just think that there's more to that than anything also. I mean, there's a little bit of her getting sent. Get a brain. 
her upbringing and everything and then her getting sent to a college where they're practically like grooming people to join some of these organizations at such a young age being impressionable and everything i'm not saying she is right for doing anything i'm not condoning anything that she did she made her own choices but there is an element of manipulation too that's been done to her i'm just saying it's not black and white why is there no mr hands a romance option because he's married oh i do need to be up there he's married yeah mm. the ankles i need to get up top one of the cops is two ways away from it <laughs> oh. <laughs> no the cop was one day away from retirement we do want to go back to moving heat because this will be a nice easy quest we need to do this see i thought he talked about his wife too I know he has a daughter, but I thought he did mention his wife at one point. I think if you walk in and you overhear him talking, you hear him talking, I think, to his wife about their daughter. Could be an ex-wife, though. Could be. Wait, a new job? Heaviest of hearts. Complete run this town in order to unlock this gig. The heaviest of hearts. Oh, but that's four. Okay, so we have to do run this town first. There's a lot of side missions for him. You can say it's Fifty Shades Grey. Uh-huh. Okay, so we want to do... I do want to be down there. No, let me... Let me... Oh, oh, no. Oh, snap. Okay. Let me go over here first. Nothing like Saturday morning making hard decisions already. <laughs> Love it. Also, Treefer, thanks for the follow and welcome in. And Kyle. Kyle, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. What the heck is that for? Let me do this over here. Mm. Let me go over here. Kyle, thank you so much, and AQ, thank you for the follow, and I hope you enjoy the channel and continue to. Quick, get her done. Quick, get her done. Thank you so much. And guys, if you've gotten a gifted sub from anybody today, I really hope you give them a big thank you. Um, it's like you think the hard choices are going to be done with, and that's all we have left because we're doing side mission after side mission. Ah, uh, go to the elevator for Ashley. Giovanni, thanks for the follow as well. I slipped, fell, and hit the gift buttons. <laughs> oh, yeah. Clearly an accident. Purely an accident. Okay, before I do this, I gotta go to the bathroom. I've been hydrating like crazy. I'm in my water era. All right. I'm just drinking so much water when I first wake up. If I had to write a novel, I'd be... Wait, what? Of rounds? <laughs> yeah. Of a barrel? What is... Okay, you guys enjoy this. Enjoy this. Yeah. I always do. I'm telling you this. If you wake up and the first thing you do is drink water, you're going to have to use the bathroom for the rest of the day. I'm telling you. I'll be back. Ginger doesn't want to come hang out. It's been like multiple streams since she's wanted to come hang out with us. She probably won't even spend time with me on my birthday. That's what happens. What? Did Pon Pon get played? What happens if you listen to too much pom pom? Are you talking about is this is this are you talking about this guy dancing right now? This is what happens with too much pom pom? Ah. Uh, all right. <laughs> Look around the NPC. Look around him. What? Is there something about pom pom? What? He is Pon Pon. Also, hold on, hold on, David. London Bear, guys. No, B Dubs Bear. London and David. David, thank you for five more gifted subs to the channel and community. Do not follow suit with these troll biscuits. Don't. Skywalker, also, thank you for 13 months of continual support as well. Time absolutely flies. Mini Cooper with the gifted sub to a drug dancer. Do not block the door. Hmm? Oh, you can talk to him. What you looking at? Are you going to ask me that? Seriously? Guys, thank you for all the mm. gifted subs. Bear is teaching the newcomers bad habits. Stay in school. Cool? Don't do pom pom. Yeah? I, I agree. Are we? We're cool. We're cool. He might be dancing to I want to step. Whoa! Uh... Is he an FIA agent? 
is he an FIA agent? Kind he's, of boring, eh? Is he just... What? <laughs> Pawn Pawn's behind this? Colin? Colin, oh, thank you for the follow and welcome in. Aries. <gasps> he's a narc. <laughs> Ashley? Free wheels. You making me move? Yeah. The faster you go with this. Okay. This mission's rough? Oh, no. This has something to do with Ashley, doesn't it? Captain Thickrod, welcome back in. Also, tell us, welcome in as well. Oh, no. Not another hard mission. All of these are so hard. Okay. Change of plans. I did that. That's done. Mr. Hands, right? Appreciate it, Hands. I'll take a look. Leon, help. <laughs> Best of luck. Thank you, Mr. Hands. V with all the dog town at stake. Uh, little good can wait. Please first solve the issue of Hanson's successor. Don't rush me. I'm simply reminding you where your priorities lie, V. You'd do well not to forget it. That's fair. All right, wait, wait. You need to reach the panel. That'll open the door. I'll be watching. Can't tell if you're joking. I don't know. Toad is cute. Amanda, what's up? Welcome in. London, thank you for the gifted sub to Captain Thickrod as well. And Toad, hi. Or Amanda, I guess. I'll have to remember that a couple times. Oh, she's typing? Okay, back. So just remember to keep a low profile. Trying to solve a problem. Not make a new one, yeah? So keep your eyes glued here. I'll be sending you tips. Just remember, once you're in, ain't no hole going back. Gonna cut off the elevator to keep any surprises from showing. All good? <clears throat> gonna need a yes if you're nodding your head right now i can't see it can she relax cheers i found the pom pom man he's in my room he just teleported in your room handsome <laughs> okay it's a bit of a mess i feel Patience like this is a virtue i feel like i'm gonna wake up naked and afraid like the last time. This doesn't seem right. Something about this does not seem right. I can't take my weapons out. London, thank you so much. And Captain Thickrod, I hope you've been doing well. You're gonna have to crawl through there, all sneaky, you know, like a snake. Ha ha. Uh, yeah. Why do I feel like this is not just easy peasy? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Slit his throat, slit his throat. All right. We're playing cyberpunk right now. Oh, Toad. Or Amanda, thank you for the follow as well. Yeah, we're doing the last little bits of a game called cyberpunk. All right, let's drop this body. But we're going to lethal dump him. Yeah? <laughs> Potter, scared Potter. Let me see. Turn off this. Okay. Let's go over here, like a Slytherin. Nice. Oh snap, oh snap, oh snap, oh snap, oh snap. Oh snap. Maybe they didn't see. Optional. You know what? It should be like that. I had one job, one job. I killed one guy stealth. That's a win in my books. One guy killed stealth wise. That's a win. Yeah, I like that the music changes too, depending on who you're fighting. Stealth does not exist. This should work though. This is good, this is good. 
Reach the garage interior. Somebody's coming in here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Nishida, right? What's my favorite gun to use? I'd say probably- oh, snap! Quick with the slide! Uh, probably this one. I would say any of the snipers. Gosh, your ears would be blown out. Caster trying to be silent is like an elephant trying to be a ninja. <laughs> hey, it happens every once in a while. No grenades here. No capes. Oh, right in the thigh. Oh. Define silent. Hey, there was a silent sniper. There was some kind of silent sniper. Can I actually get hits on that guy? Maybe. to get the people in the car. Nice, one down. I think I like snipers because you just have to do less hits on them. And it also kind of gives you reason to try to do a nice little roasty toasty headshot. I mean, if you blow out their eardrums, they can't hear. Technically, you're being silent. You're technically being stealthy if... I know, Ashley's being really quiet all of a sudden. I don't know if I trust that. There's like two back there. Come on! With big pack! I do like that you can shoot about four times before you have to reload on this guy too. Left side. I've never SMG'd. I'll never SMG. I mean like I've tried it before, don't get me wrong. I'm just not an SMG girly. Let's take this out. Roasty toasty. You're supposed to do this whole segment silent? I don't think so. I don't think so. The thing is, after we murder everyone in this room, is that they're not silence, and stealth. I like the way you think. It's like a little... Absolutely disgusting. Come on, dude. Your mates are dying and you're out there. Just despicable. not a guy's guy. Mm. The shotguns would be fun. I don't need to describe what he- we know what he was doing. Disgusting. Just letting everybody get picked off here. Let me see what I can do with this. I did stealth and visibility helps so much, which I do have it. I do have it, don't get me wrong. Okay, we just opened something. All right, those are just the... Those things. Come out and put it! Oh. <laughs> Gonna be a good day. I'm acclimating. I'm starting to really become the true killer. It's gonna be a good day. Yeah. So judgmental. I will say that it is fun to challenge yourself with stealth. Don't get me wrong. There's a time and place for it. But sometimes you just gotta go in there. And anyway, I just started blasting. Kelly is 30. 69. Absolutely. Six string, hi. I haven't played the DLC and I'm missing these streams. It's killing me. Well, I'm almost done with DLC. Um, this is like finishing up the last of the gigs and the missions and everything. And I think we'll be done around probably one, maybe an hour and a half. And then we'll be back on to just main mission solely. Mm -hmm. Ask questions later. There we go. There's our car. That's the car we know and love. Is that the, 
Oh my gosh, that is exactly how I parked it too. Does it really stay exactly how you park it or is it always backed in? Because I did do reverse Uno. All right. Mm-hmm. It's just easier Please when you murder everybody. Wheels. Johnny? I knew Johnny would oh, appreciate yeah? this. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, yeah. All right, let's see what Ashley says. Ashley? All right. You're going to have to grab it. They saw you, Choom. Either you're screwing with me or just playing crap at what you do. Nova almost out of this mess. Now, under the steering wheel, Jack in. Need to use your personal. Easy enough. I don't know. I don't trust this. I don't trust it. Ready to roll or what? I feel like I'm going to get played here. You'd enjoy. Oh, yeah. We're just wiping the data logs. You would enjoy me playing Hitman. That man would be a hoot. I did not knew he. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Leave with the car. Oh, snap. I'm just hitting every single blockade they do. Move. Ma'am, you gave me an impossible task. How am I supposed to get through this? Back up on them? Ram this car? What the heck? The move this car. Okay, I'm gonna need to get out and move this car first. Casualties. <sighs> All right, hold on. Millie would have fit. Millie would have fit. Let me get out of this. I'm gonna try to shoot some of them too. All right. That's actually good. We just have to kill these guys. Wait, is the car exploded? No, the car's still fine. The car's still fine. Open wide. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hold on. Let me do overheat on one of them. Get out of the way. John Wick just turned into Austin Powers. <gasps> bar guest. These are bar guest <gasps> guys, right? Because these were Hanson's men. Easy enough. All right, let's take it and go. Take it and go. Take it and go. Uh. Uh, guys, <coughs> slight issue. Uh, I cannot get back inside of that vehicle. <gasps> slight problem. There are more inbound. And the car exploded. No, you can enter from... Maybe with this car you can only enter from the driving? <coughs> I can open the stash. <coughs> I think we might have a problem. Who's shooting me right now? <coughs> oh my gosh. Oh, I see them. I see them. All right, now yeah. without somebody... Oh my gosh, who now? Who now? Yeah, I'm gonna need to bump it forward. In this type of car, you can only do it. I can't push it, hold on. <laughs> Why is this the most mean thing possible? Oh my gosh. All right, let me get rid of all these. This is really bogging me down. I'm showing you guys all the outcomes. What I wanted was quiet. <laughs> Who? It's like the car is hitting me. All right, this is fine. This is fine. This is fine. You're right. Let me just bump it. I'll just move it forward. Okay. Hmm. I see there's spikes on the other side. Right. Yeah, I'm seeing the barbed wire now. <laughs> oh, no. Wait, it's getting it away from the edge! <sighs> okay, everything's fine. <laughs> Every 
everything's fine. Hmm. We're good. Shut up. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> and on a milli nonetheless. Look at that. On a milli. <laughs> I hate any other car but milli. Okay, moving heat. Oh, moving heat. Colonel's gonna hang you by the balls if the target ain't dead. Got oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I don't even know what just happened. I don't know. <laughs> Okay. I, yeah. I've never, I say this in awe and not criticism. I've never seen anyone do what Caster can do with cars with this game. <laughs> London with a thousand bits. <laughs> it was the combination of all of it. I also have four stars I gotta run from. Absolute menace to society. Oh, cars are going to do what cars are going to do. The car also said, wait, Ashley, I think you've just displayed some of your best driving to me. Chachi. Uh, <laughs> it was Chad's fault. When in doubt, it was Chad's fault. Right. What I got was more problems, enough to keep me jammed up for hours. You like the attention so much, have more of it. All of Hanson's peeps nearby just got a friendly ping from me. Have fun, bitch. I said, bitch. All right. Dang. She deleted me from her numbers, but I got a free car. We got a free car out of it. And uh, yeah, level four. Okay. That explains why there were four stars. Okay. Yep. Mm-hmm. She said, bitch. It's weird to see that Casta, wait, see Casta play driving games now? Wait, I only want to see, oh, is it weird that I only want to see Casta play driving? What other games could we do? What other games could we do with driving? It's so weird because I would say that I feel like I'm actually a half decent driver in real life. Just doesn't translate. GTA, which GTA 6 is coming out and GTA 5 played a major part in my upbringing, that's for sure. The truck driving simulator. Mm. Everybody relax. All right, we need to meet Mr. Hands. We've got a couple other things. We have one more gig or we meet Mr. Hands. I feel like we should finish up with his gigs and then go see him. Complete run this town in order to unlock this gig. Just kidding. We're gonna do run this town. <laughs> Just kidding. I love when they make it simple like that, you know? Today is just a hoot. Uh, I will say, I feel like I should get bonus points for creativity on getting my car stuck and then unstuck. I guess it says to go this way. GTA 4 caster will be weird driving physics. Would match made in heaven? GTA 4. I do feel like I need to go back to all the other GTAs because I've never played any of the other ones besides 5. Saints Row would be good. Saints Row Tur Gran Turismo one off stream. I love it. I love it. But I feel like for those, I'd want to have like the steering wheel. I feel like if I had a steering wheel, I'd be fine. You guys should see. I might be crap at driving in this, but wait till you see me on Chocobo back. I crushed the Chocobo races. All right, I was drifting left and right, smashing them. Mm-hmm. Darth Vicious, don't look at me like that. I was. You guys just haven't seen it yet. Also, Wild Dingle. Wild, thank you so much for two months of continual support. It's crazy how you found this. And I'm so glad that you've enjoyed the channel and the community. And thank you for supporting me, truly. It sounds like your friend didn't steer you wrong. Kazadar, also, hold on, wait. Mini Cooper with the gifted sub to Miss Millie the Beast. <laughs> and also Kazadar with 17 months of continual support as well. Thank you so much. I need to just borrow Jess's. It's so easy to borrow things when she lives in a whole nother area for me and just have her pop it down just be like hey i want a driving wheel for my birthday 
Actually, I'll be kind of cool. I bought the steering wheel for my wife a few years ago. She loves driving sims. She used it once and then went back to controller. Is it not as much fun? Do you feel, I feel like you have to match it with other stuff. You know, I never purchased from here. Let me see if there's any upgrades. No, but I kind of want a hot dog. Hot dog. All right. I'm not going to eat it, but. Quee. Quee. <laughs> God right. town without the colonel. Can't hardly imagine it. The good old side. Oh, please, brother. He a common thug. Not even that. Not no more. Worm food's worm Tone food. Down, Chumba. Wanna Can wind up come like him? So, Sass. dog town. Kind of get What's some feelers out. Like now? On edge. Who knows what'll happen next? Colonel had the hood's balls and his iron jaws, but man, it all worked somehow. Now? Now peeps gotta take care of themselves. Mm. Apparently a problem that, for some. Ren, by the way, welcome back in. It's great to see you return for another stream. You liked it before? Yeah, before it wasn't wrecked by a bar guest truck? To the private room. So let's go. Also, Takem, welcome in. I don't, I... I wish I could speak other languages, unfortunately just English, but hi and welcome in. I see Marcy. Uh, French? Yeah, Tab, Tab, welcome back in. Also Mazda, you got your internet, wait a minute, Dingle and Mazda related, hold on. Yeah? The Starline Boost, no. I, wait, is it, is it just like, are you talking about Starline Boost, like, in... In Mario Kart, where if you hit it at the right second? I know you... I don't think you burn out. I haven't seen the Start Boost. Just good friends. I see. Yeah, I just want to show if I If you could speak French. I wish I could. I really do. But no, alas, I could not. Yeah, but welcome in, and thank you so much for popping in. Yeah, they love... Uh, wait, wait, they love your on-stream energy is what they... I think they just said. The crazy, crazy on stream energy. You could kind of recognize that a little bit of that? Ah, AJ? AJ, can last. you translate for me? I lacked the time to brew tea. Mm. My apologies. If you press two, you get the boost. I didn't know that. All right, hold on. These sphinxes always freak me out. I've never actually looked at anything else. Shall we continue? Okay. Well, let's find out what happens to the fate of Dogtown, y'all. A happy return indeed. Another meat in the flesh starting to feel special. Face to face again. Let me sit What's down. What's changed? Ginger Everything. would be worshipped. And that's what we'll discuss. Kurt Hansen. I love his artwork. A man of many hats. A criminal, dog of war. To mine eye, an entrepreneur. And business suffocates in a vacuum. Vultures circle the colonel's corpse already. The enterprise he built must choose a new leader. Mm. We will make certain they choose correctly. The okay. shard, please insert it. This we, I do agree. It's interesting how he just knows that we're gonna kind of work with him on this. Talk, thank you for the kind words and I'm glad you're enjoying the energy and just the stream and everything. Take thank the you shard, for the kind the... words. And it hammy, doesn't thank bite, you for the I promise. Uh -huh. Relax. Then why is it we care? I take the long view of Dogtown's well-being. You care for short-term profit. <laughs> Should Dogtown drown in blood, neither is achievable. Oh, he absolutely has golden pipes for sure. Uh, classy, thank you for the 500 bits. Trying to upgrade my French fry badge, don't mind me. <laughs> is it the, do you have take the, the, you have the v. It doesn't bite, the I promise. Fries? And also Zibit, thank you for the gifted sub to talk. Zibit, thank you for all these gifted subs to people. And Aurora, thank you for the follow. All right, focusing up, focusing up. Let me guess, got a successor all lined up, don't you? Who do you think it is? Lieutenant Colonel Bennett. Bennett. One of Hanson's most loyal. Y'all had mentioned that. Commands respect. Somebody mentioned his is name. Is capable of rallying a strong base. The right, logical age choice, 38. this gentleman soldier. Alas, he has competition. A man named Yago. Yago. He's starting from a lower rung, but has 35. high aspirations. He's already begun seeking outside support from mm. the Voodoo Boys. You will meet with Yago. You will convince him to back down. The chief accountant versus bar guest officer chief aide to Kurt Hansen. It doesn't really feel like a fair fight. 
feel like most people already v know Bennett. Maybe that doesn't necessarily work cold. in his favor, though. Mm. All right, first of all, I need you to relax for a second. The only thing growing cold is the tea that you haven't offered me. Bennett, tell me more. What's wrong with Yago? Hmm. Yago not up to snuff? Why? He's an accountant. No soldier. Kept Hansen's books for him. V. You don't win hearts by counting numbers. Yeah. Bennett, tell me more. All right, hold on, hold on. Born in Budapest as... Yeah, uh, okay. Uh, immigrated to Night City with his Tick family. Tock. This, I'm trying Time to really... You're no gonna man. get... Okay, you're giving me a bio... <sighs> Alright, let me read this really fast. Really, <laughs> busy being Night City's underbelly. In 2072, we have layered the foundation of the top of the organizational rank due to his corporate skill set, settled connections with smuggling trade. He presently seeks support of <sighs> Our business grows cold. Alright. <sighs> In Dogtown from the Voodoo Boys, last and most certainly not least, Yago is an aficionado for purebred canines. Instantly not a fan from Mr. Hans since he loves cats so much, I can tell. Okay. What's Bennett's story? Mm hmm. The rap god moment. Ex Marine took part in Operation Midnight Storm. He never Midnight questioned Storm. orders, didn't serve for glory or medals. Loyal from start to finish. AJ, I can't believe you just translated that. I love you. <laughs> AJ, thank you for the 100 bits. Enlisted in the uh, NUS Marines in 2063, twice decorated for a commemorial service. Tick tock. Time waits for no Thrice man. brought the military court to take a little opportunity to know where he refused to do more laws after and officially doesn't need a defector by military along with Hansen's entire unit. He remains in Dogtown as ex colonel's most loyal discipline or disciple. The natural choice in succession v, to his throne. Our business grows cold. Okay. I I'll guess, can you actually pass? No, I feel like that's not a real option. But Aguilar will. I need to stop uh, being on me. lost me. Hansen remained on top because he had the contacts to stay afloat. Most important among them was a Cuban cartel. Mm. Enter Aguilar, a merc assassin from Havana, a living legend. Every time someone in Havana lights a cigar, Aguilar extinguishes a life somewhere around the globe. I'm lucky to have her behavioral imprint on hand. Oh. You're lucky to have experience with the tech already. You want me to really? You want me? We're going back into FI attack, okay? Interesting. Interesting seeing this after Tick the DLC has ended. Time waits for no man. Do you normally do it before it ends? It's time for another cosplay. Also, Judgy, thanks for the posture check. Triple, no, that was impressive. That was impressive. Merc assassin, huh? Color me curious. Anything else I ought to know? Real name, unknown. Body count, unknown. Conservative estimates put it in the dozens. <sighs> per continent. Rumors, perhaps. But rumors often make for crowning arguments in negotiation. And I know you? Let me summarize. Need me to assume Aguilar's identity? Have a chat with Yago. Talk him out of any silly ideas he might have. Child's play. Are you gonna give me a file on what to talk about with it? Shadow. Shadow, thank you for five more gifted subs. <laughs> Even after I just told you I was gonna feed you to the wolves in DVD. V. <laughs> okay. All's crystal. Shadow, thank you so much. <laughs> I prepared a shard with helpful intelligence. Also a weapon. The same Aguilar uses. Help yourself to both. Okay. Interesting piece of iron. Nice. We Custom got a weapon. Made. A unique and highly persuasive tool. Sapporo to romance Takimura. <laughs> wait, wait, to get an imprint of a male nomad so we can romance Pan Am. Hold on, wait, you could. If we could get, wait a minute. Wait a minute. All right, let's go check out this weapon. What? Who put me in this top? When did this, do you have to wear this when you walk in? Do they cover you whenever you walk into this bar? Am I missing something? <laughs> I'm pretty sure I did not have that on before. No, I did not. <laughs> you never play DVD? Oh, it's so good. Also, Joji, thank you for asking. Yeah, my eyes are feeling a lot better. Yeah, I think it was just like a, it could have been tied to allergies too, possibly, but. All right, let's take his imprint or her imprint. 
Aguilar's. It's called Fashion. Mm. I did not put that on. I never would have. How are you Time liking Phantom Liberty better than feet. the main story? Suit up and take the imprint for a whirl. Ugh. It's actually really... It's really difficult because I haven't finished. I haven't finished the... Oh, okay. I see. Yeah, I still need to finish the main story today and tomorrow to kind of really be able to compare the two and understand, I think, but... Nothing's wrong with my eyes. I think that they were just strained. I think just sometimes... I think it was a combination of allergies, not blinking enough. Uh, when Final Fantasy VII dropped, I was I was getting a lot more screen time than I normally get too, so I think it could have been contributing to it as well, but I'm feeling a lot better. Oh, McQuackleton, probably not till June, June or July. My trip and I, I think my trip at the end of June. And also Dan and Highborn and Tamu, Tamu, guys, thank you for the follows and welcome in. You like the game's pronunciation of Aguilar? Do you have a mirror? That's a mirror. Okay, fair enough. I do. I am drawn towards the corpo look. Like it do feels feel very clean, difference? fancy. My time's precious, hands. If this don't work, you'll need to find ten new digits or aim for a rebrand. Oh. Hmm. Better than expected, V. Or Complete rather, contempt. I want to see what complete You'll make a strong looks like. impression on Yago too. A trusted source tells me he's to meet soon with a delegation of the Dogtown Voodoo's. I like that you get more time I'll with this though. The coordinates. Is that contempt? Deep disgust? Tick tock. Time waits for no man. Dead serious? They all look like constipation faces to me, to be honest. Okay, the grim, the grim's creepy. Yeah, the grin actually makes sense. She looks constipated, that's what I'm saying. They all look like constipated faces, except for the grin. Well, maybe the grin too. I care <laughs> Depending not at on all what for stage you're handle in. the gangoons. <laughs> uh. As you will. I have only one request. Yago withdraws his candidacy. I can make that happen, at whatever cost. Once you've shown him reason, call me. And remember, my district's future is riding on this. So is yours. Don't screw me over. Don't worry. Won't disappoint. That is the hope. Good luck. I don't know why, but I just picture him having a army of Sphinx cats. Just like a full blown army of them just swarming you. Key card required. Hmm. Tick tock on the clock. But the party don't stop and no, Zoe, no! <laughs> I didn't need to think about that song. Oh, no. Yes, giant skin kitties. I have never heard that term and I never want to hear it again. Uh, never again. Stop, Classy. My district. He already is calling it his. I need you. I... Classy. Give us the constipation face versus what? The deep disgust? Well, I think a lot of it, it depends too on like, a lot of it comes down to how expressive your eyebrows are too. And what you can do with your like mouth. It's weird to me how hairless cats have the ones that have survived of sins. I think they have more fragile biology than other ones. I hear that they like secrete a lot of oils too. My uh, cousin has a naked mole rat cat. And uh, it is cute. I'm not gonna lie, they actually are really adorable. But yeah, she was saying that it, it, yeah, very oily. The murderous grin just screams Casta. I feel like a lot of making those kind of faces would come down to your eyes and your, for me, like my eyebrow would probably do a lot. Sphinx cat? Yeah, the Sphinx cat. No, no, I'm talking about Sphinx cats. <laughs> sorry, brother. I'm sorry. You know, I like the ones that are, um, oh, they're kind of like werewolf cats. They look like werewolf cats. Too much Kim Possible in your younger days, I think. The amount of times that I bring up naked mole rat. <laughs> if Rain and also Morda, guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. 
I like them. I think they're cute. I would definitely have I would have a Sphinx. It just reminds me of the, well, it's actually not the same, but I always think of the, we are Siamese, if you please. Oh, you guys almost said Pon Pon. No, I've always wanted, oh, they're big fluffy cats. But at the end of the day, I, I don't think I'll ever go back to getting a purebred. I definitely think I'll just, I, I don't think I really even want kittens anymore. I think if I do end up getting a cat after Ginger, I'll most likely be an old lady. Um, oh, what are they called? No, no, not, th those are, uh, those are massive cats. No, I'm so No, it's not a Maine Coon. No, it's not, it's not a Bengal, it's not a Maine Coon, it's, um, no, they're big and fluffy. Not rag dolls, but oh my gosh, when I, uh, when I first moved away from home, I lived with a roommate and she had a rag doll. They just absolutely melt in your hands. It's so... They feel like that kind of like putty that just kind of like, whoa. No, it's not a lion. It's not a Persian. No. No, not a British. Norwegian forest cat. Sir Shucky, yes. Norwegian forest cats. Look them up. They're some of the most beautiful cats I've ever seen. I just want a fluffy kitty, but I don't want the long hair associated with it. I actually. <laughs> oh, snap. I actually don't think that I would do a. Another cat. I might get a golden retriever. I want a big golden retriever to match my energy. Then we'll just be two golden retrievers together. Ruby, what's up? Ah! Sorry. Yeah, I um, likeways, likeways. Yeah, those look really cool. The likeways, they're like the semi almost hairless cats. They look like werewolves. Yes. Hey. Look where you're going. I'm not even trying oh, anymore. That's it. Yeah. Got a tip from a concerned civilian. Oh, no, Head no. over there and do what y'all gotta do. Holy cow, this weapon's nice. Yeah, I need a chihuahua. Oh. No. No, I don't I like I like bigger dogs versus smaller dogs. A mastiff? The Norwegian forest cats. Yeah, but I think um I think they're not as big. Maine Coons are pretty big cats. They're pretty massive. I don't know. Mm -hmm. All right, activate, imprint, and wait for the boo-boo boys. Let me wait for my uh, stars to go off. I had a cockapoo. That was the dog that we had growing up. It was a cockapoo. Cocker, spaniel, and poodle. Make sure. Uh, like a medium-sized dog. Oh my gosh, the constipation person. You know, I really think it's that person. Oh, let's do this. I actually think we need to figure out. Whoa. He's a beast. Push, push. Why are you saying push, push? <laughs> he really is constipated. Yeah, I want to see if it's, I want to see if it's this person. Okay. Was it him the whole time? He bashed him with a skull crushed by a heavy object. This is what happens when you go too hard at the gym. Oh, Shadow, by the way, wait, wait, London with the thousand bits. I saw Triv say jetpack and Shadow with the 500 bits. I cannot believe you guys right now. Can I take the weight off of his head? Let me see. Oh, it could have been. No, it wasn't this guy either. I used to want huskies, but I think huskies need, they need a lot of training and attention. I think it's why I've always kind of steered clear of dogs. It's like having an adult cat and she does have crazy like orange girl energy at times, but having like an adult cat, it's so nice and easy. Like she, she's so, it's just, it's the best of like both worlds. It's like you have a pet, but they don't require as much attention. Like she does, like anytime she wants attention, I give it to her, but she's not very needy. And I feel like it's a lot easier to take care of her now that she's older than when she was younger. 
But she also is in great health too. She's a senior citizen pet. It's the best, it's the best. Also bear, no, do not start this. Bear with a thousand bits as well. Dogs require so much attention. And like, there is a part of me that loves, you know, taking them for walks and things like that, but I don't have a backyard. And so I'd really like to be able to have a backyard for some of those lazy days that, you know, you do just want to kind of let them run free in the backyard or something like that. Mm. Older animals are so sweet and they just want to give and receive love. I think the only like the only drawback to it is obviously if you do go to a shelter and you get an older animal, you have to be patient with them because you never know what kind of environment they experienced before. And that can greatly influence how they react to you, how they react to um, certain genders or uh, kids versus adults and everything. And so you just have to be a lot more open to giving them patience and understanding. Let's see. When she was three, I didn't want a kitten. Yeah, three, three or four is a great age because you do avoid the kitten stage. Absolutely. What do you want from me? Mhm. Mm Just like Bun. Bun is a great example. Yeah. I mean, we talked about that when we did the cat's protection stream. Bun is a very like. Bun is a big product of her upbringing, absolutely. But she's such a sweet. She's such a sweet cat. Like she cuddled me after a little bit, and then one minute she bought me on the face. So. Uh, Time to go, Cuban. But it was entirely based off of, I think, her previous experience. And then also think about all the... Activate imprint. Okay, here we go. Oh. Bun. <laughs> Bun is actually really cute. I felt so blessed. Also, something about an animal that's really choosy with who they love, it makes you feel 10 times, like, more valued. You're like, oh my gosh, they've chosen me. They've imprinted on me. Yeah. Yes, yes, I'd like somewhere like that, JJ, yeah. Dressed in, thank you for the follow, by the way. Mm. She's very clingy. But in a, like, I think in a good way, too. But a lot of pets, too. I, I think a lot of pets, when they're older, they are definitely prone to separation anxiety as well. Um, Probably because... not a good time to take Aguilar for a walk. <sighs> no. The bun's thin. All right, let's try to be cool. Ah, cool. Allez, ça c'est pas territoire. Hmm. Find a way to get rid of the voodoo boys. You know, let's talk. I have good news. We will talk. I will not shed your blood. A very good deal. Think about the. Moi fou t'avais you. Is it Iago you await? He's not coming. Havana has removed him from the picture. Mm. Catella? Is it la? Here, oh, they yes. didn't know who I was. But I have no quarrel with you. What happens next is your choice. Jacob Feb. He pral rencontre sal merite. Oh. Asse. Pavoli. On alle. The steamy bun, white bearded, yes. Nice. And you guys think that everything ends in violence with me. There you go. I would say good job. Mm-hmm. Bo. Bo's a cute name. A rare non-violent encounter. 20 cool is OP. 20 cool, 20 tech. Y'all good? Character development. Wait for my arc. It's coming. Gotta wait for the man. Out in mm -hmm. the open. Ah, want a face off, do you? Aguilar, you saucy senorita. <laughs> Why do I feel like it kind of likes me in this form? Spicy. You saucy senorita. There they are. Darth, it's because I have Darth's the FIA. Got no clue what's coming. I've changed my um, I'm gonna shed a tear. appearance and voice. We have no background info to sell that we are Aguilar. Something ain't right, boss. And you are... <clears throat> I answer with my own question. Oh. Do you know what happens when someone in Havana lights a cigar? Somewhere in the world, Aguilar takes a life. Yeah. So they say. Do you know what else they say? That you have angered the wrong people. We know of your plan to oust Bennett. We know of your new allies. 
The Voodoo Boys? Poor choice. My superiors follow Christ, Yago. I... I never intended any disrespect. What happens now? Oh, do you value- Oh my god, this is such a cool quest! <laughs> You'll resume your place. You'll disappear, never to be found. Do you value your life? Let's keep playing up the cool um, points. I spoke with the voodoos. They understood their lives are worth more. Now I speak with you and wonder about the value of yours. Hawkeye, still DLC for Ayla, like another please. hour. It's another not hour. what you think. May I explain at least? Talk, talk, talk. Wasted time, wasted breath. Such a shame. Charlie! What? Really? Think your hot shit. Prove it. Oh! Oh, shit. No, no, no. I thought I was going pacifist, but... You... Yeah, yeah, Hawk. So the legends are true. Point taken. I'll back down. But there's something you should know. Bennett is Arasaka's pawn. Mm. They aim to control Dogtown through him. You think that Mr. Hands knows that? Mr. Hands knows nearly everything. You have proof of Bennett's deception, I trust. Know where to find it. He goes to the city center often, Republic Way. The building's a <laughs> front. Rand, I Occupied agree. by a dummy corp owned by Arasaka. As to Bennett's biz there, ask him. Press him. You'll see him, right? Hmm. Plot thickens. Once they're gone, uncloak for your face melts like scarp Chaco. Uh, <laughs> I'm just getting started. Just getting started, Johnny. Guess you ought to keep hands in the loop. Thanks or for you. we could see what his favorite son's cooking up with fucking Arasaka. After all, Dogtown's mm -hmm. future hangs in the balance. We're still on it. Deactivate imprint. Well played, Aguilar. High five me on Monarch Obana. Good job. Welcome back in. This is going to be a good quest. Oh, absolutely. Oh, yes. Also, Junks, thank you for the follow. Classy with the 100 bits. That was a satisfying skull split sound. Okay, come on. Too far, Classy. Come on. Luke, thank you for the 500 bits as well. You're like, what? That was too far for me. You did this quest so differently. I didn't even realize that option was available. That's wild. I'm so... I do want to meet with Bennett before Kurt Hansen wakes up. Before Kurt Hansen's wake, he is not waking up. Let me just fix that. He's definitely not waking up from what we did to him. <laughs> Luke, thank you so much. Yes, Hawkeye, if you're still here, we uh, probably have another hour. He's not waking up. Definitely not waking up after that one. I don't know. We could just call Mr. Hansen and end it here. Do I want to know more? But it's not like I want Arasaka to have more power, so we need to. He's taking a dirt nap. He's gone for good. He's not coming back. Oh. Not bad. It's a zombie game now. It turns into Last of Us. Whee! Oh. I need to work on my drifting in this game. It's not doing too hot. Oh my goodness. Get a life. Anon, thank you for the gifted sub to KC Shuffle. <laughs> Shuffle, welcome back in. Also, I think I saw a Texas shrimp. This is just on the outside. Good morning. Okay. Oh! <laughs> choo choo, crash, crash. Spazzy with 100 bits. What, how many crashes are we at? Getting closer to 1,000 with every day. I must just be letting- I think I'm just caring less and less Yo. about crashing. Hmm. There's no way I'm gonna have like 170 by then. No shot. That shot- that does not count as a crash. I played GTA like a long, long time ago. Long, long time ago. I've been called out. <laughs> Doesn't count. Those aren't crashes, those are like... Love taps. Mm-hmm. Screw it, you're almost at a thousand. I'm not trying to, though. I just kind of stopped caring as much. I feel like I look at chat more now than ever. 
Excuse me. This is going to be a wild mission. The insurance company would beg to differ. How many times has Millie gotten reworked? At least 10 times. A fender bender is still a garage. Not if you don't catch me. Move. Brother. Okay, I'm going on the wrong side. Oh no, I'm truly heavy raining this right now. 20 a day? I would say probably 20 a day. Gotta make sure the bumper is fixed on properly. Hold on, I gotta cut over. Yeet! Hold on, oh, don't, 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 no. Uh, wow, there's a traffic jam up ahead. Never seen that much traffic. What's going on here? It must be for the wake. We need to cut across the street. That way we don't have to deal with that traffic jam. Excuse me. Millie! <laughs> or maybe you never catch up to it. I think it's actually fake. Yeah, look, the lights are going away. Move! Oh my goodness, people. Crazy, weaving into you. Jeez. Maybe it's an earlier accident. An earlier accident that I caused? It probably has been closer to 2K. Zen's been very forgiving of a lot of my crashes. <laughs> Everyone in the other car is just screaming. <laughs> it is kind of cool how they make it seem like there's a lot more traffic on the road, and then as you get closer, it kind of disappears. <laughs> oh my gosh, that person had a near-death experience. <laughs> oh, the light flashed before their eyes. Here we go. Why is there a scam trip? <laughs> It has not been a million. I will give it that we're well over a thousand. All right, I'm here. There's a lot of minor ones that we just forgive. Hmm. Wait a minute. Right here. All right, let's check this out. Oh, there we go. We need to make sure that we don't save over. Wait a minute. I don't think we're gonna save over anything. I think we're fine. I think I'm good. <laughs> I had a word with Bennett. All right, let me pop a squad. Judgy, Judgy, thank you for the five gifted. Thank you for five more gift. No. Thank you so much. Also, baseball. Thanks for the hydrate. I oh, know. I have a couple saves. Just a few. Judgy, thank you so much. Just a few. Mm-hmm. William, hi. Doors off the car are standard. If I have doors on Millie, it's a strange event. Ain't our guy that. Probably his hustle. Take him out now, just in case. Save yourself the headache later. <sighs> okay. Judgy coming in clutch. <laughs> Is that one too many saves? Let me see. How many hours do we have in the game? We should roast road trace for old time's sake. Obey immediately. Oh. oh gosh. I was just here. trying to get behind you. I just I just I want to grab oh ow, okay. Sorry. Tell me what I go on to. Dump the body oh. stat, then wait oh. for Bennett in the ride. Get the jump on. Oh, okay. I'm just fully taking on whatever he says. Basically, we'd have to complete the game before the save file grew too large or it wouldn't function anymore. I guess we'll wait for him. My, my, hi, welcome back in. Here, here we go, here we go. I think we're on the same page. They agreed to back me. Two unmarked tactical units in Dogtown. In Dogtown. Oh, we like him already. In Dogtown. Gordon, let's roll. Gordon, let's but roll. What a grind. Japanese suits have their neckties tied so fucking. Wait, who? <laughs> the music. Oh, fuck. Aguilar. I love the music. Did you have a good meeting? Do you know how Colombians tie their ties? So you know now how the Japanese tie their neckties. 
Do you know the Colombian way? He's freaking the out. The Colombians cut open your neck, pull your tongue out through the hole. It sounds complicated, but I've had plenty of practice. Aguilar, please, listen to me. I know what this must look like. This fuckhead Yago. Your accountant. Hmm. He's trying to cut me out. Arasaka's promised to have my back. All they want in exchange is access to our smuggling routes. They never just no. want one thing in What exchange. they seek is control of your smuggling routes. Only a fool would think otherwise. Truly. I don't think he's fit to lead Dogtown either. I'm out to secure the future. For my organization. For your bosses. Which kind of tactic do we want to take? Shadow, thank you for the 500 bits too. Darth Garth and also Rank, you guys. Thanks for the follow. Uh, that was a country frat accent. I think we should just say, what if Yago weren't a problem? And if Yago was not a problem? Perhaps I've spoken to him already. Perhaps he has realized the error of his ways. A slippery leech, that one. I know a lie when I hear one. I know Yago did not lie. He will support you, as will I. <laughs> well, now that's a different story. One Cuban in my corner is worth more than ten Arasaka boardrooms. Agreed. We have a deal. I'll forget about the Japanese. Hmm. One last question. Oh. Where the fuck is my driver? You should forget about him. Too. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's crazy seeing the influence and the power and the fear of just one person. All right, step away and deactivate Aguilar's imprint. Well, that ain't bad. Clean work, Aguilar. Time for a breather, though. <sighs> Hopefully he actually stands by it, though. Yeah. V never gets that. Nobody ever gets scared of me. They should be more scared of me, but they never do. London, guys. Anderil, thank you for seven months. Shadow, thank you for 500 bits. And London, stop trying to make this hype train happen. Don't know. We're not saving it. We're not doing this. London, thank you for the five gifted subs. Guys, if you've gotten a gifted sub, I hope you appreciate it and you enjoy it. No, the uh, guys, it's time to call Mr. Hands. Shadow. V. Guys, thank you so much. As Yago reconsidered. As indeed. Also, voodoo boys are out of the equation. Splendid. Have you anything else to add? Met with Bennett too. Do we even tell him? I have transparency. Classy bear. Hey, Nan, thank you for the gift of the surreal. Rob. Consents, I'm 411. Guys, thank you for all the gifted subs. Y'all... London, do you see what you started? London, do you see what you did? An uprising. Absolute uprising. Yup. Met with Bennett, too. Man's a sock puppet. Sock his hand up his ass. Oh. Don't worry. I pulled him off, ironed him out. For good, I hope. Huh. It's not something I asked you to do. But I do appreciate it. That's the show I go the extra Bennett mile. is still superior to Yago as a candidate. Mm-hmm. When now? Time to pay tribute to the fallen. Aguilar will attend Hanson's funeral service and ensure a smooth tribute. transfer of power. Uh-huh. Sounds like you expect trouble. Such events can trigger geysers of raw emotion. Mm-hmm. No two people grieve alike, and rarely rationally. I love this. Ceremony his and wake word both choice at too. the Black Sapphire. Aguilar should enter without a hitch. Got it. Leroy more. Vive Leroy. Good luck, V. Good luck, V. Trivial with the gifted sub to scam tram conductor as well from the troll biscuit himself. All right, let me see this triple. Yes, absolutely. Thanks for hanging around and enjoy the lurk. All right, let's go attend this wake. Yeah? Kelly. Mr. Hands, I always felt like I had this pull to him very early on in the game, too. Absolutely. It's weird to see a hype train going without Pond Pod. Kelly, with five more gifted subs to the channel and community as well. You guys get one Pond Pond a session if it's not on. Sorry. 
It didn't happen. It's not fun fun. Friday night fire fight. None of them are really doing it for me. You're listening. Maybe like a little Night FM. Do we ever listen to Night FM? Kelly, thank you so much. All of you guys. Ritual sounds kind of sussy. The sus was. Why? What did the songs on it? Obi Wan, welcome in. By the way, welcome back in. Camper from hell. Hi. I wish after you completed the DLC, you'd get to hear that music. Like you get to have a separate radio that kind of comes on. Or the songs just join onto one of, like, maybe on Growl Radio. Did a car just disappear? The Weechies. Let... <laughs> Bad? No, Kelly. The Weechies. Trivial. Trivial. Now I know something's up. You're here. Oh, I took the wrong what exit. The Everything's fine. Trivial, thank you for the three gifted subs. Rob! Rob with the thousand bits. Trivial with three gifted subs. You guys, why is there a second scam tram? That's the longest song. Hmm. It was at the stoplight and then it got Thanos snapped. I didn't see her. Man, these songs are really hanging on. I like De Nero. Also, Orion, hi. Wait. Another Orion. What? All right, we're headed to the Black Sapphire. We probably... Oh, no, no, no. We don't need to change our outfit. Sartorial, hi. <laughs> Every time Pompon is mentioned, Rocky. Rocky with the 200 bits. Dirge makes you think of FF7? Wait, why? Which song? Big man doing big man things. I've guys, I've tried like twice and pompon's not popping on. I am going to grant you guys your one pompon play, but it's just not happening. Good morning, night city. This is gonna be a long one too because we're still doing DLC content. We haven't even gone towards the dates. Oh. There we go. Jasmine. Jasmine. Guys. Jasmine with a thousand bits as well. Pretend it's a pon pon sound alert. Judgy also with the gifted sub to Noah's Raptor. Get your pom pom bits out of here. Shadow also with 500 pom pom bits. Scam tram team. The Weechies. <laughs> Cannot. But. Okay, we should be good. I think we can just waltz in. Do I have this? Do I have enough? Thank you, thank you, thank you. For the love of Ginger, safe. Good, 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 good. Rough around the edges, but he shows potential. I think I'm still Aguilar. Oh, I thought it was for a second. I want na 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 na. You can't park here. You can't sit with us. No. Bear. Yanks. Yanks the 200 bits. Bear with the thousand pon pon bits. Why is there a level five scam tram? London, thank you for five gifted subs as well. Get. Let it die. Let it die. The final act. Hansen's wake. Enter Aguilar. Shit, V. Got me on the edge of my seat. Activate implant. Activate implant. Oh, gotcha. Get this show on the road. This is a good... I like this mission. I do think this is a good kind of clean up to the whole situation in Dogtown. All right, we got this. Hennessy, welcome back in. Guys, thank you. Which don't... 
It was four number, four number dono alert. Here, let me see this. I'm trying to see it. I can't do it. DC, mister, thank you for the follow. DC, wait, I feel like I should run to the bathroom right now before. Yeah. I feel like before we kind of enter into this last bit, because we have this and then one more gig and then we're going to move on to the dates. Yeah, DC, thank you for 10 gifted subs to the channel and community. I'm sorry, I'm hydrating so much. Ah, random people just getting subs now. I'm telling you, people who have never even been to the channel, they don't even know about the community. They don't know about the channel. They get gifted a sub. You guys are truly bananas. DC, thank you so much. Okay, I'm gonna run to the bathroom. I'm gonna fill up my water, kind of just do like a midway check, and then we'll uh, we'll keep going. Also, original Leo, welcome in. Wait, or original? Wait, wait, original EO. I think it's original EO. Had to follow and sub. Your approach to gaming is refreshing. Join the Discord and community immediately. Welcome me as I'm glad to hear that. I'm really glad that you felt welcomed right away. And annoyed I just find you don't be, no, trust me. Like me before I went full time, you don't need to see it. You don't need to see it. I really appreciate the kind words and thank you for popping in and not only supporting me on the YouTube side, but also on, on the stream side of things, on the live side. So thank you so much and good guys. This is what I was saying to you guys at the beginning. Like you guys are so warm and welcoming to anybody who pops in here. Um, and it's just incredible to see the generosity, the kindness and just the unbridled joy that you guys bring to other people so thank y'all thank y'all so much guilty welcome it okay let me fill up my water use the bathroom and then we'll get started on the latter half we got lots of things to do he's almost here all right oh no oh no everything's dropping on the ground all right read the message from the unknown sender did you guys behave bye Big chair doing big things. Wait, is that song on right now? No, you guys are just left in silence. Classy. The, the hype train is still going. Jasmine, beat ups. <laughs> what? Y'all. Guys, thank you so much. I didn't do it. You did it. Bear, Jasmine. Guys, thank you. Hex and Lord Farquaad. Guys, thank you for the follows. Yes. Yeah, a lot of people came from Final Fantasy Original. Like, you were truly among friends. Cactus. Guys. What in the world? Anon with the gifted sub to JJ. Thundercrack? Even Thundercrack gifting a sub to the channel and community as well. And Cactus. Cactus, welcome back in. And thank you for 20 gifted subs to the channel and community. Y'all, Michael, Michael, a patch. Thank you for the follow, Amish. What is so up with you guys today? I say that Fridays are crazy. Saturdays, absolutely unhinged. Amish with ten more gifted subs. Cactus. I hate when there's not like an alert or anything that pops off with it. Anon, thank you for the gifted sub to Big Danny as well. And baseballs. Today is Monday. Today is Monday. There's no stream Monday. Jasmine, do not fill Overzealous's void here. We're not trying to summon Reaper. Amish, thank you so much for 10 gifted subs. Cactus. I'm sorry, but I can't look at a cactus the same way after the Cactuars. I truly... We'll never look at a cactuar the same way. It was a total Tonberry moment. I haven't even told you guys about this, but Tonberry. Finally, you finished it. Did you finish building your PC? And Sponge, thank you for the gifted sub to the channel and community as well. Y'all are truly the most generous community I absolutely have ever seen. Bear, how do you remember their name? How do you remember their username? It, it, you built it and it actually works as well. That's awesome to hear. Wait, you have to post a picture, please. Absolutely. I long to see another kitty get adopted by Maggie somehow. Not till after Ginger. Michael, Sponge, Anon. Guys, thank you so much. Yeah, uh, I had a Cactuar Tonberry moment. Mm hmm. It was lovely. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What will I do now? Hmm. I 
I feel like I can't read it. Read the message. Read the message. You remember names and- but that's not just a name, that's like a number too. Quick, she's muted. I'm not muted. Judgy, funny, funny. I guess- I guess I'm gonna- yeah. I'll keep moving into position. What? No estoy de humor. Oh, here we go. Usually I just lurk, but I do love this community. Y'all are so welcoming and big thanks y'all for that. Big Daddy, thank you for sharing that. And I say this all the time. Also, Lig, welcome back in too. I say this all the time, but you guys are a major reason why people stick around. Like the kindness and generosity that just goes beyond this community is incredible. Welcome to the Black Sapphire. Hope you uh, had a pleasant flight. Thank you for coming. Don't talk to me. Don't, and then, and then here I am, don't talk to me. Anon, also with the gifted sub to my my, I don't know if there's anybody left who is not a sub, you guys. Got some men lined up for the op. Mm -hmm. Hold on. Yeah. Hmm? Spazzy, yeah, Spazzy's changed his color. His color's been like that for a little bit now. Mm-hmm. Where? Absolutely. Big Daddy, right. thank you so much for sharing that, by the way. Mr. Quackleton, hello. You stick around for the bake sales, Eric? Yeah. This is actually a really cool atmosphere. It's been a while Shit. since the last time we were at the Black Sapphire. Don't ask why. Hmm. I strike fear into people's hearts. I swear. Rob, R. Kelly. So Last person left. Rob with the gift of sub to Mick Quackleton. We're not welcoming people, we're trapping people. <laughs> Somehow I believe this too. I really do. And Baron, thank you for three months of continual support as well. And welcome back in. Anon with the gifted sub to Lie. Lie. Major Tool. Major Tool, welcome back in. And thank you for 10 gifted subs as well. <laughs> Legend, 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 I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes and anybody that has gotten a gifted sub from anybody here. What the heck? I'm Gunkus in the Discord. I did see somebody had popped in. Somebody had popped in and said that they, uh, they had come from YouTube. I'm not sure if it was you. I need to go back through and look. Judgy. Major Tool, thank you so much. And Judgy, what did you say about five more gifted subs? I thought you said you were done. Oh, they did do nice flowers. Okay. We well, need to judge this based or judge this one compared to Jackie's. This is our second wake that we've been to. Dogtown income reports. Outstanding taxes collected. Owner of the moth has closed the bar until further notice, but she is good for the money. Voodoo boys. Solvency problems. Solvency problems. Expect issues due to Slider's death. She's closed the bar. That's a small little, yeah. Poor Reed. I didn't do it. A9. Guys, thank you for another hype train. A level eight hype train as well. Darth Garth, you're from YouTube too. Anybody who's popped over from YouTube. Was it from the Let's Play channel or from the archive? I do like the flowers. So people are just coming in and... Human cartel? I did Here? Could get interesting. You were saying? Mm-hmm. I have a burning desire to like stick to this pathways. This pathways, this pathway. <sighs> right ahead. Oh, wow. Aguilar. They completely transformed this. For all of us. Actually, I would say this is kind of a modest funeral considering. This is how you bid your leader farewell? Under the circumstance, mm -hmm. I expected more. Pomp. Pomp. Well, we did what we could. What felt right. Mm-hmm. Take me to Bennett. He came with extra security. Got a bad feeling. I need to follow Yago. I took too big of a bite. No, not a brownie. These unreal coconut bars, I'm obsessed. Mm-hmm. 
It's like just enough chocolate, but I do it for the coconut. I just am obsessed with it. Wow. You know, they, they picked a decent picture. Even in his dress blues, he still had his dog tags sticking out. Hmm. I do like the flowers. I wonder if we recognize anybody. Judgy is fully embracing the one of us. Absolutely. Mm-hmm. Dead Elf, welcome Aquabar. back in as well. What a... Surprise. I understand you've met. There's no such thing as too much coconut, I agree. Havana sends its condolences. Havana sends its condolences. And I'm leaning the on the- of Colonel Hansen's death shook us all. I'm sure the Colonel would appreciate your goodwill. You're dismissed. I met earlier with the Lieutenant Colonel. We had a lovely conversation talking of this and that. This In is end, so weird. We both agreed Dogtown needs a strong leader. That leader will be Bennett. The people here heed his words, as will you, Yago. Oh, until when? Until you leave town and he's free to stab me in the back? Oh? I want names, contacts, connections. Your informants in the NCPD, everyone on your payroll. The lighting, the Ridiculous. reflection of like. Hansen's. You will prove your loyalty to me. A fair price, Yago. One will pay. You do not get a new toy, Bennett. Ooh, I do feel like I should kind of... I feel like... <sighs> I kind of want to do this one. Because I do feel like... I don't know. He moved his eyes to... Big baby Bennett wants a new toy? Something to silence his tantrums? I just want to remind him that he's Too not going to get bad. everything he wants. The terms cannot change, Bennett. Yago would form resentment too if... if he, yeah. I just think Yago could be maybe a loose cannon. And I feel like if we go too hard, like, one way... Then they're going to be more no unpredictable. Deal. Wait, 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 let's talk. We've talked enough. Never mind, control I messed yourself, up. Bennett. I am in control. Oh my, oh, oh. No one moves a goddamn inch or you join Yago. Yes, sir. Really, Bennett? Right now, Looks to like undermine me. You got left. Give Havana my regards. The die is cast. Oh my goodness, this is such an epic scene with that in the background and everything. Uh, maybe I should have showed some firepower. Okay, maybe my attempts. To, every time I attempt not to kill people, they end up dying by my choices. The die is cast. Colonel. Leave the scumbag's corpse there for now. It can serve as a warning. Damn. Well, I gotta say, I can't wait to see what happens if you talk to Yago there. Instead. Damn. The die is cast. <laughs> what color? Someone's always gonna die, I suppose. Yeah, but I think it would be only a matter of time before Yago would try to do something just to kind of act out against Bennett. I don't know. I think that would have resulted in death regardless. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Doggy it's dog not... world, I guess. What's that make dog town? A warning to you, Silverhand. Mm -hmm. One you will heed. It's not the modern... Mm, hold on. I feel like he still has more to say. How did that end for you guys? Well, don't actually tell me, because I feel like I will be able to get a different ending next time. I'm always getting people killed. That seems appropriate for a Dogtown funeral. That somehow seems... Yeah, don't actually answer that. Yeah, it's not oversensitive. My mods are doing everything they can to back me up. So when you question my mods, you question me. So... 
I would remind you guys to respect them. They do a lot of stuff that you guys can't even always see on the like forefront. So please re show them respect. All right, we're leaving the Black Sapphire. I thought Johnny would say more there, honestly. So, do we know yet? If y'all go had any goodies, but I guess he didn't You're show up. Here anytime, Aquilar. No, I. I always have a table ready. I think that he probably Curtis was giving him the benefit Take of the doubt. Bow, v. Had our fun, but it's time we sent Aguilar off with a heartfelt adios. Hmm. All right, so we take this off one last time and then maybe we see Mr. Hands. I wonder how Mr. Hands' response is gonna be this. Mm-hmm. Adios, Aguilar. It's been real. Deactivate Aguilar's imprint. Call Mr. Hands. Let's see what he says. Samba, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. The word is Dogtown has a new alpha. And you really think you can keep this one on a leash? You were Bennett's an apex predator. Gonna make a fine new handsome. And Yago will never challenge again. Shame all his contacts went to the grave with him. Regrettable as oversights go, V. Did what I could. Mm, Things I did what I did. Hand. Did what I could, though. Did you now? When I hire a pro, I expect professionalism. For anything less, I pay less. I trust that's clear. That'll be all for now. I'll be in touch. Fair enough. That's fair enough. Okay. Yeah, I got a little slap on the wrist, but it is what it is. I know. I know. Unknown number, service error, corrupted message. Meet. We return to the place that reminds me of home and see what you find. What? Return to the place that reminds me of home and see what you find. So me. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I know exactly what she's talking about. A slap on the wrist by Mr. Hands, how poetic. Guys. Invalid number. Message not sent. Guys, I think she's still alive. I think she actually survived everything. I haven't gotten to Cyberpunk too many games. I know, there's so many games. I, I know. I was thinking about that. I'm, I'm truly excited to be able to get through a couple of shorter games after this. Because we have taken, but I mean, I haven't regretted a single ounce of time that we've given to this. Yeah. This is huge. It makes me feel like it all wasn't for nothing. If she actually did survive and she's safe on the moon. Search. There's something here. Something for us. Dragon's Dogma. No, a lot of people are talking about talking about that. Search the area provided. Mm. Roz, I might. Also classy, you have a great day with the family. Thank you for hanging around. And I hope to see you tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow is the finale. Tomorrow is, I think, like to kind of circle back to your question, Roz, I'm gonna try to do just at least one of Reed's, maybe one part of Reed's ending uh, tomorrow, depending on how long Nocturne is. It has to be this. No, that was the relic. User, I have an important message for you. Oh, skip it. Say anything to continue. <laughs> anything. <laughs> Automated response. Ha ha ha. The joke gets funnier the more you say it. Well, here's our skippy While quest. While a routine diagnostic check, I discovered a file with my owner's metadata. Name, Regina Jones. User, please return me to my... Regina? Thank you in advance. Wait, really? Okay. Okay, I'll take you to Regina. Gladly. Regina, you take your... You best user I know. June, I'm the only user, you know. <laughs> Your memory got wiped. No kidding. Slappy, fact, it is slappy. There is a 92% probability Regina Jones will reward oh. you. I'm going to be that 8% though, let's be honest. 
machine gun tracking. So there's our final quest with Scrappy. Scappy. Wait, Skippy. Skippy, Scrappy, Slappy. But that's not our mission. Wait, there it is. There it is. Metal pin. Collect the cont uh, collect the contents of the container. Okay. I guess I just go into my backpack. Is it in my backpack? Whoa, there's a lot of also random things over here that I did not even see. There's too much to do. Hold on. Inventory, backpack. Entire clothing store in your backpack. I have so many things. I need to store some. What did she exactly give us? No, these are grenades. Attachments. Filters. Um, all of it. No. Where is it? Floppy pickle. Is it a body mod? A metal pin souvenir from the lunar colony of Tycho. How can you see that though? Did it say it on it? My cyberware? Behavioral imprint? No, it wasn't this one. Which one? It's in the backpack and I missed it. She also gave us an implant. For what part? Also force. Welcome in. It's a head slot. On an operating system. Frontal cortex. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. Quantum tuner. Whenever another cyberware implant is fully used, the quantum tuner instantly restores its cooldown. Wow. And then the pin is... Look again in the stash. I guess in... It's not in the junk. I guess in the entire stash? Did you guys see it somewhere and I missed it? There! That's it. A souvenir from the lunar city of Tycho. And we can't, like, look at it close or anything. It wasn't for nothing. That's amazing. Uh, collect the contents of the container from her to eternity. From her to eternity. What's the whole collect the contents? Is there something else? Maybe there's something else that I'm missing? That's the container in use preserved. Lunar dust! Lunar dust. I'm missing something. I think I collected everything though. Yeah, first time watching your stream. Thank you for tuning in, and I'm glad to see you're enjoying your time here. I think it's bugged, yeah. Mm. I'm so happy. Let's try this one. Might be bugged after this. Yeah, I thought I did collect everything. Dallas Stu and Alka, guys, thank you for the follows, and welcome in Enforce. Thank you for the follows. Well, I'm glad that you've been enjoying your time here. Uh, nope. Okay, I'm glitching out. Okay, hold on. Here we go. Let me scan it first. Maybe if I scan, because it does say search the area first. There it is. She made it. <coughs> Ow! From her to eternity. Yeah, I'm really happy with my outcome with her. I'm, like, it was... Re I guess, like, the only thing I wish we could have gotten around was not killing Reed, but I'm so happy for Somi, and I'm just glad that somebody was able to make it out of all of this alive. Um, I do have the Skippy quest. Machine gun, I do. And we officially have one more thing left for the heaviest of hearts. We need to meet with Michael. Michael! Michael! Let's see. Just meet with Michael. Michael? Michael clung to various jobs, but jobs somehow never really clung to Michael. Years ago, when he landed a job repairing Militech AVs, he thought his Californian dream would finally come true. The come down was painful. A mistake resulting in a crash, compensation for a paralyzed corpo who survived the accident, disciplinary action. 
Things went from bad to worse. He moved to Haywood, opened an auto repair shop, and fell into bankruptcy. Then it was odd jobs here and there, cleaning mega blocks and guarding parking lots, with episodes of alcoholic haze in between. When his wife finally decided she'd have enough, took their son and left. Michael, I, just, I will never unhear it as Michael, decided to start fresh. He scammed a friend out of a loan, fled to Dogtown, and opened a slot machine parlor. The time has come. Wait, wait, this time things will work out, right? Hmm. Uh, all of the- I knew I did that, I did that. I did eat OG and also MB and Neuro, guys. Thank you for the follows. Thank you for so many follows, guys. Welcome in. We are cleaning up the rest of the, uh, the rest of the DLC, and then we're moving on to finishing main game. Yeah, it's instantly giving, uh, don't hug me, I'm scared. That's my goal. Let's check this out. Also, I appreciate it, Maxi. Thank you. Yeah, let me go ahead and do another hard save. Holy cow, is that 160? No, we're so close. We're five minutes away from 160 hours. I think we'll end up being about 180 by the time we end. Maybe 170. 175, 180. Michael, I know, I know. <laughs> Every time that I say it. Mm. My hips. Here we go. If you've ever thought of starting a family, the video I would from advise you to think twice. See, my client Michael Maldonado did not, and had a son that seems to cause him oh so much woe indeed. Oh <laughs> no. The matter's a rather delicate one. Michael wants to talk it over in person with you, and you alone. I favor clients with fewer question marks over their heads, but Maldonado offered extra. Thus, an exception was made. Hey, Mikey, this is I'd like you to see him. My see again. what this is about. Details he attached. Can't play like this, Video man. from Somi. When no. are you finally gonna fix it? There's no Mrs. I Ham. Just yesterday, but wait. Ah, uh, my bad. Next uh, day, scabs are trying okay. to bring back dinosaurs over here in the Gorn Organotopia. This guy, I, I did not think that he would really be messaging us this much. Julian's Eddie's pouring into the hood here, revitalizing and crap. Old Ronnie's got some dust in his eyes just thinking about it. Mm. Oh, you said Mrs. But you meant Your cat just threw your controller to the ground. Who knows the possible in this day and age? You ask me, ain't nothing out of reach. Later. Okay. That's not Michael. Michael's right there. Okay. Michael. Let me look at the journal and see everything it says. I've been informed that this is a delicate matter. Despite how mundane it sounds, Michael has been blessed with two things that can go together many a time. A son and trouble. He will inform you of the exact nature of the assistance he requires. All I can tell you at this point is that Michael is willing to compensate you and me surprisingly well for the better. Wait, for the bother. Do visit him and learn about the nature of his job. He runs a business. He seems to never leave unattended. You know how it is, V. Those that possess very little are the most afraid to lose whatever they have. You're Which there. means he wants us to I go outside. A quick game. I mean, he did ask. Hanson. Uh, Michael Maldonado? V. Hand said you needed a... I mean... A hand or something. Oh, it's you. Over here. Let's talk. <gasps> the quad racer? Have we done the quad racer one? I don't think we have. I don't think you can. Glad you could make it. Fixer said you can turn around even the most hopeless of cases. <laughs> How hopeless are we talking? Hopeless? It's about my son, Eric. Boy runs a motorcycle repair shop in Haywood. Totally legit operation. Taxes, permits, you name it. But this DA, Georgina Zembinski, she needs her pound Zembinski. of flesh. Wants to turn him into an example. That's where you come in. He's got the high score. Oh, I've been watching Suits. I think we can defend this. I think we can do this. First things first. This DA, Zembinski. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What's the deal? She's as crooked as they come, like everyone else in Night City. Zembinski said she's after some Valentino kingpin. Hector Sacristan was the name, I think. Hector. What's Eric got to do with it? Word is he knows Sacristan. Has heaps of dirt that could bring him down. But for that, she needs Eric behind bars. So, she forced me to testify. Now I need you to make it 
Go away. Go away? She forced you? Tell me more about Eric. So it's so Mentioned good. he sells two-wheelers. Fixes them. Little go-getter owns a repair shop in Haywood now. Yeah. Moved out of dog town with his mother years ago. Hardly seen the kids since. Sure your son's who he says he is? Eric? He's too innocent for this town. That's why they're fixing to take him down. Hmm, I do want to ask about that. You testified against your own son, though. I do want to inquire about that. You testified against your own son? What kind of father does that? It ain't like you think, okay? I... I really didn't want to. She showed me her so-called evidence against Eric. Wanted me to corroborate it. He believed it? It was bullshit. Every last word. So... Two days later, came back with some badge. Beat the shit out of me. Threatened uh... worse for Eric. Then they... Put me in front of a camera and I... I told them what they wanted to hear. I was fucking scared. I can see that. Like, I think that is a terrifying just position to be in. Go talk to her. You know, the way you people do. Eric's a good kid. He'll get eaten alive in prison. So you know I don't talk to people, right? I'll see what I can do. Not if I have anything to say. All right, fine. Gonna find her. Have ourselves a little chat. <sighs> That's a relief. No hands would endorse me some bush nigger. You'll find her at the Heavy Hearts Club. Perfect place for plotting and scheming. And you know that how? That's where she invited me for her... Heart to heart. Heart to heart. Sounds about right. But first... Okay, so we'll do that. But, uh... <clears throat> it's been a while. Really, Plutendo? I would run head first into an operating room after watching Grey's Anatomy. Are you kidding me? You managed to convince Reed to let Somi go? You have a killer argument. That's just done dirty. That's just wrong. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Jump. I, I forget how to do this in the first place. What's my uh, What's my glitch? Oh, right. Double tap for glitch. Yeah, Blue Tendo is an absolute joke. Uh-huh. Double jump. Oh, that was close already. Oh my gosh. What do you mean this is the best game ever? I missed it. Plus, we kicked Siri's butt. I don't know. We'll see. I doubt I can get a new high score, guys. That was another level. I was an absolute fiend when I got that. I was juiced up. No, that's not Red Bull. <laughs> no, it's just um, a poppy. Oh, gosh. I really wanted to get that. We need apples and carrots. Apples and carrots. Ding, ding, ding. It's nice to know you can row trace in the DLC, though. 20 points. That's probably one of my best. Four hours later. Feels like such a long time. I'm telling you, like, it feels like a lifetime ago that I discovered this game and started playing the game in general. No, I can't do... Oh, Operation Sim. We're going to do an Operator Sim. Mm-hmm. We need to be careful of the crows. You guys know how I feel about the crows. We need to get to my favorite level. All right, we're glitching. We're glitching. I'm glitching. Where's the white claws? <laughs> I should probably. I actually kind of want to get some white claws for my birthday. White claws and Outlast with my best friends and y'all. I mean, I don't think I can ask for anything better on my birthday. The crows. The crows. Diablo, hello. Mm. Mubs, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. You know, somehow this doesn't feel as intense as it once was, but maybe that's because I hold the high score. I think it's always easy on the flip side. You say Alani's for my birthday? No. I don't think I need any excess energy. Although this month has not felt like... I feel like I normally am doing a lot more stuff for my birthday month. It's been a very relaxing month. Oh! No, it's going to be perfect because we'll do, I'll do my stream in the morning. Wait, I'm just, I'm freaking out. Hold on. Um, I've got stream in the morning with you guys getting to play Outlast Trials with Anna and Jess on stream with y'all. And then some of my, some of my in-person friends are, are going to take me out. 
So it'll be nice. Be a day full of friends. A hundred and <laughs> my 111th birthday. Oh no! I still have the high score. Okay, just one more, just one more because I really feel like I'm onto it. I'm on, I'm onto it. Savage life, welcome in. I love your FF7 videos. Thank you so much for popping over to the left side and for sharing that. I'm glad that you're enjoying the playthrough so much. Thank you. You're only young once. Oh my gosh, I'm missing everything. We might as well restart. Mm-hmm. Celebrate your birthday the right way with Corey. I still have to, ah! I still need to decide what to do during like the beginning because the beginning I just kind of want to hang out with you guys. I can't do a whole like stream about last trials. I would cry. It's kind of brutal. This is actually the worst score that I've ever had into the first round. But you know what? There's always room for a comeback. Oh. Yeah, Atlas Trials is really good. I've been more obsessed with it than DBD lately. Birthday means for a rebirth? Birthday means rebirth time. But rebirth is actually, there will be a video on my birthday for rebirth. I think we should do a hidden objects game, personally. <laughs> ah! Jackbox games. I think like those are, they're not a bad idea, but it, it can be difficult to moderate like what is said or things that happen. We'll probably do a little bit of, a mm, little bit of marbles. No, I don't want to start like as fun as it would kind of be just to try something like Subnautica or things like that. I really don't want to. Also, Boobamon, welcome back in. I don't want to start something that y'all would really want to see me finish. So I'm either just going to play Fable. I know the Friday before, like this whole next week is just going to be Fable while we finish that. Maybe I'll start like Lego Lord of the Rings or Gollum. I guess we could actually try Gollum on my birthday. It'd be kind of fun. Marbles, you're giving us a present on your birthday. Well, you guys often come in here on your birthdays and give presents to the community. So I feel like for my birthday, it'd be nice to... Oh, come on. I'm washed up. I'm washed up. I know I have the high score, but I want to beat my high score. You'll uninstall Gollum within three hours. Mark my words. Well, that's good because then... All right, just one more, but I mean it. No, that's perfect. Because I think Anna and Jess are going to join me about halfway through the stream. For our last trials. Well, I was thinking we could start one of the Legos because that is what I want to do after Fable. Like, whatever we do play after, so like Knights of the Old Republic, right? We're still going to do... Nice, I got my carrot. I got my carrot. We're still going to do like Thursday cozy streams. Okay, this is good. This is good. Young and naive V versus traumatized Merc V. Is that the difference? <laughs> yeah, Voldemort. Oh, Abyss, absolutely. It's incredible. Also, why does it feel like the lights just went down? Stinger, thank you for the follow. And Jesper. Thanks for the hydrate. Nice. I built a Hogwarts castle. It's so dope. In which one? Wait, for what thing? Marbles and Gala means the best birthday stream ever. I mean, we could always go back to Bloonies. We could do... I wonder if it's as scary the second time around. I mean, I feel like scary games are always the scariest right off the bat, like with your first playthrough. Yeah, Dimmy, it is. I think somebody said they added this in the two point something patch. And you get a kick ass outfit if you get number one. It's so worth it. We also got a lot of money back in the day from winning this. No, because people are going to want to see Subnautica because it, the birthday stream like goes up on the archive. The moment that we upload the video from the birthday stream and if I play Subnautica, it is going to be a non non-stop flood of people saying, when are you finishing Subnautica? When is it going? And then you guys will have won and you'll get what you asked for. I've done Alien Isolation. That could be kind of fun. 
not Madison too. I've got to just decide what to do. Oh wait, there was a really fun game called Kitty Heist that London just gifted and I was kind of, I think it could be kind of fun. Never let Twitch chat win, Silas. Never fall for it. Of course I know you guys too well. Yes, Abyss Watchers, I have watched the anime. It actually has impacted a lot of my choices. All right, we're killing it, we're killing it. <sighs> Need to get more. Halo, if you insist. No. Never. I really wanted to do Need for Speed Underground. Such a bummer. I also could possibly go back to Banjo 2E. What pairs nicely with Outlast Trials, so though? That's the thing. I somehow Banjo Two, Banjo Two E doesn't quite go as well. Bub, thanks for the hydrate, and also Abo, thank you for the follow and welcome in. Mental chess, I'm constantly playing mental chess with you guys. It's all a game. It was only just a dream. Did we not do Chicken Feet DLC? Do I still have that, Spazzy? Do I still need to do that? We could play like these cute cat games that I've wanted to do. Like there's cat games where we can just like, I don't know, I kind of want to, kind of want to play Cat Gets Medieval still. I want to have full playthroughs of those available on the Archive channel because I think that I just, I'm absolutely in love with everything they created and I want to support them so that they keep creating more games. I wonder if they tease that they're doing another one. Uh, <laughs> the carrot making the horse go ass up. <laughs> Face down ass up. February. Ooh. February, thank you so much for the follow and welcome in. There's cat games that I've yet to finish, yeah. Yeah. So many options. We'll just kind of play it by ear. DBD. A DBD dating sim might pair well with it. What does that even mean? What is a DBD dating sim? Find my Michael Myers. <laughs> All right, guys, the crows are completely batsy right now. Hold on. This is where everything goes to crap. These crows are not messing around anymore. The music gets insane. The crows are coming. I just love his face, just the head bob. Things are getting scary. <laughs> Date the killers. Only if Jess pops into, Whoa! no, I meant to, ah. see what I mean? Those pesky crows, they get you every time. Ah. I still have the number one high score. Could I get it again? No. Thought the game title was wrong, then I remembered this is in Cyberpunk. The Roach Race, actually. Oh, I don't think of that one. Yes, Jay, it is a complete Witcher, Witcher, uh, Witcher play. The Quad Racer, we can't do either. So wait, 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 what is this? So you be the killer. Hey. Oh, and you so wait, are you talking about tunneling? Are you saying you're basically saying you should tunnel somebody? Okay, I need to get out of here. This is getting creepy. Should add a traitor survivor. You can escape if you help the killer. Like a little bit of like mafia. The pesky bird. I'm telling you the crows. Bah? All right, we need to go into avoid raising the alarm, by the way. Need for Speed Underground within here. Bear with the gifted sub to Let Me Out Games. You remember? Bear, thank you for the gifted sub to Let Me Out Games. And also, Anon, thank you for the gifted sub to Jay. I'm so in love with their games and I do want to finish them. Ah, uh, Let Me Out. They're so good. Did anybody ever go back through and re like play all of it when they gifted the community all of those free copies? Like it. Relax. Okay, so we should be here. I think we just need to go. Hold on. Here, over here. Yeah. Mm. 
that's terrifying enough just having the killer chase you, let alone other people. If we can find, like, another way in, I guess we need to take the main route. Here we go. There we go. Cliff Bar, welcome back in. Yeah, and Anon, thank you so much for the gift of sub to Jay. Jay, I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes and the community. You might be stuck now. All right, avoid. Okay, here we go. Avoid raising the alarm. We just got to play it cool. Just get with it. Sound alerts are disabled. Yeah, mister. Yeah, just during uh, the gameplay. Yep, you yep, yep. By yourself? Where's Walt? Mm. Thank you for the 100 bits. No, I do need to save again. Oh, man. The heaviest of hearts. This is going to... Okay, so we just need to ask around to find Regina George. No chance in Regina George. I bet there's someone to ask here. Here we go. Looking for a customer of yours? Mm. DA Georgina Zimbinski. Yeah, you streamer mode's turning off the music. I do. But if she's some kind of big shot, probably find her in the booth. Have to ask Jack, though. And him you'll find in the can. As Handsome in, like, Jack. The shitter? That can? Mm-hmm. Where he does his biz. Where the magic happens. Sorry, what? Maybe he'll know her. Uh, okay. Thanks. You try Stop trying to make fetch happen. Optimus, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. Welcome back in. You take one ride in the faceplate, then we rake Thank in you the so much. Where the magic happens? Listen, You're Jack. Real biz that biotechnica suit's right? supposed to come tomorrow. And now? You know. Sunflower guy. Hey, Sunflower guy. What's good? Looking for something? Uh. They say you know folks upstairs? Looking for someone. You know Girl someone? Girl Bar told me you're the go to. Man guy. Nah. Helen needs to learn to keep her trap shut. Oh. Georgina Zimbinski. Night City DA. Ring any bells? Nah. I could have called upstairs and asked, though. Sad. Missed you opportunity to be handsome, Jack. Oh, slow down. Times it is an all that jazz. Do you what I'm saying? Yep. All right, hopefully it's worth it. I'm willing to pay it at this point in time. I've sat on the story a little bit, and I actually feel a lot better about my decision. Interested yeah. or not? Yeah. Don't make me regret it. Hey, no risk, no reward, right? Hey, baby, I'm looking for a clan of ours. Georgina Zimbinski. Mm. Yeah, right. Okay, I can't thanks. pay, I'm broke. Am I? I was like, wait. My girl I saw am, her. actually. Say she's schmoozing with some heavy hitters. Booth four. I'll check it out. Thanks. All right, booth four. Hello, Find a way. Georgina Zimbinski. Yeah. Careful with that one. Lawyers are not to be trusted. Yeah. There are any kinds of people worthy of your trust? Also true. Of course. Sound technicians. <laughs> Calm down. That also sounds very much like Johnny. Mm-hmm. Objection. VIP room. Go this way. We're gonna have to get past that person, but we should be fine. Well, that's where we... No, yeah, we'll be fine. Just need to not catch their eye. We're good, we're good, we're good. Leo and Roskills, guys, thanks for the follows, and Anon, thank you for the gifted sub to Diablo and to Silas as well. Objection? It completely changes the mood in here without a song playing. Let go of me! What gives you the right? Oh. Oh. Okay, let's try to You're sneak in. You're done here. Finished. I'll make damn sure of it. What happened? What happened? What happened? Hell does it look like? Shit bags threw me out of VIP. Because? Shithead bouncers don't know who they're dealing with. They're gonna throw me out? Me? me? Yeah. Why would they kick you out? Why'd they kick you out? Well, um, some loser wouldn't stop bothering me, so I bashed his head against the bar a little too hard. That's fair. Said I was sorry, and I was. Doesn't give security the right to ride me so hard. Can't you... Pump up? I don't know. Straighten it out somehow? Oh, 
<laughs> I'll straighten it out, all right. Next time I see the manager, I'll have those fuckers fired. Thank gosh. If you're important enough, they'll back down. Did my fair share of VIP treatment. Bouncers get it wrong sometimes. Just go there, tell them who you are. Bound to get an apology, at least. You some kind of shrink now? <laughs> Works for me, is all I'm saying. Bullshit! So why do you waltz in behind the bar and have them carry your VIP ass upstairs? Cause I'm done waltz dealing with those Neanderthals. The now somebody get me a fucking drink! Jeez, okay. Well, at that rate, I think we should actually throw him out. So he said go behind the bar? A way to get in. Hmm. I'm thinking... Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let me check out the other side. Drinks on the house. I think I could... Oh snap. Oh no. This is what happens. This is what happens. I try to see. Gosh. Well, I said it was kind of quiet in here, so I wanted some music. I tried. I really did try. Oh, he's got a cyber. Cyberware? Got him. No music, fine, I'll make my own. Weapon glitch is fine. VIP room number four? Anybody? All right, I don't think they failed that. Tech ability? Just kind of steal stuff, it's fine. All right, they're not coming up here. I don't think this is room number four. Are you peeing in that plant? Oh, okay. A job's a job. That's not for me. Drink, for fuck's sake! That blood splatter's not me. <clears throat> Ow. Gotta water the plants. Got something nice and big for you! <clears throat> well, <gasps> as tempting as that is, we need to find VIP room number four. Would it not have been this one? That's two. Three. Ah, four. Four's on the other side. It must be. Four. Here we go. Close <laughs> it, close it, close it. I don't look around. She's not here. Hands is gonna be... Yeah, Hands is... Hands... Uh, uh, it's our last mission for him. It'll be fine. It'll buff out. Alright, well, she's not here. It's a little bit on the... Maybe there's something to look for? Maybe five. Maybe we got told the wrong one. That looks like her. <laughs> You're good. You're free to go. You're free to go. Go. Is anybody Regina? Not Regina. Oh my goodness. Staff only. I feel like I've been lied to. <sighs> you couldn't hold yourself to doing stealth this mission? It's difficult. It's really hard to get behind everybody. Let's see, I think. Okay, that's a lot of eyes on. A lot of eyes on. 
Well, if we take out everybody in the club, then we'll find her, right? Should be good. It's beefy boy, hold on. Let's do overheat, kill that person. Switch to Black Widow, or Widowmaker. Same, same. <laughs> Top side, behind the bar. Tossing it back one! Oh my gosh. <laughs> ah. Gas grenades. <laughs> oh my goodness. If this is where it gets morally questionable. If this is it. All right, VIP area, find Regina. Anybody else? Anything else? I was in room number four. After getting rid of your cyber deck. You were too stubborn to... There's still more people finding stuff. Oh, it's that. There is still a room with a couple of people. Was Regina? Tracing my location, hold on. Room 18, stop. Stop. Oh my gosh, no, this is too far. This isn't it either. We know what we're gonna find with room 18. Let me turn this up. Huh, all right, everybody's cleared out of here. No eyewitnesses. Regina's not in four. Johnny popped up in here, so unless she's hiding, or unless there's something that shows there's like a back room to a back room, I'm not seeing anything. Now it's just holograms. They're tracing my location. Saf, Drunken, and Gamer, guys, thanks for the follows, and my as well. Huh. This looks promising. Oh. This is promising. Open that, open that door. She's on! All right, Regina should be down here. This is like the only way it could be. Let's see if I can, oh, if you can get back here, you can definitely turn off security. So it's probably possible to do stealth, right? The pew pew is so good. He returned to surveillance system. Let's turn those off. Uh, I guess I could use the surveillance system to maybe find her. Ginger. What, baby? Room four, booked for G. Zabinski. Corporate booking for three, confidential. Book from McCormick. We have two confirmed VIPs. Visit the Heavy Hearts this week. And see big dogs. Yeah, Gingy's outside. Another random hangout upstairs. Someone else's VIP card last night. I kindly remind you to pay attention to who comes up. No. You actually stealth this? <coughs> oh, I'm sure it's possible. I would love to, I think in my free time, kind of try to do a stealth mission. I know, I see you, baby, I see you. Well, this is where, um, this is, oh, I see, yeah, because you could go back here and you could turn off everything. The stealth takeover, hold on, let me let her in before she gets impatient. you for the five gifted subs and TJ it was a second it was a second oh my god 
goodness. Oh my goodness. Say thank you, TJ. Thank you, Bear. Say thank you. You feel like very chunky right now. Did you just eat? You just ate dinner? She says, I just ate my dinner. Bear and TJ, guys, thank you for the five gifted subs. You look so cute today. Did you get your nappies? You got your nappies? Did you get sunshine? You're happy. She's full happy girl. Yes. London, thank you for the three gifted subs to the channel and community as well. Yeah, she's back to 100%. Her eye looks great. Her eye's fine. We didn't have to take her to the vet. Say we cured it all on our own. She did good. You did good. You feel so cuddly right now. Oh, I love her so much. Do you want treats? You, she just already feels like she ate too much. You feel bloated. The scratchy face. You feel bloated? All right, let me see. I don't know. I don't think she's that interested in them. She's indifferent. She's indifferent. Wait. She's indifferent today. Huh? Let me see. Let me just see. Yeah, she wants all the it. She probably just wants scratches. I would figure she doesn't even want treats today. Let me see. Just one. She says, I mean, if you put a treat in my mouth. <laughs> oh, you dropped it. You dropped it. Okay, you don't want treats. She doesn't. She just wants cuddles. She just wants attention and cuddles. You just want all the cuddles. All right, but I got to play this game. I might need to floppy pickle where this woman is because I don't know where she is. Can you help me find her? And point on the map where she is? Mm-hmm. She just wants love, but treats are sweet. I think she probably just ate. She feels, you know when you like feel your cat's tummy and they feel like they just kind of are bloating from dinner? I think she just isn't hungry right now. Yeah. Avis, what's up? Welcome back in. You just want to smell the treats and drop them for you to eat later. Yeah. You are shedding so much hair. I'm going to drop it. Look, I still have her hair ball from the other day. Cuddles 2077. How do you have the cutest face ever? You have such a cute face. I love cats so much. I love them. I love orange cats. I know. She's grumpy. It's like she simultaneously wants to hang out and not. What do you want? Oh, you're going to. Oh, you're going to. All right. Are you good? Avis 2077? Cyberpunk? I'm assuming like when you tune into stream, is it just, is it not always show what game somebody's playing when you tune into stream on mobile? Is that why some people don't see what you're playing? Yeah. Tonio's eye. It shows even on mobile. Mm. Okay. Can I get back to the game? I'm gonna get back to the game. British short hair, they're so cute. They're pretty cute as well. It shows even on mobile. You know where I'm going with this. You know where I'm going with this. Mm hmm Okay. I'm gonna let you go. Don't get mad at me. Don't get mad at me. You have to go. Um, have to go. You gotta go. Aliens. I see a big dude. I don't think you guys are gonna be able to see the alien. No seen alien. No aliens. No aliens. You gotta go. You gotta, you gotta go. Girl, you gotta go. Oh my goodness. You wanna hang out? I don't have treats for you. She wants treats. She wants them. All right. Let's see if she hangs out here for a little bit. Hoping for many more years with her. Oh, absolutely. I hope so. I can only hope for many more years with her. Oh, these DLC missions don't mess around. Why not put her on a bed next to you so she feels close to you? Um, well, I don't have a bed next to me for starters, but she doesn't really like cat beds or anything. I've tried before, but um, she mostly just comes in just to like know that she can get attention from me. And then I feel like she just kind of leaves, kind of moves on. Yeah. She's gone. Yeah, she gone. She's licking herself. She's like, Mom, you have nasty, like, lip gloss on. You're disgusting. Get it off of me. All right, let's see. Cats like windows and stairs. Exactly. And neither do I have either. 
All right. She wants our attention too. She will soak up as much attention as people will give her. Are you kidding me? She wants as much as possible. Um, I guess at this point, do I leave because I messed that up? I just feel like, exactly, exactly. Bear, thank you for the three gifted subs too. Fountain of Youth, pretty much. Hmm. I'm just gonna dance like a psycho. Oh yeah, I hadn't floppy pickled yet. Gray beard, no. No. Is it on the other side? I guess I never looked at the other side. Well. Oh, I remember where we came out here. She's here for the long run. That's why, because if you read it, it said that it switched it up. So they kept thinking it was room four. Mm -hmm. Wow, I never looked at these. Restroom. Room six. That'll do. That will do. It do be like that. We're working on it. Or is it Seems we have a visitor. Told you those pops wasn't the music. Those pops. Well, there was no music, so. Who are you? Georgina Zimbinski. Need to talk to you about Michael Maldonado. That drunk? What about him? Mm. Claims he was forced to testify against his son. Need you to wipe it. He wants me to. That cowardly two-faced sack of shit. Five See? more cheese. Told you he couldn't be trusted. What exactly did he tell you? Hans is totally watching from the cameras and just like, what is this amateur hour that's happening? Your thug tortured Michael, forced him to testify. Not the talkative type, are you? You're good here. Forced Mike Maldonado mm -hmm. to testify. Is it Rogue's VA? she means you, Hank. Did you do any shock therapy on Mr. Maldonado recently? Yeah, like I don't got better things to do. Kidnapping, extortion, arson, armed yeah. robbery. Guess whose rap sheet that is? Eric Maldonado is textbook ganger scum. He belongs in prison. He just <laughs> needed someone to help him get there. Get out of his here. His father, Michael, didn't think twice about choosing Eddie's over his lowlife son. Hmm, who is Hector? Sorry, I'm trying to give her love while the pain Who's attention. Hector Sacristan? One of the Valentino's top men. Narco millionaire, serial murderer. Two years I've been after him. Eric Maldonado, mm -hmm. he's the last domino. But if I want to use him, I need him behind bars. All right. Also, Lig, thank you so much for four months of continual support. I appreciated the penguin and cyberpunk in the wrong chats. Wait, for which part? I feel like I'm talking to a wall. That justifies forging testimonies. So Eric's sure past one. justifies forging testimonies? Teach you that at law school? This is the real world. You want justice? Mm. Need to nudge it in the right direction. Oh, okay. Maldonado doesn't care about his son. He's scared Eric will find out it was his old man who snitched on him. Of course I can make it so that never happens. I'm listening. Why don't you watch Michael's testimony first? Witness the truth yourself. Hmm. I don't know if we should. I see you, baby. I see you. Final question. On May 16th of last year, Eric Maldonado contacted you by holocall. During your conversation, he admitted that Hector Sacristan shot and killed Marcos Ferreira. He also stated that Sacristan ordered Ferreira's body to be dumped in the Coronado Bay. Which Eric did. Can you confirm this is what Eric told you? I... Yes. Yes, I confirm. Excellent, thank you. That will be all. Michael didn't bat an eye when he accepted payment for that testimony. Real entrepreneur. I'll cut right to the chase. I'm offering to anonymize Michael's testimony. Eric will never be the wiser. And if I refuse? Wouldn't advise it. Wouldn't be, uh... Safe. You. you know how I feel when somebody threatens me, guys. 
delete the testimony. But Michael's account on it was that he felt strong armed, you know, like he felt like he was kind of backed into a corner and make up your mind. ended up saying what they wanted to hear. And I just, yeah, I feel like I keep getting thrown into these situations. I don't want to have to answer. Shadow, I'm going to head out as well. I have family coming over. Absolutely. Thank you so much for hanging around. And I hope we see you tomorrow for the finale. <laughs> Tomorrow's the finale. And Biotics, thank you for almost four whole years, too. Make Just dropping by for a bit. What's up, everybody? Biotics, thank you so much. I don't want to make deals with them, though. I feel like it's shady, and I don't trust it. Mike hired me to do a job. Intend to see it through. Besides, I think you're full of shit. Full of shit? Me? I just showed you proof. Showed me one piece that fits your narrative. Not nearly enough. Mm. The testimony. Now. I'm afraid that won't be possible. Let's try this in a language you really want understand. to? Are you sure? Hank? Uh, beast my Oh, I have enough strength! <laughs> want you to stop and think. <laughs> Said me but never. But how many years you have left till you retire. About how I could speed that up. Dealt with far worse than the likes of you. Compared to them. Getting rid of you would be like oh swatting a fly. Oh my goodness. Um, <clears throat> hey, Georgina. Why am I yelling? really don't feel like dying today. Not over some piss-ass testimony. Uh, really, Hank? You and I need to have a talk later. It's all sus across the board. Link, welcome back in. There. One, two, yeah. Deleted and gone. How do we know we don't have backups? Thanks. Backups to backups. I don't know. I did what Michael paid. Now, Mr. Mr. Ham's got Michael as a client. I don't think, I don't think all the money that Michael's gonna give them is going to pay for all the damage that I just caused to this. Oh yeah, why is this guy in Night City here, honestly? Oh my gosh, look, I, I don't wanna fight, I don't wanna fight. I don't wanna fight. I don't wanna die. I'm out. I sometimes wish Ginger. Okay, give me a second, baby. Hold on. Michael. I think we need to go down and talk to Michael. Yeah, return to Michael. Oh my gosh, they're everywhere. I gotta scoop my boot. Can you go to Michael? Somebody just messaged me. Michael has informed me you'll be visiting the Heavy Hearts to deal with business. I would only remind you, it is my place of business as well, so... V! <laughs> How'd it go? Ginger, give me a second. I'm finally gonna get a good night's sleep. It's done. It's done. Testimony's gone for good. <laughs> and so is my relationship uh, with so Mr. Hands. My shoulders. Go on. Pay me with the eddies you got for selling your son down the river. Yeah. Hi. Oh, shit. Count yourself lucky you've only got me to deal with, Mikey. Just... Just go. Mm. Was dirty all around. Gig, heaviest of hearts. That was, that was. Mr. Hans is not about to be happy. I don't think he's gonna give us anything. We'll see, he might call in a second. Okay. Go, 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 go. I love you. I'll give you lots of cuddles later. Mr. Hans? Oh no, bear! I was gone for a second was faster than Lightning McQueen, come on. Michael, oh gosh. Uh, Michael had nothing but praise for you. I hope the feeling is mutual and the contract was smooth sailing. Okay. Bear, thank you for five more gifted subs. You've just been crazy today. It would have been better, however, if you'd adhered to my instructions and acted with discretion. Perhaps next time, contract closed. <laughs> At least I went to uh, I went to text. I didn't have to deal with his voice. So we should get a message from him that says, you're the best of the best around. Pleasure doing business. And I have a present for you. Oh, I got off so easy. I think it's because we didn't hear him. Whoa. I think it's because we didn't hear him over the phone, I'm assuming. I would assume this entire DLC. It's one uncomfortable choice after another. But that's it, guys. That's... 
I think, I think that's it. 10 out of 10. Which means it is time for blistering love. Oh, this is going to be good. There's four missions left, guys. Oh, we should actually go ahead and do, let's go talk. To, I, I don't think I'm going to have to go back and see Mr. Hands. So let me, yeah, drop Skippy off. That will give us three missions left. I know blistering love is going to open up into more missions as well, but for the meantime, I don't care too, too much. Phantom Liberty is done. Unless... Yeah, because I think if you get... All I see someone values our partnership highly, so much so in fact that I've run fresh out of jobs for you here in Dogtown. Excellent work, the kind that deserves reward. Please pay me a visit. We'll say our goodbyes properly. Hi ho, silver lining. I believe you know where to find me. It's a good thing Mr. Hands wants to, Mr. Hands wants to see us. Wait for the Heavy Hearts Club to open? Oh, come on. All right, let's skip time. Yeah. Thank you, Spazzy. We still have time to install a mod to remove Pon Pon from the game. We still have time. Once per stream, then you turn it off, but we haven't done our once per stream. We still have a little bit more. I couldn't wait for you. Gotta give time for everybody in the club to respawn. <laughs> that probably is what's happening right now. It's still not open. Uh, I think you might be onto something. Can never take the song seriously when it plays on the radio. It feels like kids bop for cyberpunk. Mm. I will say Yago's influence is sorely missed. Certain items of business must be dealt with on the fly. However, Bennett has risen, risen to the, risen to the occasion, maintained peace and a, uh, well, let's call it an organized consensus. Smooth transfer of power. Well done, V. Go to a different area. We'll go Skippy. I think let's just, we might as well just drop off Skippy and then come back. Mm, one gig to rule them all. We'll fast travel back to, don't worry, don't worry. I'm going to drive to Skippy. And then we're going to fast travel back. Okay. I'm surprised they're letting me back into the club too. I think I still have his good graces for now. Ah! Wake the fuck up, patrol. Civilians are acting up again. Transmitting cord. He threw myself. Yeah, yeah, he threw himself, Andrea. Thank you. All right, Millie, you stay here. I gotta hide. I gotta hide. Hide by the bar guest. All right, let it go. It's fine. <laughs> laughing, laughing. Thank you for the hundred bits. The anteater tongue? The game said it, not me. This is the game, not me. So, you need to map to the next thing. I cannot believe this. You can like ramp up it. It is. I don't know what the dog mayo is from. Oh, is it for Dogtown Mayo? Was it because we were talking about Dogtown Mayo? Yeah, I think we were talking about Dogtown Mayo. Vert, can you explain that one? Half these tags I don't remember because there's something said in passing. Hot dogs, yes. Yes, hot dogs with mayo. That's right. Yes, that's what it is. 
Yes. Ah! Wow. That doesn't count as a crash. Yeah, because we saw mayo in front of a hot dog stand, and I told you guys, I was like, I don't know about a hot dog. A hot dog with mayo just seems unnatural. Before the game is over, I'd love to see how you handle the maximum stars. I've never been able to survive long enough to see. I've done four stars. I don't know if I've ever had five stars. Mario, thanks for the follow. Hey, Non, thank you for the gift. It's up to Wacky as well. Yeah. Mesotos, welcome in. I missed cream and creamed another guy. Is that one of my tags? What are my tags right now? What are my tags? It has not been a tag for a couple months now. Mustard and onions on a hot dog? I like mustard on a dog. I like mustard with my fries though, too. That's good. Metamorphosis. Spazzy. Unlicensed driver POV. Prominent, yeah, prominent pedestrian flower. Sounds right. Moral compass on vacation. Sounds right. Sorry. Big Millie style. Cyber crabs. All right. Wait, wait, wait. So that is not one. Okay, no, no, we're good. We're good. Yeah. <laughs> Non-stop infinite pom-pom forever. I see you've added a new one, Bert. Call three 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 cast a crush. Did Millie the Menace personally attack you as well? JJ, thanks for the posture check. Oh. Mustard and fried egg is good. Uh, I kind of picture that as like whenever I have a scotch egg, I like to have like some kind of like mustard on top of it. So it doesn't sound that crazy. Actually craving a scotch egg now. Did you not see the car at the stop? No, it's crazy. When I look at chat, it's like my eyes go off of the game. It's somehow... I can't look at both at the same time. Scotch eggs are so good. Dowsy, thank you for the follow. JJ, I gotta like really posture check this. It's getting ranged with the tone of the song. I'm just craving scotch. <laughs> Screw the egg, I just want the scotch. <laughs> Celebrity stabs. Scotch eggs are so good. It's like a ah! it's like a boiled egg wrapped with like sausage and crumbs. Like oh, I don't know. How to, it's so oh, it's so good. You have to look it up. Scotch and eggs. Oi! Sorry. I got away. No pedestrians were harmed in the making of this. Excuse me? Everybody move! Yep. Bear with the gifted sub to distracted driver. Whose fault do you think that is? Whose fault? I thought she was about to flip off of that. Oh my gosh, I'm on fire, I'm on fire, I'm on fire. I'm on fire. Okay, let me see. Yes. All right, Regina. Ma'am. The 13th floor too. Yes, slightly distracted. I know. I know that Cyberpunk 2077 cars have bad brakes, but does Kasten know that you're supposed to use them for them to work? Beehawks, brakes do not exist. Okay, we only go as fast as possible. Why use brakes? I'm limited to brakes in real life, so when I play a game, I just want to just full send. Just launch it. All right, Regina, I think I have somebody that's yours. V. 
Hey, the name's oh, Skippy. Oh, I wish I could Ring have talked balls. to her about more things. Fits in a holster, more than a little psycho. You have Skip? Little bastard got swiped a while back. You like Let me Skippy? See him. Really? She likes the pacifist version on him. Let's see how you're doing. Run diagnostics. Performance, 82%. Puppy loving Memory pacifist, damaged. permanent lock. Mode, puppy loving mm. pacifist, permanent lock. Permanent lock? Mm, something's gone. She might like us better Return because to factory it's settings. This settings. Please set pistol name. Mmm, Daisy. You can you can just factory reset like that. My name is Daisy. What? Where do you get him Wait, from? Where'd you get this iron anyway? You could just factory reset. Yeah, knew a guy. Everyone called him Danish. Great techie. I mean, before he started hitting the bottle. Skippy. Anyway, poker game. Danish cleaned out his cred chip, then bet his gun. I think you can put together the rest. Mm. The combat features are great, but why the voice interface? You know, weird as hell. What if the real breaks are the cars we met along the way? You killed him. You killed Skippy. Come on. It's just an algorithm. <gasps> Not a shred of consciousness. Regina. I'm not so sure. He he had a personality. Yeah. Works. Mannerisms. Bum, bum, mm -hmm. beat him. Protocol bum, errors. Bum. A good hard reset always helps. So? Something for my trouble? Sure. Here you go. Feels kind of weird now. It's too. That's more money quiet. than what we get for oh, a gig from Mr. Hands. Maybe you should get a dog. Maybe, someday. See you, Reggie. Wow. That was a lot of, a lot of creds. Nice. R.I.P. Skippy. I I wish um I miss Brendan more than Skippy. I did this. I shouldn't have turned at him, and I condemned him to now being called Daisy. Daisy. Daisy Buchanan. Now she Regina. No. That's two for two, Skippy. And Yago. I'm just getting everybody killed in this playthrough. Truly. Okay, so we want to go to fast travel mode. There we go. All right, Millie. You recover. I think you've had enough of me. I did finally get rid of him. Look, Skippy was not my favorite. Okay, not my favorite. We went to So Me's secret place. Yeah, we went to... Are you talking about where we pick up the stuff? Yeah, we went to her her favorite spot. Okay, now let's go to Golden Pacifica. Let me save too, hard save. Mm-hmm. Someone on Reddit got a tattoo of Meet Hanako at Embers. What? <laughs> because of how long it took? Ah... Don't forget to go to the Ripper Dock to install the gift from her. Do I really want it, though? I like the things that I already have. Uh, I did get a message from Somi, yeah, and she told me to go back to where she... Well, let me do this. Unless there's something I get from putting on the thing, the attachment that she gave us. Dude, what get if the, the attachment... Back, what if... The attachment that it gives you allows you to... Do the... The black wall kind of settings? If it doesn't work now, look for a place to rest nearby. What do you mean? As in like to go to bed? Like to sleep? What color was I? Luke, you were green. You were green. Like a bench? Okay. Oh, because it, it might not still be. Oh, I see where. Is it because it's still? Okay. Are you talking about because... Well, let me see if it's open. Shouldn't it be open after that? I'm about to finish run 12, but I don't know what ending to do. Haven't, if this is your 12th run, don't you think, haven't you done everything? Nice, it's open. Are we hard saved? Well, everybody's back to usual. They don't seem to be pissed off at me, so uh, we're good to go. All right, guys, we are meeting Mr. Hands, and then we're going to go on a date with Johnny. Well, with Rogue as Johnny. Smile and wave. Was it, it was green, right? It was definitely green. 
<laughs> or was it orange? No, I think it was green. Stewway, welcome back in. They really did clean up the place. Memories. Heard Netwatch is on the prowl, sniffing around here lately. They I'm spackled certain over. I have no idea what you're talking about. Unfortunately, this thing I know nothing about is a problem for the VDBs. So much so, district power consumption has dropped by half. Voodoo's troubles keeping you up at night? Mm. Mr. Hands, the altruist. No. Disruptions to the status the way quo keep no. me up at night. No. My concern grows when the seeds of chaos are sown. It's bad for business. So what's this you got for me? V, you're Dorothy. Dropped into a foreign land. Huh. You faced many obstacles and overcome them to see Hansen's Emerald City. Metaphor's esoteric at best. Going anywhere with it? Only toward a happy conclusion. The grenade. <laughs> You've labored diligently and earned your reward. Your very own silver slippers. Silver slippers? They were, um, actually, I'm pretty sure, isn't that the story with Dorothy? Is it wasn't actually red slippers, it was silver slippers, I thought. By silver slippers, you mean... A fitting end to our tale. Something that will spare you home slippers. safely. Silver you know in the book. I mean when you see what I'm talking about. I thought so. Soon. Yeah. Yeah. No, they were ruby slippers in the movie adaptation, but yeah, I, I, I vaguely remember hearing that they weren't always ruby. Just give me my reward. Tick tock. Time waits for no one. Oh, the parts cast, don't you? What's your role in the story? Why the narrator, of course. <laughs> Figured as much. <laughs> Sounds about right. Right. Well. Your silver slippers await outside. I mm. wish you safe travels, V. It's been interesting, if not to say peculiar. So that's it for our biz together? Who can say? For the time being, it certainly is. Please, no tears. And one last thing. Be <laughs> wary of witches, the wicked, and the, and good. the good. Until next time, V. Yep. Till then, hands. I have been changed for the better. Alright, leave heavy hearts. Because I knew you. Yeah, they were silver in the book, but they made them red in the movie so they'd show up clearer against the yellow brick road. Okay, so I didn't know that tidbit. I didn't know that there was like an actual reason behind it. I didn't know if it was like the dramatization of it or maybe because it showed up better. Because it was originally black and white for a long time. Wait, or was it one of the first colorized films? Mm. Silver lining. Silver slippers. It was always colored. Police squad in color. That get get in the car. It's a car. We lost everything. That's a car. She's not a car girl. Whatever. Ah, fine. The wing is you. It's the shark car. <laughs> it was black and white in Kansas and went to color in Oz. There was a piece of it that was black and white. Okay, yeah, because it wasn't, was it even quite black and white or was it kind of like that sepia kind of color? Yeah. Holy cow, y'all, look. Three. It was one of the earliest colorized versions. It started in black and white. Uh, fairy, we, uh, perfect timing. We literally just tied up all stuff with the DLC. So we are officially moving on to Endgame. We are going to Blistering Love and then moving on from there. Raven, thank you for the follow as well. Should have been a silver truck. I... Yeah, especially if you're going to call it a... Well, I guess it makes sense for being a bullet, but... Silver slipper. <sighs> okay. A truck? I would have used. For sure. Yeah. Why not do the other DLC ending before doing the main game endings? Um, I think... 
I know you guys want to see the other ending. I think that there's a lot of me that wants to be able to emotionally put myself back in there. And I just think that it's still too soon. I mean, it's as fresh as yesterday, like basically almost 12 hours ago or 24 hours ago. And I feel like if I go back through, I'm just doing it to see the other ending and I want to feel the other ending. I want to actually like put a lot of thought and purpose behind every single choice that I make. I don't want to just do it for the sake of seeing the other ending. Otherwise, I just look up somebody else's playthrough. Yeah. Other ending's going to be just as painful. So exactly. So I am not really wanting to throw myself back into that. I just know that I won't be able to do it justice like I will be able to if I can recover for a little bit. Um, and there is a part of me that wants to see if doing the end game of this would have changed my opinion with what I would have chosen for the DLC, you know, like there's a lot, like I'm not getting to experience what a lot of you guys got to experience, which was play the main game, wait a couple years and then see the DLC. And, um, this way I feel like I get to kind of experience a little bit of both. Like it's the best way that I can kind of experience it. It's better to live with your choices for a bit. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, my graphics card right now is a 4080, 4080, I think. Yeah, I think so. I'm going to hug the duvet. See you soon, <laughs> Diablo. Have a good one. Thank you so much for hanging around. Yeah, I think I might be fine tomorrow, but it might be one of those things too that I just kind of wait to do Reed's outcome maybe next Friday. Like, so this week after tomorrow, today, I intend to keep going with some side missions for at least a little bit longer. And then tomorrow we're going to finish up everything. And most likely what I'll do because next week is like my birthday week, I'm already taking Tuesday, Monday and Tuesday off to just kind of get some time away from the game after all the hours that I put into it and so maybe I might come back to it after like on Friday after Friday or after Wednesday will be a fable stream and then Friday I might come back and do both fable and Reed's mission but I just need a little bit of time to digest it live with my choices and not go quickly into just wanting to see the opposite decompress absolutely Ziggy thanks for the hydrate too mm-hmm I'm planning to be drunk those days. Not at all. I probably will just binge Final Fantasy. Yeah. I've only had the game for about three months, so I've done it all fresh from day one. I never fancied it until it came on sale and the graphics looked beautiful. Yeah, plus I was annoyed with all the bugs in Starfield, so I needed a new game. So you just recently kind of went back through it. Also, Miles World, welcome in. How did you grow such a huge audience? I've done this for nearly six years. It's been a slow, slow growth in the best way possible. It's like a nice, um, a slow burn is what I call it. It's just like, I, I think that over time, there's a lot of incredible people that have found the community through different ways. I think also a lot of growth has come from YouTube, like full disclosure. Definitely the community has never been as large as it has been since I started doing YouTube. And also my own community members trapping people here. Yes, trapping people here for sure. Chart, Mama, thank you so much. Mama Sita, thank you for the follow. And Chart, thank you for 38 months of continual support as well. Thank you. I just watched your ending choice for Phantom Liberty. I did the same thing except you gave Songbird to read at the end. There were a couple of you guys that said that, yeah. Mm. Penguin Poggers. <laughs> It trapped me a while ago. I also feel like um, it's just like genuine people find other genuine people. And it's it's kind of one of those things that I'm not often playing games that are like the biggest, hugest hit right now. But because of that, I think people kind of end up falling in love with the whole community and not just the game that I'm playing. So I, I think that there's really something to be said for like enjoying the entire essence of it it's not just me like people might click on it because they like the game they might click on it because they feel like they're gonna vibe with the community or with me and then you guys just absolutely sell it through and through I mean it's cozy because of you guys at this point but it's always been like it's been growing for years you know it didn't just happen overnight it didn't just happen in the last year it's been almost six years in June on okay on okay hi coziness coziness you're gonna need a bigger ship soon oh no we're gonna need to play some star citizen for the bigger ship mm. scythe scythe welcome back in as well work's been a bit hectic do you work on weekends too i figure with your job absolutely 
Also, Borm, Bormt, is it Bort? I'm not saying this right, but thank you for the follow as well. Thank you. Uh, w stream, glad we finally made it to this point. Yeah, something like this needs to be savored. That's why things take longer and are stretched more when it gets close to the ending. Absolutely, and I don't want to rush a single part of this. Yeah, does Ginger visit the YouTube channel? She has popped on the YouTube channel a couple times. If you guys have seen some of the intros or the outros, sometimes Vert will throw a Ginger outro occasionally. Yeah. There's a surprise for you at the place where you picked up Somi in the van. Oh, is this like another little thing for her? Wait, that actually would be really cool to see. And Red. <laughs> Red, thanks for the follow as well. I appreciate it. Raven, thank you for two months of continual support as well. That's how I found you. I love the vibe here and I've always wanted to ask for tips because you've grown an amazing community. I aspire to do the same. Thank you. No, I, I absolutely implore you guys to always ask questions. I mean, every person's every person's like journey is going to be different and every every community is going to be different in in lots of good ways i mean there's lots of things that i don't bring that other communities do and i think all i can just say is just be yourself and you're going to bring in what you put out um so if you're putting out a cozy energy i feel like you're going to be met with that you see like there's very it's not like i have little tolerance but i, I think we're really blessed to not have too many crazy uh, trolls come through here one because I have it on verified only mode but two because I just don't think I think people can kind of get a read on it if you can get away with something like that and I feel like a lot of people understand that there's like a zero tolerance policy for that like it's just life's too short to be somewhere you don't want to be so just go click the exit button and find somewhere else that you feel like you belong more you know something at my apartment too okay so go to both of these places before we do this can you guys remind me where we picked her up at it was somewhere over here but do you guys remember exactly where i mean don't get me wrong there's troll biscuits absolutely but i think more than anything just rude people there's not a lot of rude people that come through rogue i think no no i thought somebody said to go to where you met so me yes and a hundred percent like this is what I talk about all the time. Like it is, it does not just stop at like me. It's the community, it's the mods, like the people that you bring on your team. My team keeps me sane and helps so much more than I feel like they even get credit for. Like they are a major part to the success of this community. The full, well, the stream is full of troll biscuits, but the best kind of troll biscuits. Mm, closer to the font. Mm -hmm. I feel like I'm gonna need to see it. I'm a visual learner. I feel like I'm gonna need to see this. Ah. Yeah, absolutely. If you have any more questions, Miles, like feel free to ask. I, I tell anybody like, I think that there's a lot of people that try to, mm, I don't think like scare off, but I mean, it is important to remember that, you know, there, it is difficult to make this like a full-time thing. Like there's no denying that, but I feel like if you are genuinely being yourself, playing games that you love and you enjoy and you put out good vibes, you're gonna receive the same back yeah runway raven thank you for two months cool boy and woomin guys thank you for the follows and runway thank you for 39 months of continual support as well thank you so much um i think that for anybody who comes through here you can just tell that i'm in love with video games through and through and i think that you really do need to like you you need to have that love and respect for games and the people that go behind it too i, I think it's not enough to just respect the game but you need to appreciate all the hard work that goes in behind the scene as well mini cooper have a good day absolutely yes going to pick up a meal movie and maybe some more gambling what wait you can't leave and say no movie which movie into co thank you for the follow as well and runway a uh, 30 more until 69 are you in it for the long run you're going to 69 <laughs> um real quick okay so you know what it's okay there's a hidden locker locked door in the lower level of kabuki market that you should visit before the end all right we'll talk about all that hidden stuff here in a second let me go back to my apartment first because you guys said there is something in my apartment to pick up i need to i guess i'll just drive there we'll just do a nice drive with this car it's the biggest struggle and how do you balance life and streaming well, it's gotten a lot easier since doing this full time. Like, I will say this all the time, looking back on balancing both streaming, building a community and working full time, I don't know how I did it for as long as I did. 
I think the truth is I didn't put anything into outside friendships, relationships, my family, like I worked and I came back and streamed. And so there were a lot of years that I lost, um, I lost some time with some important people, but I look back on it and it's like worth every ounce of it, but I have had to kind of come back and, and work on my friendships a lot more. I kind of got to, when I went to go full time, I got to the point where I looked around and I was like, oh, I don't really have a whole lot of people to kind of get counsel on this. You just sent some pictures, thank you. Oh, I don't have my phone here. I'll have to pull it up on the computer. You enjoy watching sports, but you never around to say what sports. <laughs> I, I mean, I'd go to a hockey game or baseball. I think those are like my favorite sports that I'd watch, to be honest. Dusty, Dusty, thanks for the follow and welcome in. Shiz, I went so me all the way and sent her to the moon. Sports ball, yes. What's your favorite sports? Yes. Mm hmm JJ, thank you so much for the kind words. Yeah. Um, but I also think a lot of it too is it's what you make of it. So it's like for me, I have found now I can balance it a lot more because as you guys notice, like I'm, I'm not very active on Discord as much as I probably used to be. Um, I try to on my off days very much take that for time for myself and for people in my life. And I, yeah, I just, I think I've gotten a lot better at creating boundaries in more recent years that's helped me be able to reallocate time to my, my private life, which helps me keep sane during times of chaos, I think. All right, let's see. Is this really my apartment building? This is my corpo apartment. Wait, can I go to my corpo building? This is my corpo one. Do you need to go back to like your very own one or any of the apartments? Floppy pickle. Uh, story stuff needs to be over the original. Snap, crackle, pop. Okay. No, I'm not going for 900, no. I was like, that doesn't look like my Omega apartment. Yeah, I wish I could tell my younger self to create better boundaries when I was, uh, yeah, absolutely, Sai. Uh, better at creating them and better at respecting others. Ah! Yeah. Lost in da da da. I have so many apartments. I know we are not hitting. How many do we have? Ah! Add that. Add another My one. It's because. Yeah, yeah. All right. You know what I'm gonna do to your dad. Roger that. This is one more important thing on the final mission. But I don't know if you'll find a place on your own. For the. Oh snap! All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta escape this. Uh, his car's looking a little, a little messed up. Suspect's vehicle has been located. Details have been Make sent. that 60? It's this damn car. Suspect has been okay. cleared. All units on site. Continue searching. Have you played the Arasaka Tower 3D? No, I haven't. I have not. The spoiler? You like the car, but just not the spoiler. Ah! Hold on. I repeat, code zero in this area. All units resume normal duties. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. Take this exit. Car needs a spoiler warning. Oh no. This doesn't count as a crash. Woo! Okay, I'm going on foot. I'm going on foot. I'm getting out of here. I'm going on foot. I don't like it. Mm. Oh. All right, let's see. Mm. Oh, the keg is a is yeah a crucial part to becoming a successful streamer. Oh man, did you even press the elevator button? The graphics are really yeah. Yeah, yeah. No spoilers yet. We'll talk about all the extra things that I can do probably tomorrow as well. 
I don't know. We're probably not going to get a lot of side missions done today. Like, we'll get a decent amount, and then tomorrow we'll probably just be dedicated towards completing everything. We'll definitely get our date, though. We'll go to the apartment. We'll get started on our date. We'll get started on our date. There's a couple other things you guys said for so me. It didn't really count. Oh? It didn't count. My favorite cyberpunk commercial. The date with Rogue, what do you mean? Mm, chat doesn't like spoilers, could have fooled me, Lock. Ah, <laughs> uh, what's my favorite commercial? I'd have to go back and rewatch all of them. There's a couple that come to mind. Hey, hey, no pushing. Yeah, we haven't done it yet. No, I was saving it to kind of get me back into Mr. Stud. I was, I was saving it. Forgot about this. Oh, postcard. Hmm. What's this? It's always sunny in Monaco or Monte Carlo. Toss the damn coin into a fountain. Back turns and over my shoulder and shit here's hoping it brings us both good luck it's from alex alex went to monte carlo she got her vacation who would have thought it's always sunny in monte carlo <laughs> that's awesome that's amazing toss a coin <gasps> and our cat mr Nebels. mr Nebels. oh my goodness he's giving first cat in space vibes Mr. Oh, what is it? What is the fallout? Mr. Oh my goodness. What is it? Uh, Mr. Something. Pebblesworth. Mr. Pebblesworth? No. You should have a trophy for winning the beat on the brat next door. Mr. Beaglesworth. But, well, no, this is Mr. Nibbles. But no, no, no. There's, there's a cat poster. There's a cat poster in one of the fallouts. Mr. Neebles. Uh, over down here. Over down yonder. I hope Johnny's feeding the cat. That's true. We never did go back and see. Not. What do you have on sale, though? But you are not who I'm looking for. You're not who I'm looking for. I need a trophy. Not Coach Fred. There's somebody else that we needed to go see. Why am I missing? The... Wasn't there somebody we had to check up on in here? He doesn't have a trophy. But I guess you can just sit. I guess sit on the bench. The trophy's in your apartment. I thought there was somebody... Barry... Was Barry the cop? Am I thinking the cop? Do we need to go you back go and check and on him? Yourself. Just wait. No, we've done Misty. Mm. Inside my apartment right when I walk through the door. Uh, should we check on him? No berry quest anymore. Okay, we're done with that. For your own thing. Yes. Oh, look at that. That's awesome. This year, Night City Championship. It's pretty cool. And then this was our little Witcher Roach Race box. So cute. Ah, uh, there's something on in, in a neighboring apartment that you can check on. Which one? I know my trash is disgusting. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to die. Hi, hi, hi. What's happening down here? <laughs> Oi. You're fine. The bully. Is it on one of these ones? Oh no, not if it's a side mission. Are you sure I haven't done it already? Is it not one of the cats and one of the side missions I've already done? Oi. Oi, mate. Okay. You've done it. You've done with that. Okay, I've already done it. Three. All right, blistering love, guys. Can't even remember why Rogue and I were always at each other's throats. All I remember is the good times. Uh, and how few of them were there were. 
And now I've got one night to make it up to her. Yeah, a movie date sounds boring, but hell, we never did normal, boring things. Better late than never, right? Ashley, welcome back in. Can you put the pin down? The pin down for so me. Oh, you guys are talking. Yeah, let me run to the bathroom. We'll do so me because I can grab my phone and see where it is. Yeah, yeah, good point, good point. And then we'll do the movie night. All right, I'm going to use the bathroom one more time and then we're going to see how far we can take this. And then anything that we don't complete today, we'll do tomorrow. Mm, Ivan, Ivan, thank you for the follow and welcome in as well. All right, I'll be back. Warrior, warrior, thank you. Getting hungry, getting hangry. Also, warrior, thank you again for the resub. And Kava, Kava with 21 months of continual support. No radio, just absolute silence. There. TJ, London B-dubs. Oh my gosh, B-dubs sounds so good. But I have meal prep. <laughs> I need to stay strong. B-dubs, Warrior, thank you for the gifted sub to Pibento as well. Guys, I hope y'all enjoy the sub and the emotes and Jackie, or no, yeah, Jackie love. Jackie, thank you so much for the follow as well. Guys, thank you. Okay, hold on, we've got two of these. Y'all have to stop making this a thing. Stop trying to make fetch happen. Mm. Okay, I'm pulling these up. B-dubs is love, B-dubs is life. It sounds so good. Not Taco Bell. I don't know why I haven't been craving Taco <gasps> I'm not gonna finish that sentence, but you know. I just, I don't know, it's not hitting the same way that it used to. Cyberpunk, thank you for the follow and welcome in. It's all my fault. Oh no. Oh no. No. You know that's one of my weaknesses. Bear with the gifted sub to Texas Roadhouse. The rolls. The rolls. The Roadhouse rolls. All right, I'm tracking. Let me see. Mm. The rolls are so good. Let me go to fast travel. Looks like one's right here. Just about? Okay, I see, I see, I see. Uh, do I have a fast travel point from here, right here? Ah, uh, the roadhouse rolls. Fast travel here. The cinnamon butter, especially if you get it to go, you can get away with paying like such little for the rolls, the salad, the steak. I see, I see, I see. Plant, plant, thank you for 44 months as well. Thank you, 40. Y'all are all getting over like 30 months. It's becoming a regular occurrence seeing people over 40 months. And that just shows me how long I've been doing this and how old I am. I am molding. Plant, thank you for all the continual support, truly. And then I think we just want to go right here. Chad's getting old. We're all getting old together. Over 40 months of continual support. Dragoons. Dragoons is like, that's nothing on me. <laughs> Thank you so much, Plant. Oh, excuse me. I don't know, Notorious. Wait, check it. Bucket slice? There's a shard. Huh. Shard from Songbird. No. If you're watching this, you know how our story ended. I'm a smidge jealous, I'll admit. I'm scared, V. But I need to trust you, and I do. And if you're watching this, I was right too. So, I thank you. Imagine if you turned her in and then you found that. Oh, that would be hard. That would be really difficult. All right, we're going to do another thing. Did 100% and never saw this. Eastern Meerkat, by the way, welcome in. I love how she goes, I, I trusted you. Like, I knew I needed to trust you. Mm. That was a good, that was a good moment. Wait, is this the one thing you, is this, are these the same things? These are the same things, Darpass, right? That was all. 
Oh, that's got to hit so hard if you turned her in at the end. There's also a memorial thing you can revisit at Spaceport. Yes. Yes, I did hear about that. Mm. You guys are awesome with these little tidbits that we've gotten to see this playthrough. It's really nice. Uh, get me out of the suit. Also, where did this top come from? When did this happen? I must have accidentally hit... Where? The amount of content that they hide in this game. Yes. Mm-hmm. It's truly impressive. Okay. Nocturne. No, I'm just kidding. Blistering love. Time to call Rogue, guys. Y'all ready? What did you choose in the relics? You know, let me see. Oh, we do need to apply the other thing. Do we go back to the basketball shorts? I went a lot of optical camo. Mm. We are going to do a date. Maybe lock them doors and put those basketball shorts on. Where are they? I guess I need to call my car first. What would Johnny wear? Millie. Stop. That, that's not Millie. That's... Oh, my bad. Total... That is... Easy mistake, my friend. Easy... Wait a minute. What is this garbage? My friend, you are not my favorite. Get out of here. Easy mistake. Hashtag... Hashtag not my Millie. <laughs> that was actually... I cannot believe that was what happened. I have to turn a lot of these things in, but let me find some b-ball shorts. What would Johnny wear? I do think Johnny would do some basketball shorts. Mm, maybe not. Maybe not. <laughs> but I would. Wait. Are they camo shorts? Are they the ones with the zipper shorts? I love those zipper shorts. They're so practical. You can go from long pants to shorts in a heartbeat. Zip. Let me see. Mm. Johnny approves. Well, there you go. Sounds about right. Maybe like do like a jacket with it or something. Maybe something else that says Beha. Go back to my like original fit. <laughs> Live or die in the plaid. Want to get Johnny's Porsche? We, I think we already have it. Maybe we don't. No, I don't really care about collecting the cars, guys. I'm not a car person. Just not a car person. Unless it's a truck. All right, let's call Rogue. Here we go. Hold on, hold on. Shh, shh, shh. Johnny wants to ask you out on a date. What do you think? Johnny's asking, or is it you? Johnny, you're the one who said you got no trouble telling us apart. Okay. And where'd we go? Where'd you want to go? Silver Pixel Cloud in North Oak. Okay. I'll swing by the afterlife. Pick you up. Oh my gosh. Talk to Rogue. We're going on a date. We're going on a date. Blistering love. Oh, sorry. Are you stupid? Sorry. <laughs> on me. Talk about third wheeling. This is taking third wheeling to a whole nother level. Forgot to tell you. Swing by in the evening. Got things on my plate right now. Okay, this evening then. Need to fast. Speed it up. Speed it up. I'd only get the cards for the achievement hunting. Yeah, if I was doing that. I like to do as much content as I as I can, but hold on. Ronald, culture and entertainment. I wish I could stop getting these these updates. I don't mind. Hmm. Talk about the cast. Ronnie spots something. Anything on the market. Ronnie again. Michael. Knew I could count on UV. Trials over. Eric's out and our involvement remains a secret. Solved my problem. For good, I hope. Hmm. Yeah. I would not say that he can expect me to help out anymore or just tell him that his son's trouble. All right, so we need to fast forward to... Well, it's already 1.24, but I'll make it more nighttime. The SnowRunner? It's an off-road truck game? SnowRunner? Oh, Aguilar. Oh, snap. Perhaps one day we will meet and learn just how well an imitation can rival the original. If at all, how amusing that would be. That is terrifying, and I hope that we... Uh... How did they know it was us? 
That's so terrifying. Aguilar seriously has her contacts. Aguilar romance? <laughs> I put on my dating shorts. Just in case. You never know when you're going to break out into a b-ball game. Bring it, Aguilar. No, Lewis. Lewis does not speak for us. No, Aguilar. <laughs> Lewis does not speak for us. Honestly, she probably is like the balls on this person and respects it, I would assume. Like the fact that I just, ooh, they knew I was coming through. Let's put on the perfect romance music. It's a good song. Well, it's kind of a good one. It's more sad girl hours. It's a good one. It's a good one. It's not hey there, the minions. <laughs> None of them are giving like we're going on a date. The voice of the machine. Does Aguilar want to mess with the best sniper? Probably not. Yeah, nothing. So not pre-date songs. This one would be, but I can't play it. I know. I was thinking Pon Pon was gonna go on, but it didn't. Black dog. See if something comes on ground. Oh. Pretty important PSA coming your way. Well, for some at least. This way. We'll see if any new reports coming in about malfunctions appearing in Mr. Studs. And yeah, what? it's a hot melted junk kind of malfunction. Oh. So unless for whatever reason you're into Jessie. scorched sausage, I'd hold off on upgrading your kit till they iron out the kinks. <laughs> she had too much fun oh. recording that one. Now here's a little something to settle you in. It is a it's a good PSA. Oh, it's so good. A lap around the a lap around the afterlife. All right, just one lap. This one, you know what? A lot of it is probably because this one and Going to Heaven remind me of like League of Legends songs almost. Did, did you tell Cast about the auto fail on the mission that triggers because Rogue hates Pon Pon? I knew Rogue and I would get along. What? Oh my. Oh my goodness. I'm going on a date, Neil. Excuse me, everybody. Move. Guys, get out of the road. I'm giving them an opportunity to get out. That was not a thousand. It's all the road. It's all the road. Doesn't look different. Miss, thanks for the follow and Anon. Thank you for the gifted sub to Nilo as well. Nilo, welcome back in. Livid, don't look at me like that. The sidewalk is the road. The road is the road. You're not safe on these streets at all. Nowhere is safe. Wait, wait until evening. Oh, snap. Hold on. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. I think I have my outfit. I think I'm ready to go on this date. I know. Anon, thank you for all of the gifted subs. Some crew taking you along as bait? That a compliment? You look... different. Emmerich. <laughs> Try again. Maybe you'll find some charm third time around. Time to replace the kidneys. Hey, Rogue. Oh. Ready? Again, you. We hey. going? Where's Johnny? Couldn't make it after all? This is a good point. You look... Wow. She does. That Johnny's wow? She's like hardly yours? aged. When's he gonna show? I really love Cyberpunk. I did. Do you see all the hours we put in? I'm just, I'm the just driver. your driver. Yeah. See, you keep him on a short leash. <laughs> Wise beyond your years. 
Hop in. <laughs> Let's go. See, I told you guys it was a chick magnet. And y'all thought I couldn't pick anybody Silver up in the sky. Silver Pixel Cloud, your favorite place? Once, probably. Haven't been there in ages. Drive-ins went out of style a century ago. But Silver Pixel's still hanging in there. Sounds like a preem place for a date. Thought so, too. Which is why I suggested Johnny take me there. Aww. A million years ago. So it wasn't his idea. Of course not. Just calm. His idea of a romantic night out was blowing up her Osaka HQ. To be fair, sounds like Johnny. Excuse me. All right, I'm just the driver. I gotta get her there. Precious cargo. All right, V. Tell me what's going on. This way. For real. Not this way. Oh snap! Doesn't do a thing without an ulterior motive. So what's in play this time? Johnny's changed. Uh, he really does want to spend some time with you. No hooks, no lines, no sinkers. All right. Are we sure about that? I, I guess I. Oh, 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 Rogue. Hold on. Sorry, Rogue. Go to the drive-in movie theater. This is so cute. I've always wanted to do a drive-in theater. Rogue. Just taking it all in. A selfless Johnny Silver. In what world? A positive influence on him. I don't know about positive influence, but we're rubbing off on one another. There we go. This is surprisingly a very safe ride. So lock me up. Oh no, this is my. Oh, I hate these areas. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay, calm, calm down. I'm not jinxing it. I'm not jinxing it. I know, Tonyus. I've always. I think it would be so much fun. It's giving footloose. I'm not even. No, I'm not using. Well, I'm kind of using brakes, I guess. I guess. Occasionally. Yeah, but Rogue deserves the best, and she deserves to survive. I had it in me all along, I just never tried. Brakes. This is kind of a cool drive. You don't like this song? Oh, I love this song. Hop! Bop! All right, hold on, put the brakes on. It's getting a little stormy out here. Okay, this is good, this is good, this is good. Face down in the dirt. I don't know why that just made me think that one. Oh gosh, skirt! Here we are. Great weather for a drive-in theater. I really feel like we're gonna be able to see. Closed. <gasps> really has been a while, I guess. Oh no. Technically it's open. Been here before. Is it? No way in. Practically have the place all to ourselves. Okay. Oh. Do we need a car to get in a drive-in? Johnny. Okay. We need a Christmas music station. Yes. <laughs> mm-hmm. It's a lot of side missions, Starboy. We were doing all just DLC stuff earlier today. See if we can kind of hack into this or do something. Severance, change of plan, shutting it down. There'll be severance packages offered, feeling alone to, oh, right, right, right. Oh, right, 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 right. Mm. Try and get the projector started. I'll get us some seats. Okay, sure thing. Millie is not enough. You have to have a convertible. Exactly Millie's where I was supposed to take her 50 odd years ago. Right, let's go check the projector. This is gonna be sweet. All right, Johnny. Do you think you got this? It's been 50 years. You still got your Riz? You think you can do this? Did you bring popcorn? Nothing. Still wearing his shades too. Entrance is over here. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I don't think he still got it. He's gotta be off his game after 50. Okay, looks like you found the projector. 
You wouldn't happen to know how to get it up and running. Hmm. Silver pixel cloud now playing. Nightmare on Jig Jig Street. <laughs> A song of ice and chrome. The streets of Night City. Bushido X fade to black. Silver Pixels classic rom com extravaganza. Ah. Oh. to see. Look at that. Last played wow. Bushido ten. Perfect. That's what you really want to watch like with her. a spurt her? of runny shit. V, we're at a drive-in. Movies the last thing we care about. Oh. Just want some background noise, a little blood, tits, and gore, that sort of thing. I mean, I think she he lost his game. All right, V, run along. <laughs> this I'll is, I didn't expect here. this on the date. What? Oh, gosh, you kids have, have fun. fun. you crazy kids. Darth Sage, thank you for four months and welcome back in. <laughs> Such a romantic, although rogue, to be fair. Grabbed oh. us the best spots. Hop on up. Okay, nice fighting, good. The movie's pretty cool. This is how you imagine this evening going? Always knew things would have to change for us to just go out and catch a movie. Never imagined they'd change this much. <laughs> Let's pretend it's 2015, huh? We just met, and I got no idea what a bastard you are. <laughs> I like the Rogue of 2077. Lured you to the movies to get laid, by the way. But I like 2077, Rogue. A far inferior version. Lay it on thick. Okay, so it's 2015. If you could do it all again, what would you change? Oh, Anything yeah. at all? I'd kill Smasher. <gasps> I do carry. <laughs> I don't think he would really say that. Ah, uh, do you think hmm. she, maybe taking a while to mull that one over? Yeah, well, you know, I'm trying to be strategic about this. Never did anything I wouldn't do again. I don't necessarily think that he really lives with regrets, but I think he would kill Smasher. No, nope, doesn't work that way. All those brain crabs, there'll be decisions. They were wholly mine. So you get yourself killed again over an obsession with Arasaka for someone who wasn't a real person. Mm. Do you know, like that one? Hey, 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 what's this? Nothing. It's just think I do carry was Johnny's answer. Had a lot of time to think while you were away. What ifs and all that. Sure, that's it. Nothing about Grayson or Smasher. Mm. What? What's Smasher got to do with anything? Getting the sense you still got a thorn in your side there. Cause I do. I think you hear his I'm voice. irate, disappointed, but rather not think about it now. Huh. See, it feels kind of weird to go down this route of like laying it on thick and causing it to be this like kind of like romance or like something happening between them. Because I guess I think it was always something that they thought about, but I kind of look at it as something that you always think about, but you never act on. Versus him with, um, why do I always forget her name? I know who I'm talking about. I do love, yeah, Rogue's voice is amazing. Alt, thank you. I think you might be hiding something from me. Alt. Johnny, there's a heap of things I'm hiding from you. Yeah. But all we got's this It's not that I don't night. believe in romance. Don't got much to offer you. Your biceps are huge. Kiss me. It's more than I ever could have asked for. Rogue, I'm here on borrowed time in a borrowed body, but I'm here. To add to my 
sleeping around but never romancing somebody. I did get a romance, kind of. I guess I ended up with some kind of romance. I love her freckles. Yeah, but Johnny's with us, been with us for River, so the least I can do is be with Rogue for him, you know? Also, is this car even sanitary? Like, who's... I liked her top. I knew there was something happening with the top. Rogue is a cougar. She's not a cougar with Johnny. I think her and Johnny are a similar age, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Should have brought Millie. See, I would have been, I would have been all for it. Had Millie been here to experience it. I think that would be the final straw for Millie though. If I was screwing somebody on top of her. I always thought the romance scenes were awkward. First person POV. <laughs> <laughs> I cringe hard at these. I know Johnny, some of you guys think I can't. It's like it's not right. Immersion, but I just find them to be as cringy as possible. <laughs> Thought this is what you wanted. I get it. Towards V. Hmm. I think it would be really, I, I think it would be really hard. I think despite how, like whatever feelings she had for Johnny, I, I wonder if that would just feel very, it's not Johnny at the end of the day. It's like hard to put the mind to the body. I understand. It's unique, no, but definitely not you awkward. don't. Tried so hard to pretend nothing's changed. To pretend I'm the same rogue you knew. Actually managed to fool myself for a little. <sighs> Get back on my own. No. Rogue. No. Fuck. Shoot. All right, did not answer that well. Take pills. Wow, Johnny takes the pills to give us back our position. That's interesting. Tor, thank you for 15 months and welcome back in. Ah. <sighs> <sighs> Rogue's gone. Yep. Guess it didn't go well. I don't. I don't even think they got into a fight. Really, the wrong movie. Guess things did not go swimmingly. Nope. Was gonna be a nice night at the drive-in. Now she's mad and won't tell me what about. Oh my gosh, that's horrible. Oh my gosh. I guess they want to give you guys, like, mean answers to give to him? Any guesses? Remember Grayson? How they spoke? How weird it was? Weird's not the word, I don't think. He was toying with her. Could be something mm -hmm. to that. Got a mullet over. For now, take me to North Oak. Okay. That's supposed to help you figure out Rogue? No. Carrie. Tell you once we're there. Movie was a turd wrapped in crepe paper. <laughs> All right, blistering love. Well, that didn't exactly go as expected, but you know, it's not the worst date we've been on, to be honest. I would say everything that happened with Meredith was a little bit more disturbing. Oh, please no tips, tricks, or spoilers. Just be mindful. Yeah, even if it's something that I might find out a little bit later too. And Luke, thanks for the hydrate. Yeah. Um, I do think we should finish out one way or another, but is this... Okay, let me just read the message from her. Neil. I'm in Dogtown. Let's meet, please. Sending you coordinates? No. Why did you come back here? No, did I make a big mistake? Oh, no. Go to the meeting point? Oh, I don't want to do that. The Meredith date was wild. That was like my first introduction to Cyberpunk, and I was like, okay. I see. I didn't date Meredith. I didn't date Meredith. Ugh. No, I get it, Ren. I get it. I thought I finished. I thought I did too, but there's decisions I made. Lizzy, wizzy, wet and wild type neither. Talking to piss your pants. Did any of you guys drive in first person? So anyway, there 
I the was, tattoo I examination. Nod. And yet I'm running naked through wet streets. Yeah. I'm in Pacifica and being chased by a horde. Of <sighs> I was expecting that to be more romantic. I shouldn't have. I can't think of what to say when I'm hearing somebody else talk. Um, I should have known better because it's Shawnee. It wasn't going to be this like romantic date that I was, I don't know what I was expecting, but it wasn't that. Yeah. It's so hard in this game. Only first is motorcycle. Oh, I should try that. Quapla, let's try that. I haven't tried it. Let me see. Still better than Abby and Owen in Last of Us 2. Oh my gosh. Oh. Um. <laughs> yeah. What am I doing? I'm calling a car. Let me try first person motorcycle. It reminds me a lot of, oh yeah, we have this one. I mean, I told you guys my stance on this at the Judy part, but. Okay, I can kind of see that. It probably would trigger a little bit of motion sickness after a while for me, but it's not bad. Oh no. Happy Zulu. You, where have you been? It's been an incredible two years. You remain as one of the best. Ah! Zulu! <laughs> yeah, hold on, let me put the brakes on. You remain as one of the best people that I've encountered on this platform, and I would like to thank you for your spirit and community, Foster. I know your stream will go far. Strength to strength, I wish you the very best. Happy Zulu. Thank you so- Thank you so much for the kind words. I know I can't read text at the same time. Happy Zulu. Thank you for the support for two years, and here's to hopefully many, many more. I know our times don't always line up, but it's always such an honor to have you here when you are able to make it. And Herbal, Herbal, thank you for five months too. Yeah, guys, don't text and drive. Thank you so much, Herbal. Hi, Zulu, thank you for tier three as well. well okay, so Johnny. why are we here exactly? Heard Carrie got himself a buck of mansion here. Done well. Where'd really? you hear anything about Carrie? In and about town. Scream sheets are full of shit about him. Oh, right, you weren't around. Mm-hmm, your boy's night out. Oh, so want to pay him a visit? I remember. Yep, seems as good a time as okay. any. Mhm. Mm want me to head to his deluxe dump? Know what they're writing about him? Oh, He's I did. I did hit X. Attempted suicide. What really worried he wants to hurt himself? Who knows? Either way, could give him some pointers. Meaning you want to go in person? Got to hand you the reins again. Yes. Behaved myself last time, didn't I? He did. I and think he took I warrant another furlough for good behavior. First for Carrie, then for mm -hmm. him. First rogue, now Carrie. Who's next on the list of conjugal visits? Nobody. Just so happens the list of people I consider friends and who are still alive is pretty damn short. Exactly why I need to talk to Carrie. I don't know why. I guess maybe it's because we've already done it a couple times, but I don't seem to mind giving him control. I know I probably, if it was really my body, I'd probably have a problem well, with it. But at this point, I kind of feel like, I guess you start to feel a little sorry for him. What was that about attempted suicide? Amateur hour. Didn't yeah. even cobble together the right audience. Tried to put a bullet through his skull in his room. Mm. Bodyguard took his gun like candy from a baby. Could just be the rumor mill. Sure, could. But I want to know. You can say, nope, I don't trust you. Okay. But I want to know what you plan to do. Nothing stupid, I promise. Just want to see how he's doing. How you plan to tell him it's you? Could be dealing with some real personal shit right now. Might not be the best time to mess with his head. v is always dealing with personal shit. That's why, in spite of everything else, we got along. Don't worry. I'll play it by ear, sensitively. First things first. We gotta get into that house. Okay. Just let me know when you want to take the wheel. Wow. That is a lot of trust for him. 
Uh, Easter welcome back in. I also said diamond eyes, diamond eyes hi. AJ, how'd you do that? <laughs> That's so strange. Also, Strike, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. And uh, Lord, welcome back in. Hi. Mm, I'll turn that off for a second. I think we've already been here. I, I feel like I vaguely remember this. Oh, let me save. Hmm. Didn't you guys say there were like a string of missions that happened after? Oh. Yeah. There we go. And cast has trust issues. Have you seen my playthrough of Ninth City? I continue to place my trust in people only to get betrayed. Absolutely. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Pigeon, all types. But primarily, oh, this is okay. I'd say primarily country. Hmm. Well, I probably. It's a chain of mission. Chain of missions for him to kind of, I feel like redeem him, not redeem himself, but get some closure before whatever happens, happens. You know what? We'll be fine, we'll be fine. Fugly as seafood barf. The whole Hope place? it was expensive at least. Oh. Something's gotta justify this level of tacky. Jeez. I mean, the oh, view, fuck. though. Cookie cutter crap straight from a catalog. Don't this? Don't carry pick this. Yeah. Always ate out. Always. Mm. <gasps> I'm getting hungry. That's the only problem. That's why I'm like, every time I'm like, oh, I'm going to do a long stream. I'm like, okay, okay. And then I get starving. I'm like, I got to go. Huh. Oh. Don't think that was originally there. It's a bit messy. It's a bit... Bit print collection. Wicked bad collection. Well, is that my desk? I Where? Impressed. Played a few of these myself back in So my desk would go days. very well with this. <gasps> oh, all right. He's showering, seems like. Huh. Screw this life. Hmm. Oh. Beautiful butterfly carry emerging from his silky samurai chrysalis. Interesting. Interesting. Uh-huh. I gotta come prepared. No, I just feel like I have to eat something more nutritious before I start stream. Okay. I don't think that's his mom. All right. I'll give him that one. Okay, that's ugly. Really, Johnny? Hmm. Is that a rowing machine? That's nice. I don't know who's working out underneath the staircase, but... No, I mean, the bones are great. Don't get me wrong. I like all the use of wood. It warms it up. It's less uh, stoic than some of the other... Like the other corpos. He's just got fitness stuff everywhere. Probably the only actual necessity in this whole pad. Steal all of his stuff. Just like Harry Potter. Except the couches, not it. The burrito wrapper. These are really cool. Wow, how do you even get pillows up there? How do you manage to get pillows up there? Choco, have a good one. Thank you so much for hanging around. And I hope we get to see you tomorrow for the finale. <laughs> the finale, it's so messy. Oh, there's a bar up here, hangout spot up here. This is killing me to see how messy it is. I'm not taking care of it like this. Who is Lizzie Wizzy pretending to be? Because it makes me feel better. I mean, you can't deny that view though. It had to be surrounded by windows on all sides. I wouldn't mind that as much as it's just too big. But I... he sits here and thinks, the fuck I need all this shit for? Yeah, I was just about to say, like, I just feel like it's unnecessary. I don't know. I like kind of like smaller, cozy homes. Solo career of a rocker boy. No, I'm not even max settings. No. Hmm. It's just so much empty space. Yeah. 
But I will say, like, he has more stuff that is unique to him than I would expect. Looks like he's showering. Alone, too. Good thing. Time to switch. Me. Okay, leave the rest to me. I'll get him out of there. Take pills. Here we go. Drop one of Misty's special pills. Let's go. Okay. I find it interesting that it gives you a second chance to look at things. Malfunction detected. Cozy homes with fireplaces, swing porches. Yes. <sighs> Feels so much better. Now let's see what you're up for show and what you're actually strummable. What if he's... No. We lost everything. Oh, there it is. Carrie's gonna walk out. Who the fuck? Keep playing. Uh... All right. Let's play Fade Away. I mean, you gotta say, he was pretty good at what he did. Johnny. Carrie? How can you tell no. that just by that? No. no it's some fucking joke. Hang on. What like did Silverhand rope. tell me before he died? It was a test. <sighs> Could just play you another it song. Was, it was. It was. Uh-huh. He told you to stop being a pussy. Did you? Look at his face. Huh? Johnny fucking Silverhand. Fuck. I mean, how? Surprise. Oh. Motherfucker! Oh. That's probably deserved. Maybe just a little bit. His okay. eyes lit up. Weren't yeah. expecting me. I get it. Oh, fucking contraire. Been waiting 50 years to do that. So you changed a bit. Nice rack. Uh, Sporting a new style? Yeah. What about you? Yeah, kinda. What about you? Shit. Mm -hmm. Johnny. Oh, man. Take the gun, doesn't he? All right. Come on. Tell me. Why do you look like a small time klepto punk from the afterlife? Hey. As long as you tell me what you got in your throat. Not a punk. Always did complain I couldn't carry a tune. Nice place. Ain't seen much of it yet. Small time? Moved in after the fourth album came out. Doesn't realize also I'm the best well, work. Apparently. Fuck you, Johnny. Don't even start. <sighs> Who'd you sign with? Shit. With Arasaka. Oh. Mornings, I record at their studio. Then evenings, Yori pops over for a little neighborly cookout. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And who'd you really sign with? Funny. MSM Records. Another pillar of society. Come on. Sit down with me. He really knows how Don't to get under my skin. I want to sit down. Live here all by your lonesome? Small time. I nah, know. got my cook, Ariel, but you know, he's off today. Miguel... What am I? Not your biz, Jum. Sit down. Start talking. Do you want to put some pants on, or are you just gonna okay. tell yourself for a long story? I just really wanted to be trapped. Can you stop Sad spreading? Sad as all fuck over all those years. Because <laughs> if I hear you spent them with the nomads, open road, winning your hair, or cool and relaxed in orbit, and now you've just. Pop by to shit all over my life. Is this full well, nudity my when you have it turned by. off? See for yourself. Oh, it is a heartbreaker. No man's for life. It's like, oh, oh, fuck. Remember the one damn time Henry showed up sober and clean as a whistle. Uh huh. And played yeah. absolute trite. No, I don't. I At least don't. Daddy was happy. Who's that? Who's that? They replaced. Elise, the ex-wife. Oh, on the oh, table. What? Oh. You're kidding. How oh. long did last? Eh, hey, too long. But don't worry. It worked out well. For her. Mm. Gave her my house in Tokyo. Cars. 
kids. Yeah. Worked out their option well for you too, then. Hmm. Looking at him now, those really were the best of times. Playing fucking rat infested dumps. Argued before every gig. Had no idea what we wanted to play, and never had an Ed do our name. Nancy? Control freak. Henry smelled like zappers and piss. <laughs> I was always stealing your pants. Hella good times, man. Not my pants. Never did get what Denny yeah. saw in that guy. Yeah. I mean, smart, smart imp, imp, that one. Maybe too I'm smart for the company okay. she kept. Nah, Denny always went for losers, incapable of dressing themselves. Oh, Hank was perfect. Half a brain and high all the time. She got to rescue him over and over again. Why'd she never try and fix me? Would have had to get in line, that's why. Yeah. <laughs> that's true. He talks about a lot of clothes despite the current situation. He lost his pants in the divorce. Stuff about you being depressed. It true? Nope. Promo stratagem. Suicide attempts too? Think putting a bullet through your skull will help your sales? Didn't work for you. Nobody remembers Samurai. Oh, thank you. Now you're just butthurt because I managed fine without you. Fuck me. Got no answer to that. Still in touch with the gang? Just Nance. Changed her name to Bess Isis. That's why we got locked out of the mission. Works for N54 News. There it is. Could track down Denny and Henry if you want. No, you postured. Maybe get together, you know, jam or something. One last performance. She went from Nancy to Bess. Bess Isis. Damn, Damn. Nancy now really I know. went for it. The Though all I hear is part-time stripper strip. with a thing for ancient Egypt. Oh. Shame you died. Sure she would have welcomed your input. How is she in general, <laughs> besides having nothing to do with music? Could ask her yourself. Hmm. Henry probably drank himself to Henry death. probably killed his own liver. Nah, it would've hurt if he was gone. Got mutual friends. Few calls and I should be able to track him down. Oh, speaking of, here you go. Can you know? Denny might still be So we need to bring the band back together Actually, before we go into him. final mission, I'm assuming? It's fine. Also, yeah, Dark, welcome back here. Not too long ago. Moved to North Oak, too. You just said you weren't in touch. Didn't hear from her. I think she might be avoiding me. You ever leave this house? Nope. Dude. You want to bring, you wanna bring samurai, back? samurai back? The band's back together? Nah, no. Could do one gig. Play some dive where nobody plays us. I mean, got my reputation to think about. Do you have pants to think about? But I won't have to explain what happened. All this? Nah, we'll spare him. Hella boring story. Oh, Biochips, Arasaka's evil schemes. So boring. Magic pills. We'll just say you're my new output. Let's do All it. Right. Let's do it. Fuck yeah! Martinez. Okay! Out. Send you Nancy's number in a sec. Okay, I'll so that's the mission that we're doing Day. next. <sighs> Oh. I'm not there. Figure it out with me. Sure. Uh, you two get along? Mm. Not lately, no. We don't have much of a choice, though. Kinda have to. Sky King and also Asafine. Asafine, oh, guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. Oh. Oh. We're getting worse. It's gonna... Johnny, you okay? <laughs> Devin. No. No. Ah, so you must be V. Johnny mentioned something like this might happen. You two have a good time? You two have fun at least? <laughs> oh, I see. Stella doesn't put that me in. in a disapproval, I hear? Just sit tight for a bit. Rest. Don't worry about a thing. We could have been staying this at this thing? house this whole Did time. Did you hear that? Gets sharper as the pills wear off. So? Want to see Samurai live? 
probably won't get another chance. Well, I really feel like I'm seeing it live. What if this ends up like the rogue thing? One big letdown. <sighs> no, I wish I had played that better. Carrie needs this concert. You think so? Does he really seem like he needs this concert? Okay, call in Nancy. Seemed like he was fine Fuck before yeah. we came along. Nice. I don't know why, I just feel like we should do this for him though. I really do. I don't know, I just feel like, isn't that kind of... I guess him just being a little self-centered, thinking this is what Carrie needs. I guess maybe it's hard for him to admit that maybe this is what he needs. London, thank you for the gift. It's up to Devin. No, 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 no. Send me my real. My, my. Thanks for the hydrate one. Mm. Or Andre. The dancing boots. So we need to call Nancy. What else do we have? We still need to finish out this, and then I think we'll really be done with Phantom Liberty. Is there a... Before we call Nancy, there should be a fast travel point near us. Yep, right behind us. Figured. Figured as... Oh! Okay. <sighs> Didn't you guys say before they patched it, you would die instantly from getting hit by a car? Yeah, no. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. All right, let's go back into Dogtown, and we'll finish up this mission. That does not count as a crash. That doesn't count. No. Stop that madman. I mean, Carrie did want to look. Wait, a low key gig. Just not. Yeah, that's true. Not to solely his rep. As a solo artist. There's probably a piece of him that does want it. Absolutely. Big Mac and altered, guys. Hi. All right, let's go to this meeting point. Mmm. I need a new pelvis. Maybe a whole new body. Everything. I'm fading. I'm fading. I can feel it. <gasps> Ow. Um, do you plan on finishing the game this weekend? I plan to. Absolutely. What we don't get done today, we'll finish up tomorrow. No, I, I don't even know. There's like, if I have no knowledge of Dragon's Dogma, it's not a game I would play right now. Like maybe it's something I'd be down to try like down the future. Oh yeah, good point, good point, good point. But yeah, I have no idea what it is. I have no ties to it whatsoever, you know? 162. But I hear that people are enjoying it. It seems like the, the hot thing right now. Ginger needs to make some food. <laughs> oh, speaking of a little baby she's telling me it's time she's like come feed me it's time what am i doing where am i going never fade away can you feel it oh gosh wait a minute is this in the same path that i went to that other thing i think so ronald i know i asked for information but you gotta quit it it's it's wearing out it's welcome here we go. Okay, I thought she said she was gonna leave. He's out. I'm playing Knights of the Old Republic. Yep. We're gonna do a couple Fable streams first, and then Knights of the Old Republic. I'm thinking Fable Wednesday. Friday will be a combination of doing reads. Possibly, I don't know if I wanna get sad right before my birthday, so I might do reads mission on Wednesday, we'll see. I'm gonna play it by ear, but I'll definitely do reads. Reads kind of side of the story after and then and then also play fable this week until my birthday and then sunday we'll start knights of the old republic yeah we're doing fable three right now yeah eventually i'll go through fable one too see the blue container i'm inside okay gabriel what's up welcome in oh my gosh What? It's, did they catch her? I just got bamboozled. Oh my gosh, they caught her. The crimson. They must have gotten a number. Damn, I got played. Actual flashbang. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Why not? See, this is, and then you say, oh, you have trust issues? Do you see this? Oh, you have trust issues? Mm -hmm. Ambush. 
That is true. They do seem to like announcing that. Except they ambushed the wrong girl. He's the setup. It's a trap. I wonder if that means she's dead though. That's what you get for trusting people in Night City. That is fair. That is fair. Mm. Nice. I I do like the announcement. I want to use this once. I feel like I never used these. <coughs> See, I just don't feel like it's that effective. No. Never trusting somebody again in Night City, which is not true. We know that it's still going to happen. Oh my gosh, I think it's just her. Afterlife, combat stim. Oh, they have a sand. Catch this, kid! Oh! Oh, controller. Me, mouse, and keyboard, never. Never. Okay. So... Did that work out for you guys? She's still alive? Well, did you guys fall for that too? You would think that V had enough of a reputation at this point that nobody would want to mess with me. Thank you, exactly. Machi, welcome back in. <laughs> that's what I, that, that, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. The whole time I was flat on my digital ass in uh, Mikoshi, Carrie was out there forging his glittering solo career. He'd better be real chill after all these years, right? But something tells me deep down he's still the same. Anyways, come on. Guy's gonna crap himself when he sees me. Let's do this. Let's do save. Call Nancy. I feel like that's just the end of it. Nancy? I mean, it's true too. Bess? Bess, Isis. No, this is her underpaid, underappreciated assistant. Steven. And Steven. And <laughs> hold on, Steven. Hold on one second. I'm just over cucumbered. Give me a second. Steven, this is her underpaid, underappreciated. Um, <laughs> that is a good point. I feel like a lot of them are probably just trying to take out whoever Cyan in, in charge. 54 News, how can I help? I'm gonna talk to Bess. She's not here. Hmm. Know when she'll be back? We need to do our mission. She was supposed to be back two days ago. Went to the Totentons to shoot some stuff. Story on Maelstrom. Call oh, back no. next week or just watch the news. If it happens to her, I'll be the first to cover it. Got a bad feeling, V. Uh, yeah, that's not good. The grenade is still there. This grenade is transcending time and space. Mm. Second conflict. Complete other jobs until Bess is available, aka Nancy. Nancy. I guess we need to do this one first. That is a good point, Maiden List. Wait, I think I should just fast travel to get there. Hold on. I'll probably do about one more mission, I think. Wait, not Nocturne. Get out of here. Don't trick me. Pershing. So we need to go to there. Mm. Milster. Okay, you can get me there. Yeah, the... No, that's not the grenade for... <laughs> is that the grenade from Ozzo? Uh, lack and also gold, guys. Thanks for the follows. Welcome in. Stealth mode still active. Let's see. Alright, full breaks. Dark, thanks for the follow as well. I can't believe it took me so long to figure out what those were. I still cannot believe that. Oh, you're right. You guys do. Well, okay. Sandstorm. If Pon Pon comes on, then we'll drive. Sorry. It might just not happen. There just might not be a bomb bomb today. Mm. Here comes the sun. <laughs> Was Bigger Man on? Did I miss it? It might have been. I feel like she fast travels because she can't drive. 
Yes, absolutely. Oh my gosh. Starting to come together. Aren't these the maelstroms no that I go for the killed because he catcalled? Nancy. I think those were. I think that was the one that catcalled me and I just shot him in the head. Yeah. Henry's on board. Way to go. Nice. All right, we'll do this later. Nice. Dark, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Good morning. I'm so, so sorry. Dark in here. It's kind of creepy, too. Uh, yeah, I shot a maelstrom for cat calling. To be fair, you guys said it was valid. Like your style. Thanks. Minimalist. Hmm. Not getting. There's a lot of things, but I'm not getting minimalist from this. Have chrome just like that. Start moving. Are you talking about my chrome? Tense too. Fuck yeah. Okay. Third four. Press the button. Well, my fingers are numb. That's his excuse. What is everybody else in Night City's excuse? Everybody has numb fingies in Night City. Also, Devin, have a good one. Thank you so much for hanging around. Yeah, I hope we get to see you for tomorrow's finale. Hear that? Tonight is today. All right, guys. This one I like. They, oh, oh, oh. Later. This honestly reminds me when you go up to like a rooftop bar of some sort and you always see the people <laughs> getting off. It's like you're staying at the hotel, but there is a rooftop bar at the hotel, so people are getting off at the rooftop bar. Oh man. Go on. You'll blend in. No problem. Uh, I feel like we need to change your outfit then. Luke. Luke, thank you so much for the 1500 bits. Deuces, I'm gonna go eat dinner and be back. Yeah, be back before the stream ends, hopefully. I don't know, I don't know. I don't know how long this mission is, but either way, thank you for hanging around today. And yeah, I hope I get to see you tomorrow for the end, ending. Uh, this is my date outfit. I think it's suitable for clubbing. Maybe I'll just um, take this off. There we go, it's like cowboy clubbing. Exactly. Luke, thank you so much. Mm, 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 mm. Oh. Say what you want about the guy. These Maelstrom knows fall. how to party. No fucking way. Remember that tape from All Foods? That's the Rimbo who did Royce. No, 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 no. Wouldn't be that stupid to show up here. Oh my gosh, you that is kind of cool. Looking for best. Looking for best Isis. Guess I gotta spell it out. You the one took out Royce. It's Charles, I. Uh, was anyone actually sad to see Royce go? Yeah. What, anyone actually boo-hoo when he went? Uh, they gotta this. respect that. The chance at a nick in the barrel. Get the fuck out! Now! Patricia. That's the All Foods punk. I'm not blind! <laughs> what do you want? Jesper, have a Watch good one. Watch out for that one. You and Jesper. the one in charge now? No! A lot's changed since Royce went, but Vampire not that much. Best Isis. Mean anything to you? You work with her? No, just gotta talk. Heard she's here. She's here, but you talk to Brick first. Brick. That's all what happens to you. Uh, Didn't we save Brick, or Brick isn't the guy that we saved? I'll take you. I think Brick is the guy that we saved. So I think we're gonna be good. Yeah. Yeah, we'll be fine. We saved him. So Brick's in for Royce now. They put him back yeah, in charge. Yeah, heard what happened at All Foods. He's built Probably like a boot. thinking Brick will be grateful, huh? What, that'd disappoint you? No, and Brick's not in a position to demonstrate feelings of any kind. Oh? Yeah, they did something to him? alternative. You mean we don't give a fuck what people think? Okay, then let's say extreme music. What's that mean? That's got to be best, right? Look, lady, you keep trying to slap a label on us. No, I'm trying to understand you. Chaos so best. A wall of noise and distortion. Brick, got another guest. V, what a surprise. 
Hey. What can I do for you? Long time no see. Yet. Yeah. 13. 13, thank you for five gifted subs as well. Thank you so much. If anybody's on, here and you just got gifted a sub, I hope you give 13 a big thank you. It's gotta be old friends a little bit. Looks like I'm interrupting. Thank you. Wrapping up, actually. It's Nancy. Percy has overstayed her welcome. Yet I still haven't gotten answers to all my questions. Make something up. You're a journalist. Should be second nature. Say it's an orgy of noise or whatever. Ah, uh, okay. Hmm, seems like your people are still mad at me. Seems your people are holding a grudge. <laughs> Don't mind me. Hold those better than they hold their iron. Show a little understanding. Try not to piss them off. Fair enough. Carrie Uridine sent me, with some biz for Bess. Carrie? Did he suddenly remember I exist? You can go. Yeah, you remember, huh? Brett. Yeah. Just like that? I ask you. No, that's what I thought. Trying to run a business here. Yeah? Thanks, Brick. That was enlightening. Let's go. Let's Delta. Wait. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Thanks. We got our girl. I'm out. Lead the way. He's trying to be an NPC in the techno club. I always love wherever they have him, like, kind of pop up at. Like, his positioning in every shot is so well done. Brick seems all right. I think sure. it was non-violent because I bad. saved Brick earlier. Squat about music. That's what you wanted to talk to him about? Yeah. Tinnitus. The Totentad sound. What I got out of Shepherd Brick Shepherd Shuffle? Okay. No pawn pot. This is gonna be fun though. One, like, I, I do feel like this is a fitting way to go into the final chapter with Johnny is to get the band back for a second. Do a kind of special. Why is the elevator so damn slow in this dump? Special little performance. Do, do. No rave until tomorrow? What do you mean? Oh, for like the, the actual performance? So yeah, probably Giving not until tomorrow. Your story? I won't learn anything about Maelstrom's music. Got lots of footage. Need to look through it, see what I can patch together. Reminds me of Garrus. Hmm. Oh, you mean the techno wave? Oh, for that? I guess I could have explored more. I guess I should have. Okay, come yeah. on. Fuck. Just hope the car's still where I parked it. That is a good point, Maidenless. I, I'm glad to hear Rick that, that, the like, the option. gig will be... Really should have talked to the asses from tinnitus. A good start. You got some right? sort of in with them? Brick invited me to one of their gigs. Yeah, she's saying tinnitus. Problem is the lineup. Changes every time. Yeah, Zook. Hmm. Samurai gig after we get the band back together. Start off tomorrow with a little little show oh it's raining sad girl hours you guys know what we have to do axe axe welcome back in hi i feel like we could really upgrade her vehicle you sure oh, for fuck's sake oh it could have been worse no did she get a boot? souvenir Oh, they Fuck just tagged it. Oh, they tagged it. Oh. I'm headed straight back to the editing room. Want to talk? Gotta oh come my with gosh. Me. Call okay. you like this. Hope it gets us there in one piece. <laughs> what do you expect? Honestly. Yeah, the rain time. I want right. to watch her driving, but so also see her. Want? Wants to bring back samurai. One I like gig, judging their driving. One night. There is no samurai without Silverhand. Hmm. Gabe being his Maybe honor. Gabe Silverhand's honor. What's got into Carrie all of a sudden? Thought he got over this Their ages ago. Cool. Well, guess it doesn't really matter. What's in it for me? That's for you and Carrie to yeah. figure out. I'll be sure to ask him. <laughs> How do you know, Brick? Saved his life once. Well, well. Ever thought about joining Trauma Team? Hmm. I feel like a killed more people than saved them, so I don't think that'd be work. 
It's like a Polaroid eye. That's what I was trying to figure out with that. I've seen that eye attachment before on some other people. It stopped raining already. The rain really doesn't last long and it happens so rarely. Felina <laughs> kiss. Felina kiss eye and also Joel's thanks for the hydrate. Minami Lane. I was made in six months. If your street is beautiful enough, cats will visit you. Yes, absolutely. Please recommend to AJ. And thank you for the hunter bits. You know I'm down to try any game. Yes. I know a lot of people skip the rides, but I kind of enjoy it. There's always like one fun thing that happens on the rides. Kings, welcome back in. Trauma team does have shooters. As we saw in the opening mission, it is true. But, uh, I don't know. I, st I think if I joined the team, I'd be like that one. Remember the one trauma team? Oh, remember the one trauma team girl that we thought was like cyber psych. Oh, she was a reformed cyber psycho. Reformed cyber psycho. Lena kiss. <laughs> thank you for the hundred bits. Darpass, you want to? Yeah, Darpass is already on. Thank you. I'm going to miss this city. He doesn't save lives, she takes them. Was she NCPD or was she trauma team? I think you're right, I think it was NCPD. I really did find it beautiful in its own ways. Primarily at nighttime, I think is when you really realize, literally. Appropriate name. No, I haven't seen the OG trailer. I haven't seen any of the trailers. The max tag. Oh, was she max tag? Yes. You get used to the grime, yeah. You don't see as much of it when you, uh... What the heck? Did that car just spawned out of nowhere, or did I just now notice them? Yeah, it's like you get used to it while... Also, just finding out, like, the beautiful things that are in it. Uh, d really? You believe in red lights? Go! Ugh. Is it still red? It's green! It's green! Well, now it's red. I think it's- I think it's frozen. Oh, okay, never mind. Stop looking at me! Look at the road! Look at the road! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. She waited for red. We saw it. I saw the green. Stop looking at me. Oh, uh, she had to wait for uncom- un <laughs> Yes. Oncoming traffic. Just in case. Y you can skip this one. We're here. Well, we're here. Hop out. <laughs> we're All here. Right. So the concert? Tell Carrie I'll put it together. Yes. Be in touch. Okay, thanks. Another one? Another one? But I think we have a side mission for her. Yeah, we need to do the side mission too. Went pretty damn well. Yeah. Now call Carrie. Hmm. All right, not bad. Hey, so how'd it go? Don't Did you, you get the other guy? Me? Yep, she agreed. Even said she'd organize the gig. Still a control freak. Awesome. Had some problems with Maelstrom. Managed to contact Henry or Denny. I know I heard Billy. Just Henry so far. Dragged him out of rehab. Great story, actually. Henry didn't that know. That does not Denny's count against me. Night City all this time. On his way over to see her now. It's gonna be a surprise. We're all gonna meet over at Denny's. What, me too? Why? You're gonna play with us, aren't you? You gotta meet the others. Send you the okay. address. I didn't do the parking. Millie did that parking. Denny's mansion. They all ended up doing not too bad. Not bad. Not bad at all. I'm gonna miss Millie's entrances. Arasaka Estate. Let's see. Complete other drops until Bess, aka Nancy, is available to call. I'm curious about the Swedenborg Riviera. To write that kind of nonsense, you've got to have a net good ahead. I think I can do this one now. Right? I'm assuming you can do this one. 
you'd be able to. Second conflict. So weird scene. Oh, I still can't. I still have to do second conflict. Oh, man. Nocturne. Ah, there's so many. No, I think this is a good stopping point. I think it's a day or two after this one. Oh, do I just need to wait time? Uh, do I just need to wait to do killing the, the name or do I need to do second conflict a little bit further? Yeah, bear with the gifted sub to backseating two minutes ago, by the way, that I missed. I missed. And also, Tivaline, thank you for the follow. I mean, I definitely am going to say that I miss Millie the most. Absolutely. We need to wait until Pon Pon comes up. Oh, that is a fair point. There you go. This is a great time to end stream. We've already done so me stuff. We already did so me stuff. Yeah. No, this is a good place to stop. Oh, I'm getting hangry, you know? I'm not 100% sure about it. Oh my gosh, here we go. Yanks. Why to end stream so early? It's been six hours. I gotta stand up. I gotta move my body around. I gotta eat. Don't you dare end it before it ends. I'll let you guys hear it first. There, thank you for the five gifted subs to the channel and community as well. Get your Pon Pon gifted subs out of here. Jasmine, luck you are. Thanks for the posture check as well. Yes, I just know it. Pon Pon is hell. <laughs> I feel this. I feel this. Truly, Holly. Holly, oh my gosh. Cam Jam, we are so close to the ending. Oh man, here it comes. Here it comes. Yep, the drop. You are my pom-pom. No, get this out of here. Holly, thank you so much as well. IGN says it's after the gig. Okay, so I just have to do the gig. Then I'll be able to do that second mission. I think there's going to be a couple more missions before we go straight into Nocturne. I can't focus on my outro as I'm talking about this. Yes, I need to go grab food. Um, tomorrow, tomorrow, 12 p.m. We're going to go until we're done with the game, no matter what happens. Um, so we'll start out with doing that gig and then we'll go on London. Get your pom-poms out of here. Um, we'll start with that gig and then we'll try to do Bess's other mission. And then tomorrow we'll go on to, <sighs> yeah, we'll go finally see Hanaka. Finally. 12 hour stream confirmed. It's not gonna be that long. There is no way. I think it'll probably be like seven hours though. It'll probably be like seven to eight hours, most likely I'd assume. But we have nearly everything done. Just a couple more side missions and then we'll get there. What? What? Don't give me that face. Ren, have a good night. Yanks with the 100 bits. I cannot believe you have like around 10 hours left. Well, there we go. There we go. That means though, guys, that probably means uh, my neck is in and out. It depends on how much I'm sitting right now. I'm going to go get it checked out on Monday or Tuesday. Yeah, um, that means tomorrow I'm probably going to do a pretty short intro. We're probably going to dive as I guess pretty much right away into everything that way we can optimize our time and yeah we'll see what happens it'll probably be a long one but i think it'll be good so get ready get ready short intro i know short intro but it will be good all right but i am tapped out for today i'm gonna make sure that i have my food i'll probably like have a smoothie or something on deck tomorrow just to kind of add a little bit of sugar for me because i feel like what happens is my blood sugar levels just drop don't give me it's go it can, i can do short intros i can do short intros come on don't doubt me like that ew a taco bell smoothie ew <laughs> just mix it all up and see what happens voldemar thank goodness tomorrow is the last pon pon day you guys get one pon pon and that is the oh i gotta turn off that is the last day that you guys get pon pon for a while a long time tomorrow yeah all of it actually and naughty peach <laughs> naughty peach thank you for the 16 months of continuous support i'm not getting <laughs> i'm not kidding it's not going to be 30 to 45 minutes it's gonna be like a 15 minute intro and then we're getting started in the game i don't care what you guys say and anon thank you for the gifted sub to blind as well blind welcome back in all right i'm gonna get rest i'm gonna get ready i'm gonna prepare myself for the long stream that is tomorrow so i hope you guys do the same i hope i get to see you guys tomorrow for the finale and yeah yeah, I think it's going to be good. 50 minute intro. No, <laughs> guys, thank you so much for hanging around today. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your Saturday. Zook, if it's over 15 minutes, we get more pom-poms. 
if it is over 15 minutes before I open up the game, you guys can get two pawnpawns for the final day. Two pawnpawns. But if I start before 15, then no pawnpawns for the whole day. All right? Wait, maybe we should make it 20 minutes. Not including the song. Not including the song. Okay. It's the bingo card last day. Yeah, I'm going to jet off and go grab food guys but thank you so much and Havy, thank you for the 100 bits as well oh and i am going to put up the next final fantasy episode right now so i'm gonna go i love you guys so much i will see y'all tomorrow for the finale it all comes down to this i'm gonna be a whole mess of emotions tomorrow i already know it's gonna be a hard day uh we're gonna need some white claws for then dean i just feel it Rob, good night. Scalman, good night. Thundercrack, good night. Voldemort, good night. Yes, I'm gonna go dive into some food. There's a song. There's a song for what? Speedy, good night. Cornell, good night. Zook, good night. Lewis, good night. Zivic, good night. AJ, all my you folks, good night. It was great having you around. I don't have any earbud. I gotta go. AJ, Boobamon, Plutento, Shrujin, Lucky, or a Zivit. And just everybody, thank you guys for just being an absolute positive force of nature um, on this platform, on Discord, everywhere. Like, you guys see the messages all the time, but your positivity is truly infectious to everybody. And I just can't thank you guys enough for everything you guys bring to the community and have brought to my life as well. So thank you. Naughty, I felt like I kind of like glazed over that but thank you so much for the 16 months of continual support i don't want to check out the instagram i feel like it's gonna be a horrible picture i'm out <laughs> yanks thank you for the oh no 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 pompons nilman no mock good night no boundaries good night mr good night vanna good night old bones london mcbuzzin all right i'll see you guys tomorrow bye